All right. I think we're good to go. Let me just do a little bit of audio testing before we actually get into it. So we're going to go ahead and wait here for a second. Yeah, I'm just going to... Uh, I changed a few settings. So one, you probably don't hear any background music, like, you know, for Don't Starve right now. But, hold on. Okay, I think we're good. I think we're good. So, I've done a few different things. Hello, welcome to the stream. Today we're going to be fighting Hamlet bosses. But, right now, I'm going to test something. And I'm going to be relying on you guys to tell me if you like it or not. So, alright, let's just load into Hamlet now. So we've got a Hamlet world here. We're going to load into it. And we're going to get started. There is no music. And that is because when I edit the videos down, the background music gets in the way. So. So. Well, you can, you can hear the background sound. I have compiled a playlist. No. What, why are you saying no to me? That's so sad. So. We're going to we're going to see how this goes. I've got some background music to play while the stream is going on. Very quiet, not very noticeable, but it'll Oh my goodness, dude, not the sneezing. In fact, it's a little too loud right now. Why is she running? Oh, thank you. Stop with the sneezing. All right. Whew, here we go. We're gonna fight bosses today. That's what I want to do. Uh, dude, I hate that the allergies go into the next few days. I really should have gotten more teapods or nettles. Dude, I gotta, I gotta stop this. This is ridiculous. Hello, Robert. Welcome to the stream. I'm not monetized yet. That is true. That is factual information. I am not monetized yet. What is my favorite character? Um, I'm I'm very impartial to Wilson, just because you know he's the first character I've ever played as. But, dude, I'm. Ah, this is gonna make me go insane. We need to get some lotus root. Do I have any lotus root left? Or did I harvest them all? I may have harvested them all. I don't want to go on the the lake while I'm sneezing though. We gotta we gotta get some tea trees. Yeah, I. Oh, the sneezing is insane. Anyways, I... Okay, dude. I need tea trees right now. There's a tea tree. We're just gonna chop it down with the halberd. We're gonna get set up here for a, for a little bit. Dude, I'm just gonna eat this. Okay, we're done. No more. Get away. There we go. <laughs> that should be uh, slightly less annoying. Still certainly annoying, but Wormwood isn't the best. Yeah, uh, he's definitely very good. Especially in Hamlet, because you don't have to worry about this. This, uh, these sneezing. Right now it's temperate season. I've already survived a full year in Hamlet. But, as you know, temperate season does not mean the end of allergies. I'm still going to have allergies for the next, like, day or two. So, because of that, I'm going to simply do my best to get past this. I've never realized how loud the in-game sounds are.
Like, you can hear the birds and stuff in the background. It's kind of crazy. Okay, we're done. We're done. We're done. We're done. All right, let's head back to our house. I want to cook up these teapods. They'll be a little useful. Hey, hey, give me your money. Thank you. Give me back my hat. Hello, Slipstitch. Welcome to the to the stream. Why don't I use quality mod? Um, I'm on Xbox, actually. So I have no access to mods at all. It's the, uh, it's the sad life of playing this game on a console. I do have it on PC, but I find it's a lot easier to stream on console than it is on PC, believe it or not. I know that might sound surprising, but it does actually, it is actually easier to stream. All right, so here's what we're gonna do. We need to, we need to get ourselves like prepared and ready. I would like to, I would like to get, um, let's, let's see here. Allergies are definitely going to be the thing that limits us severely. We've got a lot of money. We've got a lot of money. Maybe we head over to Palace Island again and stock up on some stuff there. We could make a bit more money. There, there's a lot we could do. Our alchemy engine's way out here, though. We're not, we're not set up for a long-term world. That's for sure. Let's go ahead and make some shears. And then, let's see. Oh, do we need another football helmet? Maybe, but not right now. And then I kind of wanted to make a cork hat. Wherever that is. I think it's in light. Yeah. Cork candle hat. What boss will I fight? I want to fight them all. I want to fight them all. But we got to get past the sneezing part first, and I don't want to go insane because it's just annoying to watch insane gameplay. But we're probably going to go insane because I have not... I didn't think I was going to continue this world. I started this world as just kind of like background footage for my How to Survive Hamlet series. But now that I'm actually using this as a long-term world, it's uh, it's a little different. A little different, for sure. And unfortunately, I did not mean to eat that raw. That's so stupid. I do that every time. All in one stream? That's the goal. If you've been around the channel, you'll know that I do long streams. Normally, very long streams. All right, I want to cook this. Thank you. My goodness. There we go. All right. So now we've got now we've got a little bit of protection from the annoying what you call it allergies. So let's go ahead and um we got, Hey, that's a bandit. You know what? Maybe if this guard can take him out, that would be great for us. We don't want to get hit by him, though. We have a lot of money. Dude, this guard's going to mess him up. Let's go. Stash map. Beautiful. This is your first stream on the channel. Well, welcome. Hopefully you enjoy it. Let's read this. This could be good for us. This could be very good for us. Okay. We don't have a lot of gold, either. And I'm almost thinking it might be worth it to... We could head down to the ruins, but it's, I don't know. I don't know. I have no clue. We can go to the mineral exchange, but that's pretty expensive. Okay. Either way, we've got stuff to do. Our halberd's almost gone. Halberd's almost gone. We'll need to do a little preparation before we fight the Pugilisk or anything like that. 
I want to get a weevil mantle too. Just in case we... Yeah, we're sneezing again. Of course. Of course we're sneezing again. Why wouldn't we be? Why wouldn't we? Alright. Let's, let's sit in home for a second. So that we can... We have so many logs because I was collecting teapods. It's actually funny. Okay. Alright. Allergies are over. Finally. Allergies are fully over, but now we're insane. And we're lagging a little bit. Hey, can you pay me? I just picked up poop. Alright, I guess he's not gonna pay me. He doesn't care that I did the job for him. Okay. Let's try to get uninsane first. Let's get some money. Let's get some money. I think that would be a good way to go for now. So we have lots of money. Like a very decent amount. I'm thinking of buying some gold. Ah, oh, that's 10 oinks per gold. Yuck. That is disgusting. That is a lot of money. Alright. Alright, we gotta go not insane anymore. And I'm trying to think of the best way to do that right now. We've already drained this pond of all of its lotus flowers. We've got this pond up here, I guess. We could make a cork boat, if I remember how to do that. We are probably going to need more flint as well. Man, we are not... I did not prepare this world very well. Okay, let's go to the mineral exchange. Can I fight the termite boss? Yes, that's that's a plan. The uh, queen woman. I want to fight her. Especially because I want to unlock... I want to unlock the... Wilba. The the pig, pig character. Alright, we're going to buy this flint. Not a crazy good trade, but we're going to need it. We'll need to make a pickaxe and an axe. We can't make golden tools quite yet. But we're going to try. We're going to try. All right. Let's go ahead and tools. What am I doing? All right, we need a pickaxe. And we need an axe. Wonderful. So then let's go ahead and head up north here. All right. Here's the first plan. This nap mound. I want to go ahead and... Don't shoot me, please. Oh, uh, we're going to get shot. Yep, we got shot. Ow. Okay. It's okay. Actually, that means we can we can take this iron, though. That's not bad. And are you ready to shoot again? You are. Okay. We won't deal with that, then. You loved my How to Survive videos? Thank you. I put a lot of work into those, so I'm glad, I'm glad you enjoy them. All right. We need to deal with these gnats. Uh, or we don't. I mean, technically we don't. Technically we're fine. Let's get some cork. Yeah, I'm sorry for the insanity. I want to try to fix that as fast as possible. I know a lot of you guys don't like watching insanity gameplay. And trust me, I don't either. This is very nauseating. But... I'm doing the best I can here. We just got off of allergies, so. Here we go. Lots of flowers. This is actually great. No! Whoa! Why did he shoot? Actually. Since you wanna... Since you wanna shoot at me. My goodness. Alright. Too bad we didn't get that Thunderbird feather, but... Oh well. We are losing a lot of tuber trees, but luckily this is not a long-term world, so that's okay. That's totally fine. I'm not going to cry over the lost tuber trees. I want to fight the Iron Hulk as well, so we're going to need to find all of these pieces. And then we're going to need to get the 
the BFB to transport us over into the fourth island. So we can, well, we're gonna need to do a lot. We're gonna need to do a lot. I don't know if we'll get all of the bosses in this stream. If we don't, I'll have a part two eventually. But the goal is to get at least most of the bosses. Let's just use up the rest of this halberd. We'll get another one eventually. All right. The halberd's a great weapon. What do we need for the Prestahatitator here? That's another thing I'd like to know. Okay, Weevil. Oh, you're annoying. All right, nice. We can get a lot of sanity from these flowers. This is actually pretty great. Lots of Weevils, though. A hardened rubber bung. Doesn't that just make you feel joy? All right. I'm actually, I kind of want, no, we've got plenty of Weevil Carapaces back at home. I'm amazed at those that can do long runs. I'm still at the point of dying to dumb things like starving while fighting. Yeah, okay. It all comes down to pretty much, in my opinion, once you learn how to kite most of the enemies in this game, it gets a lot easier. Trust me, it it definitely changes the way you can play the game. Because I was I was exactly like that as well when I started playing this game, or like when Hamlet first came out, I couldn't make it to day like ten because I didn't understand any of it. But after learning how most and the wiki can the wiki can help a lot. You only play Wilson. No, I do not. I I play other characters. And I was thinking of playing another character for this run particularly, like Wolfgang or something like that. But I wanted to do this to kind of show off how to beat the bosses normally. And the only reason I play Wilson as my main character is because he's so normal. You know what I mean? He's so normal that it's easy to play as him. All right, let's leave our money here. We don't need to bring this everywhere we go. We'll just get robbed. All right, let's go ahead and, all right. We need to, uh, we, our alchemy engine's outside, dude. I've got to, we got to make another alchemy engine. I definitely rushed into making that. I should have bought the house before I put the alchemy engine down. That was totally on me. Or I should have put the alchemy engine down next to my house. That would have been, you know, like what smart people do? where they think before they do things. I'm not one of those. So, yeah. All right, let's see. We can make a cork candle hat. That's not a bad idea, but we do already have a miner's hat. Um, And then we also have the cork bull canoe. I wanna make that. That'll allow us to get lotus roots pretty easily. Is that? Oh, that's snakeskin. Cool. All right, we've got another knight here. What? That was freaky. A Thunderbird just shot for no reason. That was actually very freaky. Okay. Well, we saved up a lot of... We saved up a lot of tubers from the... From the last season, the Lush season, which I'm... I'm pretty happy about. We've got plenty of these. We can cook these up to keep us fed for the most part. For the most part, that is. And then I want to get... We need to get our supplies in order, that's for sure. We had a pickaxe in here the whole time and I didn't know. And it's 100%. Dude, I am awful at this game. I suck. Okay. Well... All right, it's daytime anyway. Let's let's get to work. We also have a shovel here. We can go, we can go dig up that bandit, that bandit thing. We'll leave the shears in town, right next to the other shears that I forgot I had. We'll leave those in town, simply because. You think Hamlet is the best DLC of all of Don't Starve? I, what is that guy doing? All right. Anyways, uh, there's a Thunderbird 
sliding around the world right now. Oh, there he goes. All right. Anyways, I do agree with you. Hamlet is definitely one of the best DLCs, and it's because it adds so much. Like, it's a totally different world. All right, this is a great way to get peacock feathers. Ooh, hello. You guys remember how I said I wanted to fight bosses? Oh my goodness, dude. Somebody's got to put that Thunderbird down. That guy's going to burn the whole force down. What is he doing in town? <laughs> All right. Well, so far, this is going great. So far, this is going great. He just got a good kit from that... From that, uh... That stash. Those stashes are overpowered. Now, the only problem is... If I put this armor on... And I put this hat on... I am much slower. So... We're gonna wear the football helmet for now. We'll save the tin armor for the boss fights. And we're just gonna go ahead and drop it all in here. Alright. This halberd we'll leave in here. We'll get it ready to go. Let's walk around with some money on us. Because I want to get robbed again. Actually, we'll go ahead and walk around with like just, just the lower value of our money. That way if we do get robbed, it's not devastating. We've also got some twigs. I am so sorry that I leave my house a mess. Can I... Oh, you can only put one item on the shelves? Who uses these then? That's silly. My house is a big mess, but you know what? That's okay. That's okay. Let's leave some tools here too. I kind of want to bring pickaxes, but other than that, we don't need much. And then the miner's hat, we can refuel on the way. All right. I think damage control is almost done. I totally ruined this world when I did my first run through it because I did not think that I was going to continue it. But turns out I was wrong. And I am going to continue it. So. We've got a lot of homeless Picos running around. All right. We could do some caving. Dude, this Thunderbird is going to be a problem. We've got our sanity back as well, which is amazing. We're just going to eat a few petals. Dude, this Thunderbird is going to get on my nerves. I want to go in there. I want to go in there. All right. We're, gonna, we're just going to walk in here. So we've got scorpions in here. I find the best way to deal with these guys is probably going to be... Well, okay, let's let's look at this. We can just we can just go around though. Never mind. Never mind. They blocked the doors off. All right, this guy's going to get mad at us. Here, let's let's do a little bit of a shenanigans here. All right. Let's try to set him on fire. There we go. We've got him on fire. All right. That'll keep him off of us for now. Let's go ahead and just drop a twig on there and get out of here. And it is dark. Of course it is. Why wouldn't it be? Hello, Klein. Welcome to the stream. Ooh, we've got lots of money in here. Okay. This is great, but not what we're looking for. All right. Well, we don't need to go into that ruin specifically. We need to go into the Mant Hill over here. That's where we can fight the Queen Woolmant. I think she spawns in any of them. I, I don't know 100% though. I didn't do much research. And I have never fought the Mant Queen before. I've only fought the Pugalisk and failed. So actually, you guys will be seeing me fight these bosses for the first time. Pretty much. Like, you're going to be watching me fight these guys for the first time. So hopefully that's fun. And hopefully we can do it before humid season gets here. It, we're probably not going to be able to. We don't have a lot of time. We only have 11 days. So, what I'm thinking, and we need the BFB to come for us to fight the Iron Hulk. We don't need the BFB, but we do need the BFB. <laughs> if you guys don't know what I'm talking about, I'm talking about the big bird. I don't know why it's abbreviated BFB. It can mean whatever you want it to mean, I guess. Um... <laughs> Yeah, we'll just leave it at that. All right, we have a canoe. Let's go ahead and get... I want to get... 
Um, press the hat tater. That's what we need. That is what we need. So it's a Hogus Corcusator. All right. That is the Presta Hattitator of this world. You know what? That is fine by me. We can we can deal with that. How do I get living logs though? We might need to go to Pig Pig Palace Island. Have I found the Apocalypse Calendar? I'm assuming that's what you mean by clock, right? If so, no, I have not. Not in this world. I know how to get to it though. So it's not like it's out of reach although i do want to reach the apocalypse because you know i i plan on doing a video on that eventually all right we're going to take a trip over to pig palace island because we've got to spend some money we've got to spend some money all right so far things are going pretty good though i gotta say all right, let's fill up our food and let's get to moving. Let's get to moving. So we'll head over to Pig Palace Island. We'll buy what we need from there. We've already got one gear, but that's back at home. We need more peacock feathers. So I want to get robbed again. As much as that sounds bad, I want to get robbed again so we can get another stash map we need a lot of peacock feathers to make a gas mask which we will need to fight the pugilisk because his area is located in the gas rainforest so we'll definitely have to do figure out how that works all right oh no no this is the pugilisk i i'm stupid the pugilisk isn't in the gas it's the pheromone stone that's in the gas, not the pugilist. Disregard that statement, guys. I am a, I am being silly. I am being absolutely silly. Also, getting hit by vines? Question mark. All right. Here we go. This is the palace one. That that pine cone was the pugilist. So technically, we could go to the pugilist whenever we want. Dude, this has got to be like the. We could get this jewel here to get the pig queen thing. Oh, there's gold here too. Ooh. Ooh, ball peen hammer right now would actually be a good idea. Let's go get that gold. Let's go get that gold. All right. Let's get a move on. We've got our shears. So if there's a lot of snakes here. It's good. Wow. I don't know why I haven't dealt with these guys yet. Oh, they're going to be spawn camping me. Oh, did we already get the gold? We already got the gold. All right, whatever. We can at least mine it. We can get some gold dust. Although, to me, that's not that worth it. All right, this was a dead end. I don't know why I went in here. We need to go... Where's the exit? There's the exit. We passed it. All right, we have to get past the spawn camping vipers. Here we go. And we're out of there. Our light's gonna go out. Oh, uh, that's the exit back to the... That's the exit back to... Our place. Uh, yeah, I know. I'm not the brightest a lot of the time. Alright. <laughs> Let's do this for real now. Let's go to the Pig Palace Island. It's this way. This way, then this way, then down. I swear, this is the most complicated ruins I have ever. Yeah, don't shoot me, please. I don't want to deal with that. Nope, I said don't shoot me. I stepped on a stone. All right, just to make sure we're going the right way. Yeah. All right. Let's not get poked, please. All right, we made it. We made it. We can go ahead and it is still nighttime, so I'm not gonna. Wow. Wait, I hear the. It's the. It's the BFB. Okay. Ah. Uh, I think that's the BFB, right? Oh, she landed in the. No. No. 
Did we just get scammed? She landed in the jungle. That is so stupid. Alright, well. When did I start the save? Uh, this is the one year. This is the one year of Hamlet save. So this was the one we did in the last stream. That was like, I think, a, a while ago. It was like... What was it? It was a long time ago. So this is the one year of Hamlet save. Alright. We need to look for some things we can buy that'll help us out. None of these will help us out. That's pretty bad. What about in the arcane shop? A uh, dark sword would be good, but that's a scam right there for 50 winks. I'd rather buy living logs. I'd rather buy living logs. Other than that, though, these are pretty bad trades. Do I play Rust? I do not. I haven't played Rust before. I have heard of it, though. So... It can be something that's on my radar if people want to watch that. I know it's a lot like Ark, and I did used to play Ark on this channel. In fact, I've wanted to bring Ark back to this channel at some point. Dude, there's lots of money here. Holy moly. We gotta make another Shears. Dude, we can get so much money here. Alright, we're slowly getting ourselves stabilized. And once we're stabilized, we'll be good to fight bosses. Oh, wow. We're already full. Um, please don't forget to remind me to grab my axe. If I have space. Hello, welcome to the stream. It's been a while. And by a while, I mean, what? Last Saturday? You like Ark? I, I I assumed you liked Ark, because isn't that a uh, snow owl as your profile picture? I'm pretty sure that's a snow owl, right? And I was thinking of bringing that back to the channel. Alright, let's get some money. Believe it or not, I actually want to get robbed. Because... We need peacock feathers. Otherwise, I'm not going to be able to get to the Apocalypse calendar. And that will be a problem. For sure. Alright, we have so much money. Do they have a bank here so I can swap these out for the higher value ones? Because if we get hit by one of those one of those uh, thief pigs right now, it's going to be everywhere it's gonna be awful all right i guess we can head to the is there anything else we can buy here that will help us out if i could buy moggles that would be great i would like moggles but i don't see moggles here a tama shanter is not bad everything else here is pretty bad though like really bad So, I don't know. We might just stick to our... What we have. Um, I don't think we need gears for sprinklers. Is it that a boat? What? Hey, there's a... Ooh! Oh, I almost got hit by that guy. Okay, let's bring him to a guard. Maybe we can get a guard to kill him. I do not trust myself fighting this guy. Dude, where are the guards? There's one. Hey, guard, you want to deal with this guy? Hey, you guys want to... Are you serious, guard? Are you corrupt or something? Come on. <laughs> Dude, this is like a cartoon. <laughs> there we go. Now we're getting somewhere. All right. Uh, this guy's going to run, and then he's going to... Hold on. I don't want to get hit by this guy. We'll lose everything. Yeah, he's gone. Okay, it was it was worth a shot. It was worth a shot, but we knew it would never happen. We've got the Tinker's Tower. This place is pretty useless, though. 
But you can buy the Moggle's Blueprint. But other than that, these are all pretty bad. Way too high cost. Okay. Okay. We've got a plan here. We don't have a lot of temperate season. So we need to plan. All right. Let's go ahead and we can go to the Pugilisk. I'm getting cooked. Whoa. I'm getting cooked. What am I getting cooked by? This beetle just got cooked. Alright. Can I get some light bulbs, please? That would be great. I would like some light bulbs. Otherwise, we're going to have to rely on torches. Which, it's looking like we're going to have to rely on torches. I should have made the cork hat. I knew it, but I didn't... Oh, hey. We've got some gears here. That's not bad. That's good to keep in mind, for sure. We've also got the mandrakes over here, too. But, to my knowledge, they're not very useful. To my knowledge. Alright, we're just going to have to rely on the torch to get back home. Not a bad thing. But we will need shears because we need to get through that thing. Let's just eat these. We'll make some more shears. I'm not afraid of using iron. Arc is good, but rust. Rust. All right. Yeah, I, I, I've, I haven't played rust before. Mandrakes give living logs. I did not know that. That is... That is a really good thing to remember. We can always just make ham bats, too. Like, I don't need dark swords to fight. In fact, a ham bat's probably going to be the better of the options. Is it that obvious? Okay. Mandrakes give living wood. Yeah, okay, that's great. Thank you. I did not actually know that. I normally don't mess with them because they're they're just annoying. They're just annoying. Alright. Let's go ahead and throw on this. We've got... Oh. Um... Wait, is this going to be a problem? Is this going to be a problem? This Iron Hulk piece is off the map. Um, okay. Okay. Well, that's not pleasant. I'm hoping that still allows us to fight the iron hold I really hope it does because that would be unpleasant if we were not able to fight the iron hulk because of that that would just be not cool dude World War jungle over here. We can hammer those pig things down, too. For some... Relatively easy pig skin. Are mandrakes renewable in Hamlet? I believe so. What is this guy doing out here? What is happening? What is all this fire and destruction? Hey, I'll take the no pig skin question mark. Fine, whatever. 
fine, I guess. I'm pretty sure they're renewable because they have houses that they spawn from. So, hey, we're getting a we're getting a bad attack. That's cool. We're getting a bad attack. That's very cool. All right, let's put our money away then. We don't need anything necessarily yet. That is yet. I could go buy some berry bushes just to just to allow. Oh, here we go. Here's some combat. All right. Nope. I want the pig skin before they get eaten. There we go. This pig skin is very useful. Awesome. We got a lot of pig skin there. Maybe I can use gunpowder. I could. Yeah, that I, I want to make some gunpowder. But we have rotten eggs, I believe, back at home. Which is nice. Which is yeah, we have rotten eggs. A rotten egg, I guess I should say. So not rotten eggs plural, but it still works. Alright, we've got a good stash going on here. Now it's just going to be purchasing stuff, I guess. But let's head to the let's head over to the um the bank. Let's let's stroll our way over to the bank. Mandrakes keep respawning from their homes. Yeah, that's what I assumed. I'd assumed it was like, you know, pig huts or stuff from Reign of Giants. Let's head over to the bank. Let's buy some 10-piece oinks. Yeah, you're gonna stay there, buddy. I've gotta I've gotta buy some of these. Just so we can condense our inventory down a little bit. We could afford a you know what? Let's just buy one. Just for the status. We have a centipiece oink. Guys, we're so cool. We have a centipiece point. Alright. I do want to buy some... Oh, she got rid of them. She had berry bushes. She had berry bushes. But... Oh, well. Alright. Any of these... All of these don't look great. I mean... Dragon fruit seed, maybe. Gunpowder for the Iron Hulk. I... I was thinking of that, but I also kind of want to fight the Iron Hulk without gunpowder. Although, for the... I don't know. That would be kind of... Because I wanted to use Cocoa Nades for the Pugilisk. Because that's the way I know how to fight him. You don't need Cocoa Nades, though. It's just a really easy way to fight the Pugilisk. Alright. I'm thinking of buying the dragon fruit seeds. Maybe we'll get a farm set up, get some dragon fruits. Yeah. If, if we can get a... No, that's a garland. Um, okay. We'll get, we'll get these dragon fruit seeds. Dragon pies would be kind of nice. We need more gold, though. We do need more gold if we want to do that. So, at this point, I don't think there's... I mean, we can go sieving for gold over here. But other than that, we're just going to buy some gold. Although you need a lot of gold for a birdcage. Gunpowder for the... No, for the piece that is stuck. Oh, that's... That's true, because it'll activate it, won't it? The goal was to teleport them to the fourth island whenever BFB decides to come back. But, uh, you know, we just had a BFB encounter and it did not end well because BFB did not spawn, so. All right, all right. Let's go ahead and make a cork hat if we can, and a weevil carapace, or a weevil mantle, that's what it's called. Because if humid season hits, I want to be able to, I want to be able to make a, I want to be able to wear armor while fighting, you know what I mean? So, that's what we're going to do. 
Let's go ahead and cook some of these tubers. I'll lose the iron. Yeah, but the iron's not what I'm going for. I'm going for fighting the Iron Hulk, so. I would like to fight the Iron Hulk if possible. I'm hoping that I'm able to get him out of that situation. Okay. If we can get a dragon fruit farm set up, that'd be great for health. But I'm beginning to realize that that might not be essential. Like, we might be fine without dragon fruit farm. We'll keep it just in case. Is there anything else we're going to need? We're going to need a source of ham to make ham bats. Because that's my weapon of choice. And then we'll need a gas mask. So there's, there's definitely a bit of stuff we're going to need. I don't even have a smelter. Yeah, I don't. I don't. I normally don't mess with the smelter that much. I know it's useful because alloys can be used to make, like, sprinklers and whatnot. And, yeah, we probably should get prepared. This is probably going to go on into humid season. My axe, I left it in the town. Yeah. Yeah, I did. I did. I totally did. Yeah, because maybe we should make sprinklers. For nettles. Uh, yeah. Yeah, okay. Let's let's make a smelter then. We need a red gem. We need a red gem. An oscillating fan would be cool too. I am I am far behind, guys. I'm far behind. I am very far behind. Alright. Weevil mantle just needs chitin. We can we can get chitin. Oh now you want to drop light bulbs. Fine. Whatever. I needed those a little bit earlier. There was chitin over here. We can get... What is that guy doing over here? Weird. Alright, where's the chitin? I remember seeing plenty of chitin up here. Dude, there was chitin all over the place up here. Now there's none. Don't you just love how life works? There was chitin everywhere. Also, I plan to have the How to Survive Dry Season video out tomorrow at 3 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. So hopefully you guys like that. And then the edited down 100 days of... There's some chitin. 100 days of summer. I want to have that out by... Um, what, what was it? Next Friday. So not this Friday, but next Friday. You can make infinite lantern with the alloy. Really? Alright, let's get the weevil mantle. We can use this as a replacement for um, humid season. It'll work in place of all the other stuff. Infinite Lantern with the alloy. Really? Ooh, I, I definitely want a cowl. Those are really cool. Alright. Um. I also kind of want to make a boomerang. There's a lot we gotta make. If we can make a boomerang, we can have infinite iron. Because of the Thunderbirds, we can easily get iron from them. Or we can, you know, mine the Iron Hulks and then just run away. I didn't start trying to play in solo until I found your channel, and it's so much easier than on Don't Starve Together. Too much content there for a beginner. That is awesome. I really like... Don't starve alone. I guess that's the the thing people call it now. I think it's personally, I think it's better than Don't Starve Together. And I know that's a hot take because Don't Starve Together gets a ton of updates all the time. But I like Don't Starve Alone. I think it's fun. It's it's got a nice vibe to it. Plus, there's no latency. 
So, like, I can walk around like this. No latency at all. Don't Starve Together has a lot of latency, I've noticed. You can make Street Light with 0% Lantern and after break it, and you will have one 100% Lantern. Cool. I did not know that. I did not know that. All right, let's get to work. How can we get a red gem? How can we get a red gem? I'm not well versed in the gem logic. We can go to BFB Island to get a red gem. I know that. But other than that, is there a way we can get a red gem without BFB? Because uh, otherwise we're just on a waiting game. There's got to be a way. If we can get a ham bat, we could probably fight the Mant Queen. If we can get a ham bat. I think. We can also go search the other islands, like the Pugilisk Island, we can search it for now. Okay. Let's get some silk. Let's get some silk. Lot to do. Very little time. Well, not very little time. This stream can go on for a while, but... Ooh, my voice is getting a little rough. All right, come here, guys. Let's do this. All right, is it one or is it two? That's one. Unless they're roaring, then it's one as well. Okay. Really? Excuse me? Okay. I didn't think he could hit me from... I... Uh, we can... This doesn't provide a lot of armor, but it provides more than just... This way we're not just... I don't want to get a hit. There we go. <laughs> no silk? Question mark? Ah, whatever. Well, we don't want to take them all out, because they reproduce like beefaloes. You believe there's an island with tall birds for meat? That is... That is, um... The BFB island. It has a chance to have... Rocks in bat caves sometimes drop gems. Hmm. Okay. We could go down there then. We can go down there. I, uh... Why, why didn't I just make another football helmet? I easily could have. Whatever. I'm silly. Alright. We could go down into the bat cave. We have one... Let me get a drink real quick. You saw a silk? We can also chop down the cocoon cocooned trees. Where'd you see a silk? Ah, there's one. Okay, so he did drop one. Or maybe it was already there. I don't know. Either way. Alright, maybe we can... Oh, dude, these guys are all over the place here. I don't know if we'll be able to chop down that cocoon tree. I mean, if we can... Wow, there's a lot kind of overpopulated a little bit. So, believe it or not, these spider monkeys, they actually reproduce like beefalo. I did not know this, but I figured it out on accident because I was doing some testing. Because, as you guys know, I have the PC version of Don't Starve. I just don't play it for recording because, well... It's a lot easier to record from my Xbox because I don't have a dual monitor set up yet. But I was doing some testing, and they actually will not respawn if all of them are killed off. You need to leave at least one. So, yeah. There's some cool knowledge. Where's the bat cave? And do we have our pickaxe? We do. Wonderful. I know we've got a bat cave on this island. Or do we? Yeah, right down here. Okay, we're just going in the wrong way. Here, let's grab some grass. We're actually getting a little low. Alright, guys. I'm really hoping we can fight bosses in this one. We're at least fighting a boss. If I... 
If it means we have to go underprepared and I lose this world, so be it. But we're fighting a boss. We're fighting a boss by the end of this for sure, at least. I mean, regardless, we're going to have to fight the Ancient Herald if the Apocalypse comes, which it's it's on its way. We've got, what, 20 days left? We've got 20 days left. So... You don't think you'll stay as long in the stream because you have something to do tomorrow? That is okay. I'm glad you could at least catch it. And I hope whatever you have going on tomorrow goes well. Let's take this, though. Hey. Okay. That was very cool. Oh, my inventory. We don't need beard hair. What, are you think I'm gonna respawn? What kind of person respawns? Where are you guys coming from? Weird. Must have been a, uh... Must have been a bad attack that I did not recognize immediately. Alright, here we go. Let's do this. Wonderful. Alright, let's see if we can get a gem. It's probably not very common, but... Ooh, gold, though. That's actually pretty great. That is wonderful, actually. We might need to... Can we start an earthquake? I've got a trip to in Paris with my class. Wow. That sounds fun. That sounds very fun. Well, hopefully you enjoy it. Hopefully it is enjoyable. Alright, let's... Oh, here we go. Let's go ahead and make a torch here real quick. I know we probably should have made the cork hat, but... Oh, oh, oh! A red gem! No way! There is absolutely no way we got that. Just like that. A red gem. That is insane. Alright, I guess we'll make the smelter then. Wow. I... What, what odds are that? Like, that we just get a red gem. You don't live in America, it's not very special. I guess that's fair. Look at that pog attacking those. Ooh, iron. I kind of want all that. Alright, you know what? Fine. We do need the stones, though. Let's take this rock. Worth it. Alright, let's get this iron. Oop. I do not want to get gnats on us. Alright. Here's another battlefield biome. I think all of the Iron Hulk pieces will spawn on the same island, if I'm correct. They all spawn on this starting island. But we want to move them over to the BFB island. Island. Excuse me. Alright. Things are looking a lot better now. We got a red gem. We can make a smelter. We can get alloys. We can get alloys. And that alone is already pretty good. So we're gonna we're gonna be pretty pretty well off right now. Oh, I was wondering why there are so many twigs here. It's because of the uh, hanging vines that want to fight me. All right. Well, we're getting there. We're getting there. Oh, pig pig village is this way. Alright, I know this is kind of causing me to go insane, but I want to get there faster. Alright. Let's let's go ahead and start. We need what? What do we need for a smelter again? Uh, let's, let's go look at it real quick. I hate this alchemy engine being all the way out here. 
Smelter. We need four boards and six cut stone. We can make that. We've got lots of boards. We've got lots of boards. We can get a smelter going. Get some alloys. It's about 5% to get a gem from those rocks. Look at me go, man. And out of all of that, we got a red gem, too. I'd say that's pretty snazzy. That's pretty nice. Alright. Alright, let's eat some fried tubers. And we'll eat some raw ones to heal up. There we go. Wonderful. Alright. Let's go ahead and we'll leave living logs here. We'll leave... We want to keep the gold on us. We want to keep the gold on us. Let's go ahead and make some cut stone. Do we know how to make that? Yes, we need six of this. Alright, we've got six of that. Let's leave this here and this here as well. And then let's grab our surplus of logs. These things we have a ton of because of lush season. So, using these logs, we should be able to make four boards. And now, we can head over to the alchemy engine and make a smelter. So that'll help out a bit. That'll help out a bit. Um, where is it? There it is. We really gotta build an alchemy engine over near our house. It's just gold is so hard to get. So, but I really messed up with this placement. Alright, we've got a smelter. Um, other than that, I think we're good for now. The smelter will allow us to make some pretty snazzy stuff. So, yeah. I think that's pretty good. Why don't I buy a second room? I could. I could do that. I could certainly do that, actually. That does cost 50 oinks, though, doesn't it? Or 60, because you have to buy the door and the expansion permit. So that is quite a lot. Alright, we'll put the smelter down, like, right here. I think that's pretty good. And then... How did how does this work again? Do you need to do four? Yeah. You need to do four iron ore and then you just smelt it up. Okay. Cool. So that's how you make alloy. No, those are my seeds. We don't have enough alloy to make anything useful quite yet. We'll need to go get more iron. And break the alchemy engine. See, I could do that, but I mean, we technically could build it, build it much closer. The only problem is we'll only get one electrical doodad back, if I'm correct. Which means we'd be wasted. We'd be out one gold, which isn't terrible. But is it worth the convenience of bringing it closer to home? Is the question. You think you'll go now? Bye. All right. Glad you could catch the stream. And hopefully I will see you in future streams. It was nice for you to catch the stream. Alright. What do we need for a boomerang? If I can make a boomerang, then all of our troubles are solved. One silk, one charcoal, one board. Alright. That can be done. That should allow us to get plenty of well, that depends. How much damage does a boomerang do? But that should allow me to get some iron pretty easily. And some meat, believe it or not. I may have uh, been a little too speedy by saying that we would get a boss fight in this stream, though. I'm beginning to worry beginning to worry. There's no way I don't have any charcoal here. Are you serious? Okay, whatever. There's some burnt trees on the way back. I haven't picked up any charcoal. That's nuts. Alright. Let's grab this. 
Why is everybody freaking out? Bad attack? What? Who? Why are you calling? Or is it a? Is it a thief? Wait, why are they running around? Guys, I'm so confused. All right. What? What is all this running around and freaking out? I don't understand. All right, so now what we could do is we could head up here. Why is that Thunderbird just sliding, dude? I hate that. All right, we can head up here, and now I should be able to safely dispatch these guys. Yes. He won't fight back. So it takes two boomerangs to take out one Thunderbird without getting shot with lightning. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. Is it resource effective? Probably not. I probably could just tank the lightning. But this is a pretty great way to get some meat and iron. It's not the best way. We could go mine the iron hulk pieces to get some better iron. Realistically, but... Which we might do, honestly. Alright, so this allows us to get... What, five Thunderbird kills? Chopping those trees count as stealing? Oh! Oh, whoops. Well. That's great. <laughs> I'm the thief. Oh, no. Are they all mad at me, then? Looks like they're chill about it. Oh, well. Looks like they're pretty chill for now. This guy's not, though. He's stuck. All right. So we can make another alloy, which is not a bad idea. All right. We've also got thunder feathers. Not exactly sure what I can do with those. I think you can make a thunder hat, which is like, I don't know why you would make that instead of like just bring an umbrella over or something. It's cool if you need a, you know, whatever. All right, what was I planning on making? I wanted to see how much halberds cost, even though I don't need any. Hey, buddy, you want to stand near me for a second? For just a second? Yeah, I want a ham bat. Alright, how can I get... How can I get big ham? Except for, you know... The obvious... Being very mean to the pigs. How can I get big ham? The tall birds... Those are on the tall bird island. Um... Big ham. How can we get? How can we get? Or big meat, whatever you want to call it. It looks like a, like a ham. So, how can I get a big meat? Don't take that out of context, though. Please. How can I get a big? meat no clue all right let's cook up and eat the rest of these blo blooming tubers all right oh that was a wasted tuber my bad. My bad. Alright. Well, unfortunately for the... For the pig citizens, I'm going to have to steal another tree. Because apparently that's stealing. 
even though the trees are burnt and definitely lower property value. So, like, I don't know why they're complaining. Alright. Where are these burnt trees that everybody hates to see me cut down? Why are these not stacked? There we go. Alright, get very upset with me again. Look at that. They don't care. They don't care. Try killing hippos? That is true. That could be a good way to get some. My only concern is hippos have a strange fighting pattern that I have no idea how to deal with. Alright. So, what I want to do is I want to make some gunpowder. There we go. And then I want to make... Let's see. So, we could make halberds. Technically, this might be decent compared to that to the hand bat. Although, the only problem is durability. That's like the big issue here. And then we could make the mant stuff too. Okay. Okay, guys. We 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 got plans. We got plans here. We got plans. All right. So, it, I'm just trying to do, like, everything at once, so that's why it's all going so weirdly. But look, we're, we're making some progress. We're making some progress. Alright, so we've got the gunpowder we'll need for the Apocalypse calendar. That's if we can get the peacock feathers to even, you know... do anything about it. Alright, let's just drop most of this stuff back here. Um, Alright, let's organize our inventory a little bit. Oh, I had I had another rotten egg. I could have made I could have made more. Whoops. Whoopsie doodles. Um, Alright. We can leave the cork here. We don't... Actually, I'll make the cork hat. That's somewhat useful a decent use of my powers. Alright. Yeah, this is very enjoyable, I bet. Watching me run from my house over to the alchemy engine, then back to my house. I'm sure this is a very engaging and fun stream. I apologize for that. I want to give you guys what you came here for, which is fighting bosses, but... Unfortunately, I am... Alright. We need a axe. And I'm thinking an opulent axe is not worth it in Hamlet. It's just not worth the cost. So, we're not gonna make an opulent axe. We're just gonna make a normal axe. But it's okay. It's okay. Because flint is far more renewable than gold is on Hamlet, at least. Alright, let's gather this cork up. Could have brought the shovel to get some extra cork from the... Dude, what is going on over here? Bugs are fighting bugs. How funny is that? Alright, that should be enough cork to keep it fueled and everything. We'll get we'll get a little bit more, because we want to keep it fueled. Alright, do we have any more? There's more up here. Let's just let's just get a little bit more. We want to make sure we always have it fueled, so. Oh, I'm sorry, dung beetle. Oh, he gets back on his thing? I didn't know they got back on it. That's cool. I actually did not know that. I've never seen them get back on it, because normally I just instantly harvest it, so... I've never had the pleasure of seeing it. Alright. Let's head back to the alchemy engine over here.
And then we need to go get get some chitin. Should we do the... What should we do first? The queen woman or the pugilisk? I'm thinking the queen woman. I've never fought the queen woman before. So it should be very entertaining watching me most likely suffer violently. I have fought the Pugilisk before, and it did not go well. I did not know the head did, like, a whopping 100 damage, so it ended in what you would expect, tragedy. Alright, let's gather this Chitin up. The Chitin comes from the Warrior, or, or the Mance. It's not Warrior Mance, they're just Mance right now, but... Here we go. Um, how difficult is it to fight a mant? Do they kite? Okay, they try to kite, but they're not very good at it. I've never fought one of these guys before, but it looks like it's pretty easy to deal with them. Looks like it's pretty easy to deal with them. Although I wish we had more chitin. Just lying around, but... I guess not, huh? We could just go in, like, guns blazing. Oh, here we go. Here's some chitin. Oh, lots of chitin. Hold on. This might be the way to go. Just walk through the forest, gather a bunch of chitin. Perhaps. That rainforest tree still has its burr. That's weird. Do they not lose their burrs? All right, that must mean there's there's another mant hill up here. We can ooh nectar, yummy. Don't mind if I do. Oh dude, there's so much chitin near this guy, but okay. Oh, it's a full moon. Don't do it. Don't do it. Dude, he's chill. He's so chill. <laughs> he's so chill. Love that guy. I was gonna fight him, but I guess not. He's so chill. Here's, here's a drone. Um, These guys aren't hard to fight, though. I don't think we need to make disguises, honestly. I think we might be fine to just go in, you know, crazy like that. Bad attack? Yeah, bad attack. You can't see their silhouette, though. Um, we don't need any more pigskin. That's the gas rainforest. We don't want to go in there. Not right now, that is. There we go. Alright, we gotta... I, that's another thing I really hate about console, is it does not let you... Here we go. Take them to the edge and we'll be good to go, because they get stuck. Super easy to handle them on the edge. This nectar's spoiled. Not great. Yeah, dude. The vampire bat attacks has to be, like, the weakest version of hound attacks ever. Like, they're so easy to deal with. Sure, they're more rapid, but like, come on. It's so easy to deal with them. Alright, let's give this a test run. Let's see what we're dealing with inside of here. Yeah, we're dealing with a lot. Okay. Alright. So before we do this, before we do this, we're going to go Queen Woman first because I've never encountered the Queen Woman. So this should be very fun. This should be very fun. Um maybe we'll just go Halberd. We'll go Halberd for it. Is what I'm thinking. We don't have healing items. We could buy some from the Mud Spa. Which is not a terrible idea. I think they're relatively good prices. 
let's see yeah five oinks or four oinks not bad prices at all for healing items in my opinion i mean we're rich so like we're we're the richest people in swinesbury so like we have disposable income i wish that was me in real life but unfortunately it's not <laughs> Okay, so, let's see, what are we, and are we like an hour in, what are we, uh, yeah, we're like an hour and 30 minutes in, finally, an hour and 30 minutes in, and we're about to fight a boss, I'm hoping, <laughs> I'm hoping, I'm hoping we're about to fight a boss, alright, so first we're gonna need some logs, and we're gonna need this rope, and then we have kite, and we'll, alright, I think that's everything we need should we bring the tin armor in maybe should we also make a lantern absolutely a lantern would very much help down there but to make a lantern we're gonna have to go on a glow fly killing spree and that's that's gonna be rough I don't think there's any other way to get light bulbs, if I'm correct. I mean, there's tons of glow flies here. Like, come on. One of them. There we go. We're getting light bulbs now. Hold on. Let's see if we can get... How many light bulbs do you need for a lantern? Their drop rate is just so low. Dude, this is like an infinite spawner. Look at how many... There we go. We're getting some light bulbs now. This is nuts. Look at how many are just popping out of this flower. We're gonna get Krampus. This is actually a way to Krampus farm. No way. This is actually a viable Krampus farming method. Holy moly. Let's see, are we actually gonna get a Krampus? No way we don't get a Krampus, right? Oh, what? There he is. There's the big man. There's the big man. Oh, the halberd does do less damage than... You know how mad I would have been if he dropped a Krampus sack? Do you know how mad I would have been? <laughs> Not very mad, but mad enough. That's for sure. Anyways, let's get, let's get to work. Let's get to work. All right. So we need we need Oh, we can make a bird whistle. I totally forgot about that. We could make a bird whistle. Two light bulbs to craft the lantern. Yeah, that's what Okay, nice. So we'll have extra light bulbs too. All right. Now we've got a lantern that will help immensely when it comes to fighting down in the mant area, for sure. Oh, hopefully the game doesn't crash. That would be stupid. All right, we can make the mant mask. Just one second. I wanna, I wanna fully look this up to make sure making the mant armor is worth it. Uh, enjoy the background music while I do this. Let's see. So the Mant Mask is... I believe it's just a way to... Yeah, yeah. Yeah, okay. Yeah, we're gonna want to make Mant Armor and whatnot. I think that's a great idea. Alright, let's not wear it though. It's going to decompose on our head. Alright. And then we're gonna need a log suit. We're gonna need a log suit, which means we'll have to drop this ax for now. And then I think you need rope for a log suit. Let me just make sure. Log suit, yes, you need rope. Rope and logs, it's in the name. 
And then we can make a mant suit. That's like perfect. All right, we have mant armor now. We can just walk right to the queen at this point, I'm pretty sure. And then what's funny too is the mant mask also acts like armor, which is nice. It's not great armor, I don't believe, but it is armor. Nevertheless, we could also make another football helmet. And then I'm thinking of bringing the tin suit down with us to also... Dude, this is just infinite glow flies. Is it humid season tomorrow? Like, there's no way it's not... Well, no, because then they'd be in a cocoon. So it's not humid season tomorrow. Alright, I also want to try fighting a hippo. I've never fought them before because they're just so intimidating, but... How bad could it be? All right, we got two on us. That's not great, but. Okay, they get bored very easily. Can we separate him from his little friend here? Is the question. Okay, they do do the jump attack. No. Oh, it's that stupid thing that eats all the lotus. Oh, that was insanely easy. I actually don't want to kill this one. No, don't eat my meat. Don't, don't, don't do it. Don't do it. I need those. Oh, this hippo is going to get eaten. He must have been damaged. He had to have been damaged from all this fighting. Because, like, that was way too easy for a halberd. And I know the halberd's a decent weapon, but it's not the best. So there's no way he wasn't damaged. All right, let's take this antler too. We can maybe make it bird whistle, which would be pretty nice. All right, I kind of want to see if this guy fails. Oh, he's got a friend coming to help him out. Oh man. Oh, this guy didn't make him mad. Oh well, whatever. That was a fun little battle. We got our meat, though. Now we can make a ham bat if we want to. Which I'm thinking of making a ham bat before we fight the... Before we fight the... Wow, dude. This is insane. The amount of glow flies and whatnot. Alright, so yeah. We have enough to make the ham bat now. Alright, guys. I think it's time. I think it's time. We're going to figure this out. We are all... Well, maybe it's just me. Because I'm sure at least one of you guys in chat have probably fought the Queen Mant before. Or at least I'm hoping. I have not fought the Queen Mant before. Ever. Ever. In all of my Don't Starve career. Never fought the Queen Mant. So, this should be fun. This should be very fun. We're going to want to take some food down with us. Um, we have the lantern, so we don't need the cork ha hat, technically, realistically. We also don't need the logs. The alloy, we don't need, I don't think. I'm thinking of taking the full, like, tin set, though. It's gonna make us slow, but it's gonna protect us a lot. So, I think that's worth it. I think it's worth it to bring the tin set. And then maybe a backup football helmet, but, uh, is it... Is it fun though? We wanna we wanna have fun, right? Okay. Okay. Let's go to make some meatballs. In fact, we could make some resource efficient meatballs doing this. And no, I will not be doing a no meatballs challenge, guys. Absolutely not. Never will I be doing that. I would never do that. Absolutely worst idea ever. All right, well, hippopotamus antler has been obtained. All right, looks like we'll be able to make one more meatballs after this. Should we buy some healing items too? Probably. Probably. If I had to guess, that would be the smart move. I know, okay, just because I haven't fought the queen mant before, does not mean I don't know, like, kind of the basics that have to go with the Queen Mant. 
I know that the Queen Mant doesn't attack you, and I know that she spawns minions in. So, that I know. However, I still don't know the proper, like, attacking technique. So, this should be very fun. This should be absolutely fun. Also, how are you guys feeling about, like, the... Because as you guys know, I turned the game music off. The reason I did this was because when I go back and I edit it, like, in my... You know, to make it into a video. The background music, like, the in-game music gets in the way. So I've added just kind of, like, a, a very low-volume background music that's just playing through the stream. Please let me know what you guys think about that. Because... You know, I want to make sure the stream is enjoyable for everybody. I like it, but, you know, that's me. Plus, it gets rid of the, uh, you know, those awkward moments when I'm not talking and it's just silent. At least now you got some, uh, some background music to jam to. At least I hope. I hope you're jamming to it and not hating it violently let's take our 100 piece oink we don't need all of these resources with us either you like it that's good that's what i like to hear let's actually leave a lot of this stuff at home we don't need a lot of this stuff we will need some ropes though i might might take shears we'll go get some grass on our way there oh that made turkey dinner no wonder that took so long whatever we'll eat it that's a pretty good all right, it's not humid season yet, but it is raining. And we have our fancy helmet and our tin suit. We've got our mant armor. We've got our football helmet, and we're about to have a ham bat. Is there anything else I need? I don't think so. I am going to go to the spa and buy some healing items. That I know I'm going to do. And I'm going to buy a good bit because we're going to do a lot of fighting. So. Although. You don't really hear it unless you're concentrating on it. That's good. I wanted it to be like that because, you know, it's background music. It's not meant to be the the focal point. Hold on. I'm having, I'm having a brain idea, guys. Like, my brain is having an idea. Worst case scenario, if this battle goes on into humid season, I'm not that afraid of that. I'm not actually that afraid of that. Let's go to the grocery store. What are they selling here? Okay. Okay. If if I'm correct, if I'm correct, pomegranates are actually a really good healing item. And we wouldn't be stuck in the animation of healing. Because that's the big killer is getting stuck in the healing animation. So, we buy pomegranate for one oil. Oh, they sell meat here too. You know what, why not? We can make another ham bat. Okay. I wanna say cooked pomegranate's pretty good for healing. Plus, who knows, we might, we might be fine, guys. We might be fine. Should I still go buy some healing items? Probably, I'm still gonna do it. I'm still going to do it, because we'll probably have some times where we can get... Hey, get away from me. Although I do want you to... F hmm. I want him to... We don't have a torch in our inventory, though. We can't set him on a fire. Here, just... Uh, guard? Question mark? That's what I thought. Okay, he's going to run away now. Uh, let's buy the honey poultices. Buy a few more. That should be good. Yeah. That should be good. We'll leave it in this slot here so we can heal nice and fast. Alright. Are you guys ready? It's time to finally, after almost two hours, do what I promised we were going to do. And that is fight a boss. As long as we fight one boss during this stream... I won't feel like I clickbaited you guys. 
I hate doing clickbait, so I will I will be very happy if we can if we can manage this. If we can manage this, I will be a super happy person. All right, let's leave the gears here. Um, I think we just need to cook these. Yeah, we just need to cook these pomegranates and we'll be good to go. Okay, those should be pretty good at healing us, so. All right. It is time. It is time. Well, almost. We are going to take one small pit stop, but it's on the way there, so it's not really a small pit stop. We're just going to grab some more grass, because we're going to need more grass. But I'm sure that's okay. Oh, oh, almost totally forgot to make the ham bat, though. That would have been so embarrassing. We get over to the man the man uh hill and we just don't have a ham bat and life is bad and we stink and stuff all right we'll grab some grass on the way if i can pick it up that is all right it is raining pretty bad but you know what that's fine we're fine Mortal Kombat soundtrack should be ready for the upcoming fight. You, you know what? I could I could load up some like I don't have the Mortal Kombat soundtrack. I do not have that. And I'm not sure if I mean I probably could play it because video game music is really r weird when it comes to YouTube copyright. Oh, it's, it's human season tomorrow. Okay, that makes sense. Alright. Alright. One second. I have to read chat. I click to watch your content. It doesn't bother me if you don't end up doing, the, doing what the title says. Dude, you are so real for that. You're an amazing person. so real all right either way let's let's finally do what the video said i was going to do oh you know what huge problem here we can't bring our backpack with us which is actually not a huge problem we can just do a little bit of swapping out here weevil mantle i kind of want to keep that on us just in case Okay, you know what? This is not bad. I want to leave some open inventory spots, though. Ah, uh, but I'm going to want... Uh, ooh, we don't need twigs. And we don't need this ham. Um, we'll be wearing that, so that's not a big deal. Okay. We'll also be wearing the man suit, so it's not that big of a deal either. Alright. Let's make some rope. Let's make like two pieces of rope and then uh, guys guys okay guys all right please i know i know there's latency let's check the latency let, let's let's check it real, real quick hold on let me go over to the youtube real quick all right we're on normal latency so it's gonna take a while for your chat to get through to me but Please, remind me to pick up this grass. That is all. Alright. Let me go ahead and hit record. So that we're getting the content that I need for my future videos. And let's suit up, guys. Let's suit up. Alright. We've got everything we need. I believe so. We've got the hand bat. We've got healing items. We look like a mant. That is what I forgot to do. I forgot to go on Do Not Disturb. Let me make sure I can do that real quick. I knew I forgot something. I, Dude, I, I hate the Xbox notification system. Because it jump scares me every time. 
Every time. Like, that jump scared me. I actually got scared. I actually got scared. Alright. Guys, it is time. Alright, we are one with the mance. Alright. Un Whoa, what, what are these things? Holy moly, I've never seen these things. Ow. Okay. I'm I'm messing around. I should stop messing around. Let's go find the queen. I've I've never been down here. Can I open these? Oh, honey? Ooh. Hello. I've never been down here. Is this place actually like worth it to go to? Like at all? I've just never been down here. Did I bring my light bulbs? Good, I did. Whew, I thought I didn't bring those. Oh, I just realized the, the armor makes a cricket noise when you when you walk around. That's kind of fun. Pick up that grass. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> that actually having that on my chat log. Uh, is going to help. Alright, it's going to be humid season when we get out of here, by the way. So. Dude, nine honey, though? We could make, like, taffy. Or stuff like that. The queen spawns in every single... In every single mant hill, right? Like... I'm not just... I don't have a chance to not find her in this mant hill. Right? Hi, friend. We're friends. Right? Like, she spawns in every single one. You don't know you haven't been to Hamlet or Shipwreck yet? Very reassuring. <laughs> oh, boy. Oh, it's another honey chest. Yes, please. Okay, yeah. The way to come down here, though, is to get this mant armor, because uh, we would have had to fight a lot of mants, and it would have been annoying. So this is definitely way to go. Too bad we can't understand them. I think, it doesn't the pheromone stone allow you to understand them? Or something like that? Though Those are mant warriors. Is it? I think that's the queen. I'm pretty sure that's the queen. Also, warriors... Can see through our disguise. Alright. Oh, that's perfect. The music got a little more intense, too. Let's do this. I'm pretty sure that's the queen. I don't know what the warriors are doing, but... This is it. This has got to be it. Alright. We're at the point where it's just warriors. Yeah, this has got to be the queen's lair. Luckily, the warriors seem to want to go to the center of the room and not go anywhere else. So, like, I'm okay with that. Yeah, they're like, they're they're being we very weird. That guy almost, whoo, it's the big mama. All right. It's actually light in here, though. We didn't need the lantern. Funny enough. Okay. Guys. We have everything we need. We're going to eat some meatballs. And we're going to put on our tin suit and armor. Okay. Man, I'm nervous. I've never fought this thing before. I'm actually nervous for this. All right. Let's see how this goes. All right, she's shooting eggs. She's she's shooting eggs. All right, we're taking lots of hits here. Holy moly, we're taking hits. All right. She is wow, dude. We're taking hits. Holy crap. Okay. I think we need to leave one of these warriors alive to 
allow us. We're also super slow because of this armor. It might be worth it to take the armor off and put on like the mant suit or something. And just wear the hat because we are so slow, like unbelievably slow. So we're just taking hits. All right. She shot another egg. Oh, it's because the, the warrior died. All right, we gotta, we gotta go. All right, the warriors are mad. Who's back here? Who's hitting us? Wait, what's hitting? Oh, it's the avalanche. Duh. A doy. It's the avalanche, dummy. Okay. How much health does this thing... Oh, we're... No, we're gonna get envenomated. I forgot she did this. She's screaming. Oh, we should have brought earmuffs. I totally forgot about this attack. And by forgot, I mean I never even knew about it because, you know, I've never fought her. I only looked at the wiki. That's all I did. Okay, dude, can you guys fight each other now, please? That would be cool. I would love if you guys could stop. Wait, here we go. Here we go. They're stuck. Oh, wait. Guys. This is the way to go. Look at this. They're stuck. Okay. That's fine. That's fine. She can do this all she wants. We're fine. Wait, we're not even using the ham bat. What are we doing? <laughs> oh, dude. Victory. Victory right here. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Yes! One boss down. One boss down. This hat is insane, guys. This tin hat is actually insane. All right, this warrior's mad at us. I want to get that crown. Dude, I'm just running around like a crazy person right now. Okay. Let's throw back on this mant mask real quick. Dude, what a victory. What a victory. Actually, let's let's take care of this guy. This guy's going to get annoying. There we go. All right, that's the bundling wrap blueprint. That's like, all right, let's see if this heals us. Yeah, that heals us pretty well. I got to say so myself. Um Okay. Cool. So Hmm. I actually can't pick up the crown. You got to be kidding me. I can't pick up the royal crown. I How can I get the crown? Actually. Wait a minute. Like there's there's actually no way I can get the crown right now. I do know you can mine her throne if I'm correct. So we should be able to come back down and mine her throne. Yeah, it got stuck. I wish we brought our twigs down now. Great. Great, great, great. Okay. Well, luckily we have our mant suit, which is not going to expire yet. Let's... Okay, let's, let's head back out. Let's head back out. Out. For real? Oh, no. Stay away from me, guys. I don't want no problems with you. In fact, it might be worth it not to wear this because it's actually going bad. I want to keep it for... Okay. Yeah, we need twigs. We need twigs. Right, 
right, let's try to not anger these guys. And we angered them. Of course we did. Why wouldn't we? All right. We're out of there. We're out of there. But we're not out of the woods yet. We've still got to... Oh, yeah. Let's... Hold on. Let's put this back on before we make everybody mad again. All right. There we go. Beautiful. All right. Let's go get a pickaxe. And then we should be able to get the crown. We should be able to. Now, at this point... At this point in time... I can proudly say that I did not lie to you guys. We fought a boss. Did we win? Yes. So I gotta say. Things are going pretty good. Although now we gotta get out of here. It's getting late. It'll be dark soon. Who cares, dude? Who cares? Um, it is gonna be humid season when we get outside, though. May or may not be foggy. So, okay. When you guys go to fight the queen... The queen, uh... Mant, whatever she is. The queen Womant. Please make sure to bring a pickaxe. Pickax. A pi what, did I, what did I just say before that? Dude. I'm just speaking nonsense. Did we take the... We took the wrong way. Wait. What? Guys, how do we get home? What? Uh Dude, I'm confused. How how do we get home? Okay, it's got to be this way, right? That was an epic battle. Yes, it was. It was. But there's plenty more to come. Especially the Iron Hulk. That battle is... I most likely will fall in that battle. My goal, too, is to not make any resurrection items. I want to try to see if I can take out every boss for the first time. Ah, giant grub. Go away. Alright, it is humid season. Alright, we're out now. We're good. So, what I'm discovering is this tin suit is absolutely awful it makes you so slow so slow with the tin suit as you guys saw i couldn't do a thing i couldn't do a thing i was just stuck there all right don't puppy guard my backpack please all right let's make a pickaxe real quick and then we'll head back in to mine the Queen's Throne. I'm pretty sure you can do that. I'm pretty sure that's something you can do. I'm hoping that's something you can do. <laughs> Let's keep this tin hat on us. We'll put this on. Uh, we should be good to go down. Yeah, like this. Our, our body's gonna give out soon, though. So, like, we do... Oh, there's another passageway here. Why did... Oh, wait, no. That goes to nowhere. This is weird. Wait, the, the entrances are changing. They change. Oh, that's so weird. I actually did not know that. That is cool, but also kind of weird. All right, can we make it there and back before our butt gives out? Let's find out. Um... All right. We've got a pickaxe on us. It should only take one pickaxe, I hope. I hope. We don't need to wear the the chess piece while we're in the Queen's Throne area because the warriors aren't fooled by our disguise anyway, so it's not that big of a deal if we wear it or not. All right, we're almost there. Let's go ahead and swap this out. We didn't lose a single percentage. So, let's throw on the Weevil Mantle. Yes, you're very ma- ah! Okay. Um, hold on. Get away from me, you freaky little demons. 
Let me go into your queen's habitat, dude. Ah. Uh, dude. Annoying much, maybe? Oh, they kind of glow. Oh, I didn't realize there was light in here. I didn't realize they kind of glow. Ow. Why do you keep hitting? They're damaging my armor when they do that. Yeah. Alright. I think you can mine this. Right? I'm not... Okay, yeah, you can. Whew. There we go. You even get some gems for it. That's awesome. Okay. All right. Guys, we now have the crown. This is great. Okay. Um, but first, I'm going to leave these down here. Blue gems are awesome cuz sprinklers. We kind of do want those. I'm not going to lie. I'm not going to lie to you guys. We do kind of want those. Um, do we really need the tin suit? It's it's so bad. It's like painfully bad. We don't need the tin suit. We don't need it. We just don't. The honey, however, is kind of cool. I'll take the honey. Okay. Oh, and this flint. All of this flint. Oh, why? I mean, okay, look. We don't need the light bulb, but we'll just... What did I just do? Let's just throw it in there. Let's take this flint. I want this flint. Is there anything else in our inventory that's giving out, though? I don't know. Alright. Yeah, I kind of want the flint. We don't have a lot of flint back at home. So, getting flint is good for business. Okay. Now we just got to survive the way out. We've got the royal crown. But I do suggest you guys, if you come down here to fight these guys, definitely go ahead and bring with you a... Bring with you a pickaxe. I hate that they damage my armor when they do that. Holy moly. Can we get out of here? Alright. We're good to go. We're, we're, we're in the clear. We're in the clear. We survived and... Surprisingly... Didn't have too much trouble. Who's next? Pugilisk? We've only got three left. We've only got three left. Um, how do we get home from here? I hate this, these change. That's so weird. Alright. Um, we're gonna have to go this way. Dude. That's strange. Oh, what? This is an exit? Where? Oh, that's cool. So they're all connected. I did not know that. That's cool. That's actually really cool. Okay. Um, it's probably going to be easier for us to traverse the above ground back to our house. We'll wear the weevil mantle. We'll just drop the man suit for now. All right, those are going to hatch. We're going to get some humid season issues happening soon. Um, let's go this way. With the blue gems, though, we can make sprinklers, which is nice and not that bad of an idea. All right, guys. Oh, oh, it's, it's, a uh, BFB. Okay. We can get taken to the island now. Um, I think we're okay. I think we're we're ready to go there. I think we're I think we're okay to go there. I think we're okay to go there. Go there. Okay. 
Yeah, we've got we've got what we need. All right, come take me. Take me to your magical island. Let's go. Beautiful. We can get Robin. Um, uh, we don't have a lot of inventory room, though. We can eat these meatballs. It wouldn't be too much of a waste. Alright. Let's get these gems. I'm pretty sure these have a chance to drop gems. Yeah, look at that. More blue gems. A purple gem. Another blue gem. Oh, dude. Sprinklers are going to be amazing. All right. So this is the Pinnacle Island, I believe it's called. This is Pinnacle Island. And here we are going to fight the Iron Hulk. Or at least hopefully fight the Iron Hulk. That's if we don't fail to any of the bosses before that. Hey, this is a cool set piece. Um, we do need gold, I'm not gonna lie. You know what I did forget to grab, though? My grass. Yeah. I did, I did do that. But, uh, we're fine. We're fine. We'll go back and get it later. I'm about to eat this morsel raw, though. Because I'm crazy like that. Plus, we can just wear this crown to gain our sanity back. That's a little, that's a little tip for you guys. Uh, this crown is amazing for sanity so i would suggest if you already have wilba unlocked don't sell this crown to the pig queen if you don't have wilba unlocked then that's another story but it's all good all right we got the royal scepter too we're getting all the items that's pretty cool all right i think it's time to go home now though can we mine these, or do these need a hammer? Those need a hammer. Alright. Let's get out of here. This should take us to a cave cleft. If I'm correct. So we just need to... We just get to explore a little bit. Um, yeah. Wow, dude, look at all these ferns. Alright, this is the wrong way. Alright. Alright. Getting late. Here we go. This is the way out. Hello? Okay. A spooky hole. Smells like a million giant bats. How spooky could that be? Surprisingly, it's not that rainy. This took us to Pig Palace Island. Wow. Okay. That's cool, but also annoying because now we have to make our way back. I don't think there's anything we need over here. So let's just go ahead and immediately make our way back to our homeland. Uh, we don't want to get hit by things because we're not wearing any armor right now. Although we could go trade in this, this crown so we can unlock Wilbo real quick. I would like to unlock her because... I think the only two characters I don't have are Wilba and Wes. And I eventually want to do a adventure mode live stream as well. Hopefully you guys will be interested in that. Um, where's the palace? There's the palace. Let's just let's just unlock Wilba real quick. Oh, it's not Oh, it just it counteracts the nighttime sanity. I forgot about that. It's not incredibly useful. Like, it's not Tam O'Shanter useful. But it is still useful. So I suggest, if you don't, if you already have Wilba, don't trade in the crown. But me, 
I don't have Wilbur yet, so here's the crown. So that should unlock Wilba, I believe. Right? I hope it does. I thought it did. Here's your staff. Alright. Uh, we could buy cool things. Like, this This right here is probably the best item in the game. This thing right here, the key to the city. This has got to be one of the best items in the entire game. And we can also buy this, just for fun. We're not going to buy the silly string. This is... The silly string is what you need to... Actually... Go to Reign of Giants and... Shipwrecked. But we don't need to do that. So, not that big of a deal. I thought Wilbur was supposed to do some, like, fancy animation. When she, uh, when she got unlocked. Hold on. Let me... Uh... Wilbur... Wilbo will be unlocked as a... Oh, she has a room? Where? Oh, this way. Let's go check. Is this Wilbo's room? Oh, hey, we can... We can, uh... We can trade these in to pig citizens. Over on... Oh, I didn't know that was an exit. Weird. Where's Wilbo's room? I actually don't know where... She just sleeps on the floor? What a crazy person. Is this Wilba's room? Should she be in here? I have no clue. But let's take some of these. Do these stack? These do. Let's just... Uh, let's take some of these. These give you items from pigs over in Swinesbury. So I'm okay with stealing a few of these. Not that it's really stealing, because she's not even caring. Let's go ahead and... You'll have to play Adventure Mode or on other DLC to unlock more characters, because last time you died in Reign of Giants, it said you were at max. That's weird. I, I thought you could unlock the other characters from Reign of Giants. I'm, I might be wrong, but I thought you could. I thought you could. Do I even want Robin? Like, I don't even think I want Robin. I don't even think I want Robin. Or should we just get Robin? Because, you know, it, it's Robin. <laughs> like, I, I just don't care for Robin that much. It's just a worse version of Chester. You know, we don't need the Halberd. We, we've got, uh, weaponry planned. Alright. Let's head out into the night. Uh, oh, we, uh, we could have just worn a, ha I, I'm so stupid. Let's go grab our halberd. I'm not about to leave our halberd there just because we weren't wearing a headpiece. I'm still curious where Wilba went. Actually, you know what? Let's let's check real quick. Let's check real quick. Let's see if I've unlocked Wilba. Some characters require specific actions. Yeah, like Wilba. Alright, let's see if we've unlocked her. Yeah, we did. There she is. Alright, so I've unlocked Wilba now. Now it's just Wes that I don't have. So we'll do a we'll do an adventure mode live stream eventually. Let's get back into the game. We'll do an adventure mode live stream at some point. I think that'll be fun. The only problem with unlocking Wes is it's RNG dependent. It's RNG dependent. So yeah. It's it it sucks. It's awful. I hate RNG-dependent things. 
All right, let's head back home and grab our grass that we left. Because I remembered this time. We are going a little insane, but... What is that noise? That's because you didn't activate the other DLCs. Okay, that makes sense. That makes a lot of sense, actually. What is that dung beetle doing without its dung? Gross little guy. I'm going to get trapped in that room one of these days. Uh, speaking of trapped, I don't actually have iron on me. I'm going to need to make a machete. Aw, oh, dude. I didn't want to waste more. Ugh. Alright, fine. I guess the halberd is getting left behind. Because we got to make a machete to actually get home. I mean, I guess I could just chop these and then leave the machete, but... Oop. I almost got my shelf, my, uh, myself shot. That would have been embarrassing. Will you do a cook all the recipes from Reign of Giants plus all DLCs in some in one stream? You know what? That is a genius challenge. That is actually genius. Okay, let me let me hold on. I'm going to screenshot your comment because I'm actually very tempted to do that. And I will make sure that people know it was your idea. Because that is a genius challenge. Because you're right, it, it, it seems easy, but it's definitely not. Because there are some recipes that are just straight up hard to make. And some that are like you, it requires you to go to the other worlds. So it's almost going to be like a speed running to other worlds. That is so genius. Thank you. Thank you for that. Wonderful. Yeah, that does sound fun. I'll definitely have to do that. That's a good idea. I'm still waiting on, because, you know, I'm, I, I'm still editing and getting the 100 Days of Summer video plan to come out but but once that comes out and i see how it does because the the 100 days of winter video i mean it did well but um I, youtube just didn't push it like a lot of people clicked on it a lot of people watched it all the way through it's just youtube didn't push it for some reason and i'm not sure why it's very upsetting but oh well you win some you lose some right you win some, you lose some. Alright, we're back home now. We have successfully taken down one boss. One boss. Now let's leave Robin here, because Robin is kind of useless. We have the executive hammer and the key to, key to the city. So let me show you guys what the key to the city does. Look at this. You can craft everything everything you can even craft another slanty shanty like look at this if i took this key over to shipwrecked i could make a slanty shanty in shipwrecked or the same thing with reign of giants it's that crazy like you it's so amazing i really suggest anybody who wants to enable hamlet come over here and get the key to the city because Oh my goodness, is it amazing. Is it amazing? The answer to that is yes, it is amazing. An astounding yes. Alright. Well, we still have our fancy helmet. This thing actually is kind of a beast. I know we were wearing armor, so that's probably why it has such a high durability still. But it is a ridiculously high durability. I mean, look at that. That's kind of insane. Okay. 
let's go ahead and make one hundred days of winter stream is when you join my channel. That's nice to hear. Uh, don't worry about it too much. It's definitely disappointing when YouTube doesn't, you know, work the way I want it to, but that's just the way it goes. Almost all of the views from that video were from search, which is so weird. It just means YouTube didn't push it out at all. Basically, everybody who watched that video looked it up, which is, it's cool, because, like, that means 200 people looked it up, but... It's also not good because, you know, I'm not getting any push, but look, I'm not going to lose sleep over it. It was a fun project to make, so that's what that's what really matters. All right, so let me show you guys what these do. So let's look at this. I can I can give that and they give you things. So like kebabs. Look at that. Free food for just giving them artifacts or things like this. Isn't that cool? It's so cool. All right, let's take our pith hat. We're going to finally need this thing again. Uh, we left our grass over in the... Yeah, we left our grass over in the jungle. Of course we did. Why wouldn't we? Why wouldn't we? Okay, so on the list, we need to fight the Pugilisk, which will be a, a little harder when it comes to humid season. We might do that in lush season. We might spend humid season gearing up for lush season. We need more peacock feathers, and we need... Yeah, we need a lot of stuff, guys. We need a lot of stuff. We need a lot of stuff. All right. Okay. So... I think it's foggy outside. It is. It is foggy. Unfortunately. Alright, let's wear this so we don't get mugged or something. We only have seven coins on us, so I really wouldn't mind getting mugged. Because if we get mugged, then we can... We can actually get another map, which is kind of what we need right now. Yeah, I don't like fighting any of the outside bosses without, you know, visibility. I need to be able to see. So let's see, how much do we need to make the sprinkler? I think it's in survival, maybe? Or is it food? I feel like it's something they'd put in food. Yeah, it is. So we need ice, which we can buy, and two alloys. We could totally make the sprinkler. Now, you found my channel through through the subreddit. That is cool. That is cool. I haven't promoted on there in a while. I probably should start again. They, that community is really awesome. It's actually really awesome. All right, I'm just going to make sure. Um, if I'm correct, I think the sprinkler needs to be near water. Yeah, it needs to be near water. So, we'll need to actually put our nettles down. Which, we could use the sprinkler right there, actually. Like, that wouldn't be a bad idea. W yeah, I think that's what we're going to do. And then we'll get nettles. Oh, yeah, dude. This is amazing. We're going to get lots of nettles. We're going to get... Okay. Okay. We've got the money to buy the ice, too, that we need. So... Not bad, I gotta say. We're doing pretty good. One boss down, and we're not even... Well, we're getting close to the apocalypse. That's what I'm worried about, but... Hey, you know... We have to fight the Ancient Herald, too, technically, so... That's just another thing we'll have to fight eventually. When we get the chance, that is. Alright. Let's drop this machete, too. And then let's keep the log suit up near the front. Yeah, we'll keep, like, our armors up here. My inventory is going to be messier than it ever has been. Um, look. 
just the way it has to be, unfortunately. All right, let's head to the grocery store. I just got struck by lightning. All right, let's get some ice. We need six ice, and I think it costs one oink each, so it's like... This is a super good way to get ice, by the way. Like, meatballs? Easy. All right. That should be enough ice. That actually is more than enough ice. You know, let's get enough to make some meatballs. Oh, she closed the store. Me close this shop. Dude, I'm going to steal this ice if you don't give it to me. Willingly. I'm just that easy. Whoa! Uh, serves her right. She wouldn't give me ice. <laughs> Dude, that, that is a tragic fate of events. Ah, uh, there he is. Of course, it's when I have all of my money on me. You couldn't attack me when I didn't have my money on me? Like, come on. Okay. Um, well, actually, this is good. This is, this is good. We can take him to a pig guard. And the pig guard should set him on fire. And that'll make him easier to... There we go. All right. All right, hold on. There we go. There we go. We got to keep him mad at us, but we don't want him to hit us. Oh, no. We're losing him. We're losing him. No. Oh, we lost him. Oh, well, whatever. Whatever. Fine. Tragic, but... Nah, we're all good. All right, so we'll have to bring the sprinkler over. Then we can get infinite nettles, which is going to let us do whatever we want during lush season. Which is actually wonderful. It's actually pretty wonderful. All right. Oh, these nettles are in full bloom, too. Woohoo! All right, we've got some issues over here. Right. Oh no, this takes two hits per beetle. That's not what I like to see. Hold on. Let's just... Here. Ooh, you want to get mad at that guy so bad. You want to get mad at that guy so bad. You want to get mad at that guy so bad. Ooh. There we go. We're all good now. We're in the clear. I'm surprised they don't just drop light bulbs in that form. Any bosses killed yet? Yes, we got the Queen Woman down. So the Queen Woman's down. Next is the... I want to say... Pugilisk. I want to say Pugilisk is next. Also, welcome back to the stream. I remember you from one of our first streams. Dolphy. So, welcome back. Hopefully you enjoy boss fighting. Oh, come on. I hate these guys. Alright. Um, the only issue is these nettles are not in a sprinkler... Wait. Oh, you can't build it? Here? Really? Why? You can't build it on this turf? Oh my goodness, dude. These, these beetles are annoying. Can you not build a sprinkler on jungle turf? No, you can. I saw that. How close does it need to be? My goodness. Maybe it's just because there's uh, the leaves get in the way. That would make sense. That would make unfortunate amount of sense. Yeah, I mean, we technically could put it over here, but right there might be the way to go. Although, there's still a lot of blocked. You know what? It might be worth it just to put it on the edge here. Kind of like right here. Because there's still a lot of room for them to grow. 
Let's just drop it down right here. Wow, that lagged the game so badly. Alright. Let's also go ahead and make another shovel. And then let's move the ones that are not in the radius into the radius. Now, we have infinite nettles. Which is not bad. Should be able to condense these guys all in. I'm hoping. I'm hoping. I think that's within the range. Let's see. Alright, they should open up. Okay, nice. Yeah, look at that. All of them are in range. That's beautiful. So now we have infinite nettles. Those will just keep regrowing. Amazing. Amazing. So, now we need to go get our grass back, which is okay. Yeah, right now we're just preparing. I want to wait until lush season to actually fight any more bosses because humid season freaks me out if we're going to fight any outdoor bosses. We did fight Queen Womant during humid season, but again, that was an interior battle. So I kind of want to wait for Lush Season to actually fight the Pugilisk and whatnot. I think that would be a smart move. We also need to get a gas mask, though, so we can get to the Apocalypse calendar. Alright, let's get a little bit more grass. We left some grass over in the jungle. I know that, but not too big of a deal. I'm also thinking of, um, okay, let's head back this way. How long does it normally take for nettles to bloom? I think it, it it's a while. I think it's one full sprinkler. Oh, there's more nettles here. Look at this. All right, let's see if we can increase our... We're getting wet from there, but I can't. Uh, you get so wet within the sprinkler. All right, maybe, maybe. Yeah, look at that go. Awesome. Awesome. All right. Well, that's great. We now have our lush season figured out. We're not going to have any allergy problems, hopefully. We can just live off of... Uh, Nettle rolls, which is amazing. We've got a little bit of ice as well. I don't know why the worker pigs sleep outside. It's weird to me. They don't have homes or something. Alright, we're going a little insane. But... Alright, let's buy some more ice real quick so we can make some meatballs back at home. We should have the stuff to make meatballs. We'll drop the majority of our money back here as well. Alright. Yes, we do have the stuff to make meatballs. We also have the stuff for honey ham and whatnot. So, that's definitely a good idea. This ham bat is almost as good as a spear. So, it, aka, it's not that good. We're going to leave the blue gems here too. We need more peacock feathers. I'm just going to call them peacock feathers because that phrasing is not very easy to say without sounding like something else. I think that makes honey ham, if I'm correct. If I'm correct. I may very well be incorrect. Let's just go ahead and leave this outside. There we go. No big deal. Oh, uh, Robin's cold. Oh, how sad. Too bad I don't care. Robin's just worse Chester. Right. I'm probably going to make another ham bat and then head to... We need to do some battling. Uh, 
Ah. The dilemma. Oh, yeah, it makes honey nugget. Nuggets. Okay. All right. All those oinks and you can't hire a maid to clean your house. <laughs> Dude, I live like this. <laughs> no big deal. No big deal at all. We have uh, almost spoiled meat. Um, oh, you probably need two big... Yeah, I need two big meats for honey ham. Okay, so what's the move while we're waiting for lush season? We could get more nettles, but realistically, that should be all the nettles we need. We should probably go get some lotuses. Because right now, we're just waiting. We could also get some stocking sticks. Get ready for battle. Let's go ahead and... Hey, you know what? Let's do it. Let's fight. Oh, dude, I hate these guys. You hit them once and they leave. So annoying. I wanted to fight. I wanted to fight. Oh, now we can't see anything. All right. Whatever. All right. Let's go ahead and head off into the darkness and spookiness. It's 1.5 units of meat. So technically one big meat. Um, and then a morsel would work. That's not bad. Alright, our nettles are not quite there yet, but they're they're getting there. Alright, I want to get some of these lotus flowers. Dude, I don't know what was going on there, but that freaked me out. There's hippos, too. Oh, it's the porcupine thing. That's right. That gives us another big meat, too, which is not bad. And we get the quills, which are somewhat useful, if I remember correctly. They're somewhat useful. Okay. I don't want to deal with the poison frog, though. Dude, you can't see anything. Oh, uh, did the... I think a stupid porcupine... Ate all of these already. That's so annoying. I hate that they just eat them all. So quickly, too. So quickly. Okay. I mean, we can head over to the other... It's not worth it during humid season, though, because it's just... I can't see anything, so I can't see the porcupine. Which makes it very hard to, like, prepare for him. Here we go. Okay. Now we can see. And being able to see means I can see the stupid porcupines. So let's hop out. Let's grab our canoe. Let's head over here. I don't know what's going on over here, but it's not my business. None of my business. Oh, crap. Okay, our canoe just took damage because of that. Oh, I forgot the frogs can swim. There we go. No more swimming for you, buddy. Oh, no, you don't. Oh, no, you don't. Oh, he made me drop my meat. I was wondering where my other meat went. <laughs> All right. Beautiful. That should allow us to get most of these lotus plants, which means sanity won't be too much of an issue. These things give, give you a large amount of sanity. So that's nice. I don't think the hippos are territorial. I don't think they are. But we're going to be a little careful, just in case. Pretty sure this boat could be one hit by the hippo. He's looking pretty mad, but... 
Oh, dude, all of the grass here got uprooted because of that. Hey, how's it going? Where do you think you're going? Look at him running away. He's going to find some more lotuses to eat. What an annoying little guy. All right. Um, let's throw on the football helmet. I also would like to... Let's see here. Did one of the stalking plants get destroyed over here? I don't think so. Um, we can head down here. I want to get another stalking stick ready to go. Get it made up. Or at least in preparation to make up. Yeah, it looks like this guy's still kicking. Alright. Alright, he just leveled up. That's... Oh, great. He's, like, crazy leveled up now. That's annoying. Is it still four for these guys? I think it's still four. Alright, beautiful. Oh, come on. Weevils? Nope, it's one for those guys. I, I can't forget that. I keep forgetting that. It's so annoying. Oh, beautiful. <laughs> he was in a lot of battles, so it makes sense that he uh, he went down pretty pretty fast. I want the stock, though. There we go. We don't need the Weevil Carapace. Alright, that looks pretty good. Looks like I grabbed most of what I need. And, oh, our sprinkler ran out of fuel. I forgot, you kind of need to baby this thing. That's kind of annoying. You know what? It's no big deal. It's no big deal. It is absolutely not a big deal. Though, what is a big deal is we need to get a gas mask, like, right now. <laughs> or we're in trouble. Hold on. Is there any other way to survive the poison rainforest? Because I actually don't, I actually don't know. Um, I'm, yeah. Well, the particulate purifier, yeah, that works too. But we don't have access to that. We need the gas mask then. Which, where is it? Where is the gas mask? There it is. Oh, we just need one more peacock feather. That's all we need, and then a cloth, which we can head over to the Pig Palace Island to get, or the grocery store. Actually, it probably is going to be the grocery store. Let's see if they sell cloth right now. We can buy some cloth. Not a bad idea right now. We're also going a little insane. Don't worry, we'll be fine. We'll be fine. We've got lotus roots, so we'll be good to go. Alright, let me go see if we can buy some cloth before the shop closes. Any cloth? No. Of course. Why would he be useful? Why would he be useful? Alright. I'm going to be right back, guys. I have to uh, use the restroom, unfortunately. So, we will be on pause for just like uh, a few, maybe like a, at most a minute. So, I'll be back.
All right. Welcome back, me, to the stream. Whew. All right. I should have just called this surviving a second year of Hamlet at this point. I thought I was just going to be able to speed run the bosses and it would be like, you know, so so easy, like we wouldn't have anything to worry about, but no. Nope. Nope. Of course not. Dude, really? That is actually so annoying. Hold on. Just stay away for a second. I just need this fire for a little longer. Alright, you know what? Fine. Have it. Alright, let's go no longer insane. Beautiful. Welcome back to sanity, guys. It is absolutely beautiful here. Alright, we've got quills and whatnot. We could make the bird horn, but we already went to BFB Island. It's all the way over here. Pinnacle Island. Which we'll need that for the Iron Hulk. What we're also going to need for the Iron Hulk is the telelocator platform and whatnot. So, that'll be fun. And for that, we need, like, feathers and stuff. Ugh, it's gonna be so gross. Alright. What did I need to grab? We need one more peacock feather. And then I kind of want to head to head to the shop. I want to head to the shop real quick. To our stocking sticks gonna give out. Good thing we got another one on the way. Alright. I really, really want to need a piece of cloth. So, let's see what we can buy here. We can buy a razor, why not? And of course, this guy's going to... Hello? Dude, wonderful. Alright, really? Can you just give me a cloth? That's what I need. Alright, let's buy an axe, I guess. Oh, we have to leave and go back in every time. Alright, we'll buy a pickaxe, I guess. Hey, we can use tools anyway. Dude. Uh, we'll buy a shovel. Dude. We'll buy a pickaxe. The general store is the one that sells cloth, right? Okay. Okay. I'm beginning to worry that they don't sell cloth here. There's no other way to get cloth, though. I'm pretty sure the general store sells cloth. Alright, we're going to keep going. We have plenty of money. And we can make more money easily. Dude. Alright, one more time. Great. How wonderful. Hey, it's a robber pig. Um, I wouldn't mind a battle if we can win. I would not mind a battle. Nice, we did it. We even got the hat, which is cool. But I, I think the hat just lets you steal from the external villages. But you know what that means, guys? We now can make a gas mask if we get cloth. Now we just need cloth. Of course, cloth is going to be the bottleneck here. But this is actually kind of epic. Okay, let's read this real quick. Uh... Oh, it's on Pig Palace Island? Yuck. Hold on. Let's see, where can we get... How can we get cloth in Hamlet? Is there... No other way than just... Um... trawling but we can't even make a trawl net because we need the blueprint uh so yeah we're just gonna have to we're just gonna have to gamble at the general store that is so annoying 
That is so annoying. I'm just going to buy backpacks at this point. Here, let's just buy both of these backpacks. All we need is one cloth. Just one cloth, dude. One cloth. A cloth. Dude. We're going to lose all of our money to this guy. Okay. I think I'm being scammed here. Like, actually. We have so many axes, though, now, guys. Like, that's... Wow, that's so helpful. Our nettles are probably bloomed. Let's go over there. Alright. Alright. Enough of this... Enough of these shenanigans. Let's head over to our nettles to see if they're bloomed. I'm also going to get rid of some of these picos. Man, they make a freaky noise when they die. I don't like that. The rain stopped. Hopefully the nettles are bloomed. They are not. Unfortunate indeed, but... Yeah, you thought you'd get away with those seeds? Nuh-uh. Nuh-uh. We could refuel it with vines. That's probably not a bad trade-off. Dude, I don't want the weevil carapace. I want the vines. Thank you very much. There we go. Uh, we'll, we'll use the sprinklers when we want to baby it. Oh, vampire bats. How wonderful. Um, uh, it's not that big of a deal. I'm not afraid of vampire bats that much. In fact, it could be free pigskin. But... Here they come. You guys gonna fight me or what? Yeah. All right, we're, we're just straight up wasting the durability of our football helmet at this point. That is a terrible way to fight the bats, by the way. Don't do what I do. I am just a silly goober. I think I went the wrong way. Yeah, I definitely went the wrong way. I also did not bring shears. And you want to know why I didn't bring shears? Because I'm so smart. I'm so smart. I'm not silly at all. Not at all. Oh. <laughs> right, we do gotta pass by the uh, Scorpion place. I don't like passing by this area because these Scorpions are kind of... Yep, that is why I don't like passing by this place. No way that hit us, dude. <sighs> of course that hit us. Why wouldn't it? Why wouldn't it hit us? Alright. That's uh, that's going to cause a side quest of its own. Yeah, because we're going to need to get the anti-venom for this. <sighs> Which, yeah. Alright. Well, at least those guys are dealt with now, permanently. I don't want to get shot. That would be great. There's a Venom Gland. We could eat this. It'll do a lot of damage to us, but we can heal afterwards. Yeah, that really hurts, but we're going to just heal it off. There we go. We're fine. 
We bought these honey poultices for a reason. And let's be real, the honey poultices are probably not going to be all that useful during a boss battle because of the animation. Can we actually pick that up without getting stabbed? Okay. I really thought that would cause us to get, like, trapped in there, but... I don't know. I guess not. Alright. Let's get over to Palace Island. Let's also pick some of these flowers. So we can get some sanity back. Oh, there's that's so cute. I've never seen one of the dung beetles sleeping before. That is so adorable. That is unbelievably adorable. All right, welcome to Pig Palace Island. Again. How long have we been streaming? Only three hours. Wow. I could have sworn it would have been a little longer than that, but no, we're doing pretty good. What is all that light? Oh, the glowfly larva. Look at them. They're trying to go fight them. What, what do they think they're going to do over there? Huh? What, 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 what do they think they're going to do? Wait a minute. Oh, no. It's not on Pig Palace Island. I bet you it's on Pugalisk Island. Or the Apocalypse Island. Dude, that is so unfortunate. That is actually so unfortunate. We have had the worst cards dealt to us possible at this point. And the Apocalypse is on its way. It is on its way. Looks like at this point we'll be fighting the Ancient Herald before we fight anything else. Yeah, at this point we'll be fighting the Ancient Herald. <laughs> That is so... Why? Out of all places, it decides an, a different island. Okay. Whatever, I guess. Whatever. Yeah, at this point, it looks like our fight's gonna be with the Ancient Herald first. Because things are not looking pretty. They're not looking pretty at all. All right, um, yeah, we don't even have the cloth that we need. And I swear, dude, peacocks are like so rare for no reason. No reason at all, they're just so rare. Oh, there it is. I guess standing in the light. All right, I didn't think that would happen. But oh well. Woo! Let's keep it moving. I just got shot. I knew that was going to happen because I always just beeline for the next room. I knew it was going to happen one of these days. And it decided to happen. I ew, wow. Whoa, chill out, guys. Chill out. Hold on, can I move? Don't stun lock me like that. My goodness. All right, I don't have another hat on me. I do, but it's a tin hat that will slow me down. Let's just take these guys. Why are they all aggroed on me? That's kind of nuts. They're supposed to, like, aggro one at a time. Very weird. All right, we'll just take him to town. We'll be fine. We'll be fine. How funny would it be if we got stun locked to death? All 
Nope, see, they they just give up on me. All right. Hey, pig guard, you want to do anything about this? Okay, chill out with that stun locking. This is actually bad. I think one more hit and we're like, we're in danger zone. We gotta stop messing around here. Ooh, that is unfortunate. But look, now we're faster than them. Do something about the bats, please. Alright, we're fine. We're fine. No, we're not fine. Okay. I thought we had I thought we had time. Um, let's just go into a shop real quick. Dude, why is this bat the most annoying bat known to man? Hey guard, you gonna do something about this? Thank you. My goodness. Alright. Let's chill out for a second. Why do you hear Rim Rimworld music? Are you imagining things? No, okay. It's not Rimworld music. I actually do have background music though. Um I I decided to add background music because you know, there's a lot of times in stream where there will be, like, awkward silences. So I'm trying to drown those out a little bit. Just a little bit. It's just a little test. I'm seeing how it goes for this stream, and depending on that is if I'll continue doing it. But so far, it's gone pretty well. Most people haven't noticed it, and that's good. I want people to not notice it. It's only for when I'm quiet. All right, can we make another football helmet real quick? All right, good, he's burning. All right, let's head home. Let's head home. If I'm dying in this world, I want it to be to, to a boss. Like, anything less than a boss, and I'll be very upset with myself. I'll be very upset with myself if I do. Alright. Let's go ahead and... We probably should whip something up real quick. Um... I think this will make honey ham. No, you can't put battleist wings in a crockpot. Crap. Okay. We would need morsels. Oh, yeah, we do have morsels. So this should make honey ham. This should make honey ham. Which is a pretty good healing item. Funny that you mentioned RimWorld, though. I was thinking about streaming RimWorld. Because, you know, I, I like that game so much. I was thinking about bringing that back and streaming it. Also, look at how big Robin's egg is getting. I haven't even done anything. Yeah, this has got to be honey ham with how long it's taking. What? Oh, it's not. It's, of course. All right. Cool. Well, that's very bad then. That's a very bad conversion. Um, can we do this? Will this be honey ham? Honestly, who knows? <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm experimenting at this point, guys. I'm experimenting. Oh, his egg is shrinking now. Too bad I, again, don't care. You would watch RimWorld? That's good. That's good to hear. You haven't played for years. Uh, last time I played was a while ago as well. I, you, I do actually have a Let's Play on this channel, but it was also back when I had my bad mic and bad video quality. You do like the themes that the DLCs have. Oh, beautiful. That heals us up. Let's just go ahead and make... I know they're not good conversions, but... We'll just make a few honey, whatever you call them, just for now. 
We are about to go into a porkalypse mode. So, like... That's gonna be fun. It's gonna be very fun, I'm sure. Hey, we got another stocking stick. We really can't afford to be sitting here like this. But, you know what? Maybe that's just the way it's gotta go. I don't even know when lush season is supposed to hit. When is lush season supposed to hit? No clue. No clue at all. I guess we could just look for a peacock. Man, it is raining. Of course. Guess what he doesn't have? Cloth. Ten more days till the apocalypse. That is true. And I don't have a gas mask, so I can't do anything about it. I feel like I have to talk louder because of this rain. Alright, on the bright side, all of this rain has to make the nettles bloom again. Oh, wait, wait. Okay, this might be worth it. You know what? It's worth it. Yeah, it's worth it. It's worth it. I don't think we lost anything either. I don't think we lost anything. We need this gas mask, like, now. If we want to do anything. Oh, beautiful. It's on our island. Okay, we have the peacock feathers. We have the peacock feathers. So. Now it's just the cloth. And then we'll have the gas mask. But the only problem is... The cloth is literally RNG. Like, we... We are at the mercy of the game. If it wants to give us cloth... Then it'll be nice and give us cloth. Oh, you're telling me those aren't bloomed? Alright, we're turning this on. We're getting bloomed nettles, at least. Alright, let's go loot this, though. Let's, let's check this out. Alright, so we've got the peacock feathers now. And more money. This is actually a pretty bad chest. Okay. And he also got the swashy hat, but eh, who cares about that? Sorry, buddy. I need the flint. All right, how long will it take these guys to bloom? Is the real question. I don't know. I have no clue. All right, well, at this point, we are just at the mercy of RNG. If it wants to give us... All right, you know, we'll, we'll come back. We'll come back. We just need to remember to come back before that runs out of juice. All right, um, lush season is day 56. Okay, good to know, good to know. I'm actually worried though, because if we don't get this gas mask, then, wait, if we don't get cloth, it's actually going to be impossible. Well, like, not impossible, but, like, super hard to get cloth. Because the store's going to be closed during the apocalypse. All right, you know what? I'll buy flint. Okay, I'll buy flint again. Just give me cloth. Cloth, please. Cloth! Dude. This is actually going to make me very upset. Cloth. A piece of cloth. Dude. Cloth. Dude. 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 No way. There is 
No way. I, you do not know how tempted I am to just. There's no other way to get cloth unless I go down into the ruins and smash every barrel or uh, base and just hope that I get the blueprint for cloth and the bamboo for cloth. There's just straight up no other way. He's actually trolling me. I, we just used all our money. We just used all our money. Okay. I love RNG. Yeah, I have hammered the balloon. Because I hammered it for the pith hat. Normally, I don't do that because I normally just rush the pig queen island to get the pith hat. But I didn't because, you know, this was supposed to be a tutorial run. Now I'm seriously regretting that decision. We're out of money now. Not that it's going to matter. We're going to be in Porkalypse anyway soon. So. Woohoo. Woohoo. All right. Well, we've got to hammer the vases down then. That's what we've got to do now. That's what life has become. So... Let's make a hammer. And I guess that's what we're doing now. I guess that's... We've stooped so low. Alright, we need to go back and get the uh, nettles though. Those things have got to be ready. By now. And I don't want to leave them any longer. Because who knows how much fuel that thing has left. Almost there. Oh, what? They're not ready? How long? Alright. Alright. Oh, I didn't want to do this, but now we've gotta. Now we've gotta do this. We have to smash pots. For the next, like, century. Okay. I did not bring a machete. Dude. I am awful at this game. I am actually awful at this game sometimes. Okay, before we do anything, though, let's get my grass. I left my grass somewhere over here. There it is. The grass that I said I was going to get after fighting the Mant Queen. Or the woman ant queen. My bad. My bad. Um. I am actually confused how long these nettles take. Like. I am genuinely confused. How long these nettles can take. I can try hammering down the shop and rebuilding it until I get cloth. Ooh, that is true. What do I need for the general store? I, I do have the key to the city. Hold on. What do I need for the general store? We'll need to get a little bit more money, though. But, okay, it's pigskin, three axes, and four boards. That's not bad. The only issue being, we don't, we don't have that much pig skin. We don't have that much pig skin. I hate, I just hate how cloth is all like completely RNG based in Hamlet. Like, you know, shipwrecked, you just go grab some bamboo. You're good. Here, you literally are at the mercy of RNG. I have to be near the nettles for their wetness to register. Oh, that's awful. 
That is awful. How long do these guys take then? All right, I guess we'll we'll chill here for a second then. I want to at least get one nettle harvest. So we'll we'll chill here for a second. Um I don't know if we have a second though, to be honest. Guys, this is so fun. Yeah, there, there are definitely some downsides to this DLC. One being cloth. Like, that... Having something be totally RNG-based that's also necessary to survive... Is kind of rude. I gotta, I gotta admit, it's kind of rude. It's kind of rude. These nettles are just going to take forever. You used to plant trees near the nettles and then just grab... See, that would be smart if I brought anything with me. But I am unsmart and did not bring anything with me. Because I thought the nettles would be done. But like now, this is like a sunk cost fallacy because I've used so much water. That it's it's got to be... They've got to be close, right? It's raining, too, now. Like... There's no way these nettles don't get, like, fully ready to go. Come on. Come on. We're wasting an entire day because of nettles. So this turned into a watching grass grow stream? Yeah, pretty much. I apologize for this super engaging content. <laughs> you guys like this? Is this fun? This is very fun. This is incredibly fun. You know, at this point, I'm just going to wear my football helmet. I don't care. We're just standing still anyway. Like... Oh, I'm so sad. The humidity is so crazy. Oh, wah, wah. It is raining, and there is a sprinkler. I, I can't leave either, because, like, it's sunk costs. I already waited this long. I already waited this long. There's no way I can leave. Like. There's no way I can leave at this point. Because, like, we've already waited so long. Oh, crap. Our nettles are gonna burn down. Oh, no. Did I just... Oh, this is actually bad. Question mark. Why must you be so annoying? Okay, thank you. Oh, we were standing in the sprinkler. This is hopeless, dude. What? How long do nettles take? Oh, crap. Alright, guys. At this point... Their growth saves when you go away. Only their wetness doesn't save. Yeah, at this point... Okay, 
at this point, we, we just count it as a loss, dude. It's just a loss at this point. We, we're, 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 it's so over. It's, it's so unbelievably over. We've got no gas mask. We've got, life is just going to be hard. It's, uh, it's apocalypse time almost. Nettles need to be above wet for three days straight. That is ridiculous. Holy moly. All right, guys. We're we're going to we're going to warm up a little bit. Look at Robin being useless in his useless little shell. All right, let's let's dry off a little bit. I don't want to be all wet. All right, let's grab our key to the city and our executive hammer. Um, let's also I want to go get some free food get some free food oh wait nope only the guards are out can i trade with the guard no no fine whatever whatever dude all right let's go check the shop one more time no way no way no way we, we need it though we don't have the oh crap Okay, okay, wait, what do we do here? What is that guy? He buys gems. He buys gems. Okay, we have a blue gem. We need to go back home, grab a blue gem, and get back to the store before... All right, let's go back to the store before they close. Come on. All right, come on, speed run, speed run. No, he closed. He closed. He closed. No. 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 I'm staying here. I'm not risking him sw switching out this cloth. Like I am not risking this. I I we are staying right here for the entire night. I, I'm, I'm like the first customer in line. Nobody's taking this cloth. I am, I'm puppy guarding it. It's like uh, Black Friday. I'm puppy guarding this thing. Nobody's getting it before me. Dude, I know you're hungry, but I don't care. Wah, wah. <laughs> Actually, we are pretty hungry. Unfortunately. Come on. Come on. Come on. I'm immediately going to buy this cloth. Come on. Yes! Yes! We have cloth. We have cloth. We have cloth. Okay. What, Dude, what is happening to Robin over there? He's going crazy. All right, let's go get some free food. This is a really good way to get a bunch of free food. Just trading these things to people. Like, look at that. Butterfly muffins. Uh, pumpkin cookies. Oh, did not mean to do that. Tasty. Uh, taffy. That's good for sanity. Perfect. We got a bunch of free food there. Um, dude, honestly, I'm not going to deal with the dragon fruit seeds. Not going to deal with them. Okay. This hand bat's going bad, but you know what, dude? At this point, I don't care. All right, what do we what else do we need for the gas mask? I think it's just pig skin. Ooh, let's grab our gunpowder. I want to clear the way to the Apocalypse Calendar now. I think that would be a great idea. If we can clear the way to the Apocalypse Calendar, then we win, in a sense. We'll be okay. All right, I'll leave the key to the city here and the executive hammer. We've got our resources in our backpack. We should 
probably make shears. But I don't know if I have the necessary iron. So, you know what? We're fine without shears. We've got a good helmet, just in case something bad happens on the way there. We've got nettles, although... Ooh, yeah. We probably should get ready. It's almost lush season. Let's make one nettle roll. That'll... That'll hold us over for until... Yeah, we make one nettle roll, and that should keep us good to go, just in case lush season happens on our way there. And then we'll make another ham bat. We'll make another ham bat. Okay. Things are going good. Things are going good. I have no clue if these nettle rolls are going to go bad before we make, make it to lush season, but even if it does, I don't care that much. All right, let's take the cork hat, too, because our lantern's almost gone. All right. Wonderful. We have everything we need. We've got a pith hat just in case uh, another humid strike happens. Whew. All right. Wonderful. Wonderful. Let's do this. We got a machete. We do. Okay. Time to go. Time to get to the apocalypse. Time to get to the apocalypse. We'll check our nettles one more time. But, like, at this point, I don't care if they're not blooming. Oh, I do care because it's going to make it annoying to fight bosses, but... I care more about the impending apocalypse than I do... Yeah, dude, that's so annoying. I... Best feature of the game. Best feature ever. Best feature. Alright, let's get to the poisonous rainforest. Oh, no, let's make the gas mask first. <laughs> oh, man. I'm just... I'm, I'm trying to, like... I'm going way too fast. I need to... I need to slow down a little bit. Going way too fast. Gas mask. Beautiful. Now I can breathe anywhere. What a boss thing to say. Now I can breathe anywhere. And I have what I need for a hand bat? I do. We'll make it when we get there so we get the longest survivability. Um, you know what? I'm just going to eat a lotus raw just to keep our just to keep things going nice and smoothly. There we go. Just so we know we've got enough. All right. It's poisonous rainforest time. Oh, the glow flies just patched. That's disgusting. This is going wonderfully so far. Why is there a luxury machete here? Did I leave that here? Alright, let's start recording again so I get some, some cool footage. Alright, gas mask it up, and let's get to moving. Alright. Oh boy. This is the spooky, the spooky place. We shouldn't have to be here long because, ah, right there, I already found it. Okay, that's annoying. That is also annoying. <laughs> How can all of the bad things happen at once? Like, that's my question. Great, dude. Great. Absolutely wonderful. This is so fun. Alright, we have to deal with these guys first. Alright. 
Let's we can use the snap tooths. Those guys will get mad. The snap tooths will get mad and uh, distract the bats for us. Whatever we do, we don't want to take damage to our gas mask. I don't think we'll take damage to our gas mask necessarily, but we just want to be ready for anything. All right. Let's actually move out of the poison rainforest real quick because... All right. This way we can just assess the situation now. All right. Looks like we've got only one bat on us. Okay. This can be handled. Those little spots in the ground with stone turf aren't poisonous. Really? So, like, we're the, uh... Okay, that's cool. That's good to know. Alright, hold on. I have a plan. I have a plan. Oh, wait, no. Nice. The bat god. Awesome. Okay, we're good to go again, then. Um, we do not have a... We, we just... We, we can make it. We can make it. We got this. Easy peasy, guys. We'll be fine. I do kind of want this nectar, though. So we'll take a little side quest. Oh, not now. Not now. Any time but now. Oh, we're almost there, though. We're fine. Wait, we don't have our pith hat. Why didn't I... Oh, wait, I do have my pith hat. Yay! Okay, good. Um, but also no, because we're being chased still. And I have no clue to the severity of our chasing. Okay, here's the plan. Here's the plan. I should have made my hand bat when I was back there. We'll be fine. We'll be fine. We'll be fine. We'll be fine. Okay. All right, we're in. We are in. Thank you. Thank you for uh, reminding me. I'm just silly sometimes, and I don't look at my slots. Whew, we're in. We should probably make the ham bat now. Like, I'm just going to make it now. We'll get more ham at some point. We'll be fine. Let's eat some of this nectar. And then, yeah, let's let's get to work. This court candle hat is so heavy. Wah. Wah, wah, wah. Alright. I stepped on a stone. Okay, that's not a deadly stone. It's just the annoying one. Alright, we don't want to be in here. Not useful. Not useful to us at all. Okay, so, so far, not good. Let's just take these guys out, honestly. Okay. Yes! That's amazing. Woo! Alright. Right out. Um, I am probably going to wait till daytime, though. Probably. Or, no, we'll be fine. We just need to be able to place down an item very quickly. Okay. Alright, we're good. Never mind, it's also foggy. Should be fine. Nope, I don't I don't like the sounds of all of that. Okay. I don't I don't like all that sound. Alright, we're good to go now. We're good to go now. <laughs> I'm not a fan of all that sound. Let's also refuel our core cat. There we go. 
Really? You gotta do all that. Ooh! Freaky. Alright. Hello? That was so cool, dude. That was so cool. I very much thank you for whatever that was. That has got to be my top 10 favorite moments ever to happen. Lightning through the canopy of the jungle. Yeah, that happened. Dude, fight the thung, the dung beetle. The thung beetle. Ah, no way, dude. All right, we got to heal. This is so annoying. We're fine to go. Oh, there's a peacock. Where were you in the first island, dude? How many are there? I don't care. I don't care. I don't care. I don't care. I do care a lot, actually. This is very annoying. Can't even eat in peace, dude. Alright. They gotta go away at some point, right? Like, hold on. Can I get them stuck? Yeah! Yeah, who's the stupid one now? Oh, they can still hit me through there, though. Oh, dude! Infinite rabid beetle glitch. Oh, there's a nettle that's bloomed. Wow. How cool. There's a nettle that's bloomed. I could have invested in bug spray. Bug spray works on these guys? I always thought it was only for the gnats. Well, that's a lesson for the future. That's for sure. Um, I failed to understand how annoying these guys truly can be. But it's okay. We're gonna, we're gonna, we're doing some shenanigans here. Okay. There we go. That seems to have freed me from most of them. Okay. Guys, it's so quiet now. That's so beautiful. It's so quiet now. All right. We got to look for the next ruins. The ruins part two. No way. No way they saw me. No way. Oh, no. No, there's more of them. Uh, I'm going to... You can't even outrun them. Like, that's... That's the... The sad part. Like, you can't even outrun them. Okay. Uh-oh. Alright, one second. One second. Ugh. Alright. I apologize. The cat just walked into my room. Alright, I want this aloe. Aloe gives you a good bit of health. But, um... You know what? We don't need these feathers anymore. Go away! Please! Oh, Thunderbirds? Iron. Ooh, iron. I'm gonna eat the asparagus. I, I kind of need this iron. Okay, it's raining, but no fog. Oh, wow. Thunderbird. Bug spray is insta-kill. What the? Look, there's a Thunderbird uh, nest on the uh, ocean. Wow, well, I don't know how to say any words right now. All right, I do want this iron, though. Very handy stuff.
All right, it's time to heal. Let's eat some aloe. That'll heal us a bit. Okay, so I think all of the peacocks were on this island, which is annoying when we needed them. Wow, dude. Holy rain. This is actually insane, the amount of rain. We got a lot of iron, though. I'm actually happy about that. No, 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 no. Absolutely not. Okay, seems like the Thunderbird wanted to deal with them. Ow! How rude do you have to be? To strike me with lightning. Okay, you know what? We're just gonna heal. We're just gonna heal. We'll get more money. So, let, let me... Let me just say, the actual name of the stream should have been Watch Me Struggle to Get to the Apocalypse Calendar. <laughs> That should have been the actual name of the stream, I feel. I feel. That's what this stream should have been called. Unfortunately, hindsight, hindsight is always 2020, so. Uh, don't smack me. Dude, what if the rabid beetles won the war against the plant guys? All right, I'm thinking it's not going to be in this jungle. It's probably going to be in a different... Oh. Oh, there's blooming nettles. There's blooming nettles, though. We don't need these petals. Thank you. We gotta go. We gotta go. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh. Oh, dude, why are we here? Hey, light bulbs, though. I thought they didn't drop light bulbs. Those are very useful, and I'd like some. Unless they... Uh, no, what? I've never seen them drop light bulbs. That's so weird. All right, how bad is it? Only one? No way. Oh, no, I'm not going to attack him right now, because there's another one over there. Okay. Okay, we're fine. We're fine. We're fine. How many bosses did I beat for now? I've beaten one. The Queen Woman. That's all I've beaten. None of the other ones yet. None of them. Alright. You know, I'm actually going to set down a fire... I'm actually going to set down a fire. I'm going to refuel my core cat a little bit. Um, yeah, I just realized I set down the fire and it's raining again, so I can't even dry off. I wanted to set down the fire to dry off, but... Literally, can anything go my way? Can anything go my way? At all. That would be cool, I think. Personally, I would like that. Alright. Well, cool. We're going to get even more soaked. Why wouldn't we? Right? Like, isn't that just fun? That's where all the fun come from, comes from. is me not getting anything. All right, dude. And I can't even find this stupid. It's definitely on the other side of the world. All right. All right, it's got to be up here. What are we getting chased by? Not you. Go away. Alright. 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 Fine. Fine. 
Oh, yeah, yeah, now stop the rain. Do it, fine, whatever. I don't care. I, I don't care. I do care deeply, and I'm very upset with the game's decision to do this. Very deeply upset. We only have five days. We only have five days, actually. Like, two more to go? Isn't there three? Because technically the Ancient Herald is considered a boss as well. We've got the Pugilisk, the Iron... Oh, no. The Iron Guy, and then the uh, Ancient Herald. I want to fight the Ancient Herald, but I want to have control over the Apocalypse first. That would be my preferred scenario. Right, we're going to drop that hammer. I don't need it quite yet. We're also going to eat some radishes. Uh, dude. If I ever find the ruins, that is. Ever in a million years, maybe. Ah, uh, there it is. Finally. Okay, this is the Apocalypse calendar. Couldn't be in an, any more annoying spot. And we're probably going to get fog now, if I had to guess. Right? Am I right or am I right? Like, which one is it? Alright, I should be able to just... Alright, let's, let's just scoot these guys around. I don't want to fight them if I don't have to, because they're not that lethal. I just want to move them around. Okay. You know what? I don't care. I'm getting out of here. <laughs> oh, I'm so sick of this. Alright. Alright. Alright, what are we dealing with in here? Be sure to survive a couple of days in the Emporcalypse. Yeah, that's true. That is... Okay, that's a shooting rock. I, ow, dude. Oh, now this guy's mad at me. I, I hate scorpions. I hate them. All right, let's get let's get for real now. Like we're we're being silly. We're being so unbelievably silly, and we need to be real. We need to be for real. We're in danger right now, dude. How can a bug be so annoying? Gotta be my least favorite um, entity in the game is scorpions. Like, honestly, I would rather deal with the shipwrecked monkeys or venomous mosquitoes. I'd rather deal with them. I'm being totally honest. I hate scorpions. Okay, we do have to check around the rooms, though. Because the Apocalypse calendar is going to be behind a crack in the wall. So we do have to be wary of that. Yeah, we're either going until we've defeated all the bosses or I lose this character. Whichever one comes first. And so far... You are annoying, dude. Yeah. Take that. Alright, I don't see any cracks in the wall. Any cracks in here? Probably not. I'm not seeing anything. Okay, we can go this way. 
What's that noise? You guys hear that? I wasn't a fan of whatever that was. That's for sure. Um, I genuinely was not a fan of whatever that noise was. But cool, I guess. All right. Alright, I'm not seeing any cracks in the walls. Alright. Nothing. 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 Alright. Um... Potentially went the wrong way. There is a lot more ways to go. No way he just did that to me. Alright. We're fine. We're fine. We're fine. Guys, why are you so worried? We're fine. Let me just add some more fire to my head. I should really be looking for suspicious cracks, but... There it is. Okay, we found it. We found it. We found it. All right, that's got to be the calendar right there. It's got to be. There's no way it's not, right? If it is, then it's over. And I'm so sad. But it's over. All right, let's go ahead and... Uh, what do I want to do here? What do I want to do here? Um... Hmm. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Let's see. I think, personally, I want to set the Apocalypse back. I don't want to deal with it yet. I don't want to. I want to be able to have full control over it. After we get this out of the way, we can go fight the Pugilist. And then start working on the Iron Hulk. So, this is the only thing in our way, which... We should now be able to handle. Alright, but first, but first, let's walk in here. And then let's drop this. And then let's throw this on. And then let's... No, you are not envenomating me, buddy. Dude, use any freaky attacks you want. I don't care. Just do not envenomate me, please. Alright. So, we've got the suspicious crack here. All we have to do is throw this gunpowder down. And boom goes the dynamite. Alright. And now... Welcome to the apork... You gotta be kidding me. There's a scorpion in here! <laughs> I knew that was an, a chance, but like, I know it's not... Come here. How do you fight these guys without taking damage? It's so annoying. Oh my goodness. Alright. 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 Welcome to the Apocalypse Calendar. We will be turning this off. So what we can do here is we just go ahead and... Um, I think that's forward. We want this, right? This is backwards. So we're just gonna set the Apocalypse backwards. Don't worry, we'll manually trigger the Apocalypse.
wait, which way does it move? Yeah, we're setting it backwards now. Alright. Ooh, we're getting quite hungry. I'm gonna eat all of these radishes. I don't care. Alright, we're just gonna set the apocalypse back a little bit. I don't care how far back it goes. I just don't want to get jump scared by it. For now. So, let's see. How are we doing? That's pretty good. That's pretty good. I think we're 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 getting there. Again, I'm not looking to make it last like as long as possible without the apocalypse. I'm just trying to make sure we get a couple more days. So we're just going to set it back a little bit, is what we're going to do. And then, honestly, that's not a bad path, really. It's just going around this up here. So that's a pretty good way to get to the Apocalypse Calendar. That's not bad. This is a really good spot. There's also the Ends Well down here, but eh, it doesn't matter that much. All right, guys, we're almost back to the default setting. As you guys can see, it's almost lining up. All right, so we're going to stop here. That should give us plenty of time. We'll be good now. We'll be good now. Apocalypse averted. Wonderful. Of course, I stepped on a stone. Why would I not have stepped on a stone? I'm going to get shot. No, I'm not. I'm cool like that. Woo. All right, guys. Apocalypse averted. And it's lush season. How fun. Now we can get back to business. And by business, I mean, let's go get some tubers because they're blooming now. And I like me some tubers. Dude, that, that guy's going to shoot his lightning. All right. Yep, I told you. What did I tell you? I knew it was going to happen. Oh, Nat Swarm. I don't want to deal with that. All right, we can eat these raw, too, to get some nice health. This is probably... If we can, if we can farm up some more nettles, I think we'll be good to fight all of the bosses in the season. Because I know a lot of people don't like Lush Season because, you know, it's allergies. Unless you're playing as Wormwood because then, you know, whatever. Fine, lucky person. But I really enjoy Lush Season because food is not a problem at all, ever, during Lush Season. It just means you can't fight anything unless you have a good source of nettles. So, we just have to get ready for that. Because there's no way we can fight a boss while sneezing. That would just be crazy of us. That would be absolutely insane. Out of my way, Brambles. All right, let's get home. We got to go this way to get home. I don't know where I'm going. So welcome back to Lush Season. It's uh, It's been a while. It's been a while since we've been here. What just did more damage to me? Did you guys hear that? It sounded like more damage was done to me. I don't know what that was about. Alright, are we going to have enough cork hat to make it? I have no clue, but we'll we'll find out. Dude, stay away from me, you freaky little being. 
All right, let's get out of here. Dude. Ah, uh, great. He's going to be spawn camping me now. Gotta love it. Uh, he stepped on a rock. Ew. Gross. Little scorpion guy. All right. We are out. We are out and about. The apocalypse has been averted. And we got some money. Nice. Now we just got to get out of this stupid, gross rainforest. Also, is the... Oh, that's got to be the Pugilisk Island then. Okay. Hey, we can harvest some green mushrooms though. I'm not opposed to that. I'm actually not opposed to that at all. Give us some sanity. That'd be nice. Well, we did it. Despite all odds, we did it. And we came out relatively unscathed. Are we annoyed? Yeah. But are we alive? Of course. Of course we are alive. Because we're just that good. Look at those brambles growing. Disgusting. Are right, you just sneak by here? An overly complicated spiky thing. Yeah, that's that's how I feel about it as well. That's how I feel about it. All right. Well, we've got our nettle rolls ready to go whenever the cursed season decides to give us allergies. But, now we're pretty good to go. Okay. Wow, dude. Robin's egg got huge. Alright. Now that the apocalypse has been averted, it's Pugilus time. It's Pugilus time. Which should be very fun. I believe so. We're gonna wanna get like some money, I think. I think we're gonna get some money, maybe. And then probably. Let's go ahead and cook up these green caps so we can gain some sanity back. Wonderful. Then let's cook up these tubers so that we can get some food back. Equally as wonderful. Alright. We also don't need this gas mask anymore until we plan on turning the apocalypse back on. Should we... Should we, should we... Well, technically, if we just bring a bunch of nether rolls over, we'll be fine. We'll be fine. Technically. We also have a torch here. Not that it's necessary. I want more light bulbs. Does any place... Hold on. While we're while we're waiting at home real quick. Uh let's see. Um Oh, yeah, I totally forgot. You know what I could do? I don't need to get light bulbs. I can use the key to the city to make lanterns. Which, let's see. 
How much do those cost, though? Uh, that's not a great conversion. You know what? What if? What if we just? What if we just? Hold on. What if we like? Okay. Look, how bad can they hate us if we do this, right? Like, what if we just? What if we just find a spot where there's no guards, like over here? And what if we just? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I'm liking this. You only need one lamppost, guys. Stop being so wasteful. Dude, now we have a ton of lanterns. This is amazing. And alloys. Wonderful. And we made the pigs only mildly angry. So that's great. Yeah, now we got a ton of alloys as well. Uh, alright. Well, light has been... Light is no longer an issue. We got plenty of lanterns for any boss battles. Or, you know, whatnot. I say what we should do... Is... I think now's a good time to start making money. So that we can get some healing items. I think that that is the way to go for now. So... Let's throw these in here. We also got some electrical doodads, which is nice. All right. Let's make some shears. Let's get to work, guys. Let's get to work. All right. First, we got to find... Well, no, we can just start chopping hedges. We need some money so we can get some healing items. All right. Uh, allergies start tomorrow. So that'll be very fun to deal with. That'll be super fun. And everybody enjoys allergies, don't they? Are you the... No, you're a gem. You're a gem buyer. I need relic buyer. Who should be somewhere around here. Either way, we can get some coins from you, Catherine. Let's get some money. There we go. I see the relic guy up here. Awesome. Thank you. All right. Things are looking up for us. We can actually probably get another boss after what? Let's see. We fought Queen Woman at like an hour and 50 minutes. So it's taken us about two hours to get to another boss and it's still going the count is still going up don't don't think that i don't know that all right is there any other hedges no this this area is terrible for hedges there we go now we've got plenty of money we should be good to head over to the mud spa and go ahead and grab some healing items. Here we go. Anti-venom, you know what? Might be worth it. I'm buying anti-venom. I'm sick of those scorpions, dude. Okay, she's messed up now. Okay. Unfortunately, looks like I'm gonna have to buy healing salves. But, you know, oh, now she's only selling coffee beans. No, I need more I need more healing items. Fine, I'll buy another anti-venom. You know what? Uh, at this point, we might as well make, make coffee, dude. All right. You know what? You know what? Two healing salves should be fine. Two healing salves should be fine. Oh, yay. What a lovely... You know what? The pigs will deal with this. Not my problem. You ready, guards? Because it's about to get spooky. And we leave. 
And now we don't have to deal with them at all. Let's actually go in the grocery store. Do we got anything interesting in here? We can make a melon hat. You guys remember the, the uh, melon hat? Wasn't that fun? All right, nothing in here that's interesting, unfortunately. All right, I guess we can we can deal with this guy. Whatever. This is entertaining. This is very entertaining. <laughs> Alright. Alright. We're almost ready to go. I just want to make another ham bat. So that we have a full ham bat ready to go. So we're nice and good. And I want to gather a few more nettles. We don't need the pith hat anymore. We don't need iron ore on us. Oh, hey, Robin. How's it going? How's it going, buddy? Dude, he's so stupid looking. <laughs> Alright, we might as well make coffee. We have the ability to. Why not? Get some speed going on. Alright, that should make coffee. Um. Alright. Alright, well, we don't need to carry money on us either right now. We also don't need... Well, we got nettles. That's worth it to keep with us for now. Logs? And... No, we also don't need these. Alright, things are looking good. Things are looking good. We need to go take out a hippo. Yeah, we gotta go take out a hippo. These nettles are spoiled... But I think they'll last until tomorrow. As long as they last until tomorrow, we're good. That's all we need them to do. Is just last until tomorrow. Oh, it's a full moon. I didn't even realize that. Alright. Might as well head down to the... This coffee would actually be kind of helpful for the battle. We'll keep it for the battle. So I can move nice and fast. Hey, what's up, guys? Ow. Oh, they steal things from you. I didn't even realize that. I didn't think they would steal things from me. Totally did not realize that. Look at him running with my pig skin. Oh, what an evil creature. They glow, too. That's so weird. So weird. There it is. Alright, now we can eat these and it's not a waste. Wonderful. Alright, Hippo, I'm sorry about this. Wow, that was embarrassingly easy. What's up? Welcome to the stream. Um, you didn't miss much. We fought the Queen Woman. That was it. And then... Um, yeah, we fought the Queen Woman, and now we're about to fight the Pugilisk. We also found the Apocalypse Calendar, so that was fun. That was very fun. Alright, we got Anti-Venom, we've got, uh, we've got coffee, we've got a ham bat. Let's just make some food, and then I think we're good. I think we're good to go. Yeah. If we can get some food made up, we'll be good to go. Alright. Alright. Let's just go ahead and... Uh, uh... Do we want to make... You know what? That might be a good idea. We'll make... We'll make these, because then we'll at least get some health while battling.
Yeah, the only time I fought the Pugilisk, I died because uh, its head attack does like a whopping tons of damage. It's annoying, but we've got it. We've got it. Oh, we're getting hot? What? We're getting too hot. That's funny. All right, we're just going to cook up a little bit. This is good. Good stuff right here. Good stuff right here. We can also make honey ham, but eh, I don't need it. Don't need it. Right now, I'm focusing on these and meatballs. That way we have... In fact, we'll eat one now so we can get our health nice and full. Or close to full. Uh, the next vid is dropping tomorrow at 3, Eastern Standard Time. Um, it's going to be the dry season guide. And then next Friday, next Friday, I plan on getting the 100 Days of Summer out. Although I am still working on it. It is very hard. And I'm, I'm just hoping it uh, YouTube doesn't do me as dirty as it did with the 100 days of winter because that got shown to like no one so very upsetting but oh well oh well yeah you did guess the next video <laughs> all right this should be fun um i actually don't know the strategy for pugilis and I don't want to know the strategy. I'm just going to go for it. I'm just going to go for it. Last time I fought Pugilisk, I just kind of tanked him. And that turned out pretty bad. With like a few log suits and football helmet. Not a great idea. I would not suggest to ever do that. I failed horribly. What program do I use to edit? I, uh, I use DaVinci. I have the studio version. Or, yeah, I think that's what it's called. The the lifetime subscription or whatever. I think that's what it's called. Strat for Pugilisk is to run real fast. Well, I guess that's good that we have uh, coffee then. It's a good thing we have coffee. I didn't I didn't even mean to make coffee. I just made it on accident. So. <laughs> All right. We've got plenty of uh health now. We're we're good looking here. We got plenty of health and food. We'll eat these one more time. And let's get moving. We actually Hold on. Before we Before we dedicate fully, let's grab our machete because we can use the machete to actually let's see all right yeah we want to get some tubers before we head out to pugilus land we'll also need the machete to cut through the ruins i know that all right How long does it take for tubers to regrow? They regrow, right? Like, those tubers, we cut down, like, last lush season. How long do they take to regrow? Weird. Anyways, I'm just going to grab some of these for extra health. These guys are very good for health. And then, oh, you know what? We can't go yet. We can't go yet. What's this bird doing in my house? Uh, that's Robin. And he is, uh... Silly and not cool. He's not as good as Chester. <coughs> cool. I can use the pig guard's weapon to kill Pugilus. What is that noise? Oh, he's awake! The Iron Hulk is awake! Uh... We're not fighting you yet. Go back, go back, go away. <laughs> uh, 
Uh, no, I'm going to use a fresh hand bat because I want to make sure I'm doing as much damage as possible. And I know the halberd does not do a crazy amount of damage. It's good, but it's not like crazy good. It's not fresh hand bat good, at least. All right. What did we need to make? We needed to make something before we left. I totally forgot what it was. Oh, yeah. Nettle rolls. Let's make those before we go. We should be fine with two nettle rolls. That should keep us from sneezing too much. Because then the rest of the season, we're just going to prepare to get the final island ready. So that we can fight the Iron Hulk. Alright, we've got nettle rules. We're ready to go. Let's do this, guys. Let's do this. This should be fun. Actually, before we before we do this, I'm actually going to grab a... I'm going to grab some ice real quick. I like eating ice. It's fun. So, I'll be right back. Uh, it won't be too long, though. I'm literally just walking out of my room. All right, I have returned with some ice. Ice hurts your teeth. Yeah, I don't think it's the best for your teeth, but I like it. Ah! I fell off of my chair. That was bad. Woo. All right, one second. All right, we should be good to go. Wonderful. All right. Let's go beat a Pugilus, guys. Let's do this. We've got three lanterns. Three. Three lanterns. Count them. Three. So if nighttime happens, we're good. We're fine. All right. Pugilus is right here, I think. We've got plenty of blooming tubers to heal. Um, all right. The question is, can we make it to the... Oh, no. We're going to have to break some brambles. We can make more football helmets, too. But I want to use the tin hat if possible. All right. Here we go, guys. Let's get to the Pugilus. All right. This machete is going to break. How unfortunate. All right. Dude, snakes galore in here. My goodness. Oh, it's a wishing well. Not what we need. All right, so that room's useless. I did fall off my chair. That was pretty embarrassing. Not gonna lie. Oh, wonderful. This room looks pretty. All right, not what we need. If you kill the Iron Hulk, you'll be able to become invincible by creating the... Oh yeah, I know about that. The uh, living artifact. Probably one of the coolest items in the entire game. Alright, there goes our machete. We'll have to make a new one. Not where we need to be. Alright, let's keep moving. There it is! Alright, Pugilus Island. Welcome. So, this is Pugilisk Island. We need to find the Fountain of Youth. That's what we're looking for. Whoa! It's a... Look at all these nettles! Oh, we should totally bring these home. 
Eh, not not a big deal right now though. We've got nettle rolls long enough to last us for hopefully well, long enough. That's the hope. That's the hope. Um all right, we need to find the fountain of youth. Let's also make another football helmet. This one's going bad. We have the tin hat, but... Not what I want to rely on, to be honest. Hey, money. Uh, we don't need it. We're fine. Alright, we're also going to leave our... We're going to wear the log suit because of obvious reasons. This is the one time where I will choose a log suit over a backpack. The one time. Because the Hamlet bosses are no joke. They are all pretty messed up. Alright. If we can find the Fountain of Youth, that is. Let's see. Well, there's a stash over here. We don't have a shovel with us, though, so. <laughs> uh, we can make one. We'll make one and dig that up before we go home. There's lots of nettles on this island. It hurts to know that I never ate the Guardian's Horn. Yeah, dude, that... Okay, there have been two mishaps with the Guardian's Horn. Because on the 100 Days of Winter challenge, it got eaten by a hound. And then on the 100 days of summer, I just forgot to eat it. So, like, I'm just, I, yeah, I'm not good at dealing with the Guardian Horn. I'm also about to start sneezing here soon. We've got nettle rules for this. Where is this Fountain of Youth? Is it over here? Oh, our thing just gave out. How wonderful. It's got to be over here. All right, let's eat these so we don't start... Sneezing. Where is this fountain of youth? I'm finally choosing the safe option. Yeah, it's because I don't mess with the Hamlet bosses. The Reign of Giants bosses and the Shipwrecked bosses are like... Eh, they're okay. They're easy to deal with. Hamlet are no joke. Especially the Iron Hulk. That man is crazy. That man is nuts. Shoots lasers at you. That pretty much insta-kill you. It's kind of crazy. Dude, so many nettles on this island, but no fountain of youth? What? Gotta be here somewhere. That's gotta be here somewhere. We also already reset the Apocalypse, so we're good. We don't have to worry about the Apocalypse tomorrow. It's not happening. Though, if we want to fight the Ancient Herald, we need to... Can it be across this lake? Is that what? Is that what's going on? You've got to go. Best of luck with the boss. Ah, oh, thank you. Glad you could catch the stream. Is it across the lake? I'm beginning to think it may be across the lake, guys. Will I fight the Reign of Giants? Giants? I will at some point. They just glitched out during my... During my, uh... How to Survive series. I did fight the... Deerclops. Oh, here we go. Now we're making it somewhere. I did fight Deerclops in my very first 100 Days of Reign of Giants video, but that was a while ago, so there's not like a modern time where I fought a Reign of Giants boss. Uh, well, if you do have to go, I will uh, see you later. Glad you could catch the stream at least. That is nice. Dude, not having a walking cane sucks. Holy moly. Alright, dude. 
Fountain of Youth, question mark? Like, anywhere, maybe? Is there, like, a certain spot where this thing spawns? Yeah, dude, my mic quality was bad back back then. It was not pleasant, that's for sure. I did not have pleasant mic quality back then. Eating... Okay, nice. That's a fast eating animation. I just wanted to make sure. Alright. Um. Well, the Fountain of Youth can't be, like, in there, right? Like, it... No way. No way. No way. No way. Okay. I take back the other title. I should rename this stream... Watch me walk around Hamlet for eight hours. That that should be what I name the stream. Because, like, we're not finding anything. <laughs> okay, I think we might have to get on the lily pad biome. I don't like that biome because it's spooky and scary, but... This is the Pugilisk Island. This is where the, uh, yeah, no, I don't, I don't get it. Do we have to cross this biome? I guess we must have to. Oh, did you hear that little mosquito sound? All right. Well, we might as well just chill for the night then. Let's just go to make a fire, dude. Let's chill out for the night and then we'll, we'll cross, we'll cross. Um, unfortunately, I forgot that you need wood to, uh, actually make a raft. Looking for Pugilis for eight hours straight. True. True. No way! No way I get two scorpions. The most annoying creature in the game. Oh my goodness, guys. I hate these things. I actually hate these things. Like, my my disappointment with these things is immeasurable. Alright. Let's get away from this guy. Let's go chop down a tree. And let's get to the Pugilis. Oh, it dropped a burr. Nice, cool. I guess we're not deforesting. Alright. Let's cross the lake here. Welcome to Shipwrecked, everybody. Welcome to the world of Shipwrecked. Alright, it's gotta be over here, right? Like, there's no way it's not. Alright, at this point, I might make the hand bat. Just so we can start getting fully ready, because it's... It's so over here, there's no way. Oh, I'll take this aloe, though. That's a nice healing item. Oh, what's up, pig guard? You want to help me with the, uh, Pugilis? That'd be cool of you. Here it is. All right. All right. Um... First off, Klein, I'm going to need you to take back that um, that sentence there. There's no way you love scorpions in this game. Scorpions in real life are cool. Like, they're actually really chill. I like scorpions in real life. In this game, why would they give something a jump attack and an envenomating attack and have enough health to survive five ham bat hits? Like, awful. Awful. At least, the only redeeming quality is they don't have a ranged attack. If they had a ranged attack, they would be the worst. Anyways. It's Pugilus time. Alright. Um, we should be good to go. I think I just take water out of the fountain and we're, we're ready to go, right? 
Hold on, let me make sure. Let's get a lantern ready to go, just in case things go bad and go into the night. All right. All right. Here we go. All right, it's Pugless time. So I think you just you just straight up hit it. And oh yeah, he does he does hit. All right. Here we go. All right. I don't know when he's going to start using that crazy ranged attack, but we need to get ready for that. Because it is coming. I'm almost tempted to swap out my football helmet now. Let's just swap it out now so we don't take any extra damage. Because we're probably going to start getting frozen here any second. This is probably the coolest looking boss, in my opinion. Like, this boss looks so cool. It's close, though, with the Iron Hulk. Here we go. Is it ranged attack time? No, he was just thinking. Wait, what? What is he doing? A tough nut to crack. Ho, <laughs> Let me check. Um, I do have it in... Let's see. I, I'm getting all of your chats. Uh, I have it set to live chat now. Um, okay. That Okay, that's true. Shipwreck spider warriors are also the same. But at least you can control. Like, you don't have to see Shipwrecked Spider Warriors. So, like, yeah. I am seeing all of your messages, though. Yeah, we killed so many Krampus. And there was just no... There was just no good things about that. Alright, we have to go for the pink areas. Let's... Owie. That hurt. Ooh, stay away from me, you freaky little thing. Oh, oh, we got frozen. Yuck. All right. Yeah, I, I see that attack now. No, 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 no. All right, that means, his, that means his health has to be getting low. Dude, you're so freaky. Oh my goodness. We're going to bed. Owie. We have to go for the pink skin. Uh, stop it. Stop. Stop. Alright. Dude. Rip. Ow. So we have to go for that pink skin. Oh boy. Oh boy. Yeah, having coffee is a lifesaver. Like big time. Okay, you know what? Whatever, dude. Oh, he just bites? Okay. When he uses his freeze attack, just move away from the head. Really? Weird. So just move away from the head? Oh, because he'll stop doing it. That makes a lot of sense. Okay. 
Boom! Pugilisk down. All right. Woo! We got it. We got the Pugilisk down. Where's my backpack? There it is. That's the Pugilisk. Now we save the best for last. The Iron Hulk. Can we do it? We also have the magic water. We also have the magic water. We're gonna save this. This is used for the whatchamacallit. The living artifact. And then snake bones, I don't know what you do with these exactly. I know they make some type of like, they make some type of thing. They make some type of thing. Uses bones and something else to make a dish that heals for, what is the something else? It's a skull with his bones. Oh, we have to dig up his skull. I forgot about that. All right, um, yeah, it looks like our coffee wore off at the perfect time. Our coffee actually wore off in the perfect time. All right, unfortunately, we're, we're gonna have to drop a lantern real quick. All right, we could dig up his skull. However uh, morbid that is. There's his skull. The Pugilus skull. Uh, now, the fact that we only get one of these makes me think that it's not worth it to make a crockpot dish with this skull. But, well, we'll figure out. I think you can make, like, a freezing ray with it or something. Something crazy. He also drops a lot of monster meat. We don't need this asparagus. What am I doing? Two monster meat and two snake bones. 40 HP, 25. That is insane. That's really good. That's actually really good. All right. All right. Let's grab this monster meat then. Um. Oh. Uh, dude. Inventory management? Question mark. Uh, we don't need an axe. Let's get this monster meat. I know he drops like the most monster meat out of any creature in the game. He drops a lot. We can also eat these nettle rolls. We're good now. Awesome. Let's gather all of these bone shards that we can. Um, I think there's only one snake bone left. Cool. Also, yeah, his his noise is like glitched. You can still hear him. All right. Now we got lots of snake bones. We got lots of stuff. All types of goodies. Ooh, we need these azure feathers. We need these. I know that. Um, do we need bone shards? Really? Like, I, I don't think it's going to kill us to not have bone shards. We'll be, we'll be fine without the bone shards. All right. Well, there's that dealt with. Well, that looks ominous. <laughs> All right. Uh, bye-bye. We will hopefully see you in the next stream. It was fun having you. Alright, let's go ahead and pause the recording now. Not for you guys, just for my... Oh, it's BFB. Yuck. For once, I don't want BFB here. We already got your island unlocked. I don't need you. Will BFB land in the water? Oh, God. Dude, she's gonna crush me. Alright, let's get back home. 
That's what I think we needed to do. Don't land on me. If I die to BFB landing on me, I will be unbelievably upset. Almost did. Almost did. <laughs> All right. Oh, we need our machete. Yuck. All right, well, this shovel will wait here. We'll make a new machete. Dude, I swear, I'm gonna, the map's going to be covered in machetes. You know what? Let's pick some of these resources. Let's spend some time gathering some resources. Because why not? Right? Why not? I'll be honest. Pugilus dropped a surprisingly low amount of uh, monster meat. Okay, so question, question. Should we fight, should we fight the Iron Hulk the normal way? Like, you know, just, just bringing all of the pieces together on the main island? Or, should we fight the Iron Hulk by taking all the pieces to Pinnacle Island? One's going to take significantly longer, so. It's really up to you guys. How long of a stream do you want to watch? Because <laughs> if we want to take him to Pin Pinnacle Island, we need to farm up a ton of purple gems. And that alone will not be fun. So I'm actually thinking about fighting Iron Hulk on the main island. Just because we're not farming the Iron Hulk. Bringing the Iron Hulk to the Pinnacle Island is definitely a good idea if you want to farm the Iron Hulk. But I just want to fight the Iron Hulk. So, like, let's be real. Let's be real here. Alright. Well, Pugalisk down. Pugalisk down. I think we're just going to fight the Iron Hulk normally. Although, before we do that, we're going to have to get more nettles. Which means... We're going to have to sit and watch our nettles grow. So I hope you guys are ready for that. Because that's going to be fun and enjoyable, I'm sure. Alright, hey guard, you want to deal with this? Actually, you know what? I can deal with this. I have a... You know what? I'll take this. Alright. Alright, let's move up north. Back to our house. Real quick. Let's move up. We need... Yeah, because... Okay. Think about it this way. We could fight the Iron Hulk on the main island and that would be okay yeah, yeah we're gonna fight the iron hulk on the mainland i think i think that would be a good idea all right we got our snake bones we got our pugilist skull that's cool we got our anti-venom we could leave that here honestly we don't need it anymore we're not gonna be going caving anymore that's we're we're totally good well unless we want to go to the apocalypse but that's not for now. Not for now. Um, Azure Feather. Okay. Can I drop the magic water? It won't, like... Okay, good. That's so weird. <laughs> I was worried it was gonna, like, just vanish. Alright, so when it comes to the Iron Hulk, I definitely want to get very prepared. Like, unbelievably prepared. Alright. 
So what I want to do... Is I want to make another log suit. Wonderful. We've got our fancy helmet. That's a good thing to have. Let's drop this lantern. We don't need all of these lanterns. We'll actually just drop this outside because it's easier to turn it off. Oh, I can't turn it off for some reason. Whatever, I guess. It'll just run out on its own. Cool. Okay. Okay. This is it. This is it. The moment we've been waiting for. It's time for the Iron Hulk. But, not quite yet. Not quite yet. We've got a little bit of preparation to do. Let's see. We've got football helmets ready to go. Wonderful. We've got some blooming tubers. Although, I want to cook these guys up. I want to cook some of them up so we have some food. Alright. Bloomin' Tubers. Probably my favorite food source in the game because it's so abundant. Alright. Are you guys ready? To watch nettles grow. Because that's what we're gonna go do. That is what we're gonna go do. So, we can head over here. Not going to worry about that at all. <laughs> Just fall asleep on the floor, dude. All right. Okay. gonna have to do that and then let's go ahead and refuel the sprinkler and then we want to stay in the area so we pretty much are just gonna be chilling here until these nettles bloom oh whoa whoa they bloomed immediately would you look at that All that time we spent sitting there waiting. And these guys just bloomed immediately. Okay. They must have saved their, uh... Their state then. That's weird. Alright. I will never understand how nettles work. I'm gonna be totally honest. Well, that... That made this significantly less boring. I'm... I'm very happy right now. All right. Well then. Let's get to work. So we need to get all of the Iron Hulk pieces next to each other. My only concern is Look at where the head spawned. Hold on. Let's... Yeah. How are we going to get his head out? We're going to have to find a way to activate it. Without... We, we could try gunpowder, maybe. I think that might be worth it to try. We'll try some gunpowder. Um, let's also go ahead and make our nettle rolls. Before we fully commit to doing anything. Oh, Robin. You funny little guy. Or big guy, I guess, I should say. You're pretty large. That was in no way meant to be mean to Robin. I'm just stating that he is a large bird.
All right. We got nettle rolls. We've got plenty of nettle rolls. Now, let's gather our immense stockpile of pickaxes that we got from buying things from that shop. Because, oh my goodness, did we buy a million things from this shop because we needed cloth. And look at that. There's cloth here now. If I had half a mind, I would buy that cloth. Alright. Um, uh, okay, look. We don't need all of these pickaxes. Let's actually, you know, we only need one lantern. Like, it's not that big of a deal. Unfortunately, I can't turn those lanterns off for some reason. So, those lanterns are going to become useless. But that's okay. That's okay. Not a big deal. Not a huge deal. Alright, let's chop down this. Everybody's gonna get mad. Yeah, look at them. They're so scared of me. Oh no, I'm crazy. <laughs> Dude, imagine freaking out because somebody chopped down a tree. Like, come on now. Alright, let's make some gunpowder. Let's make a torch. Oh, I'm... Dude, I made a torch and look what's right here. I am the most wasteful individual known to man, I think. Alright, because I think if we can... Like, we need to make sure we can get this head out, though. Because this right here is an issue. Like, a big issue. We may not be able to fight the Iron Hulk. And that's what I'm incredibly worried about, because I want to fight the Iron Hulk. I want to fight the Iron Hulk. But he's not going to make it easy if his head is just stuck in the wall. Alright, we're almost there. Whoa, vines. Yuck. Alright, here's the head. Can we reach it with a pickaxe? No, we cannot. Um, how did the head even get here? Like, okay. So, big question. Big question. Let's, let's see. Let's see. Um. How, how can we get this guy out? We're gonna need to, I, I need to hope that this activates him. I... I just... Okay. Let's hope that the... No, that just went off the edge of the map. You've got to be kidding me. You're joking, right? Otherwise, I just have to wait for lightning. Or, I mean, use a telelocator staff. But then we need to... Ah. This could not be any more annoying. Like... Okay. Well, the gunpowder just dropped off the edge, despite literally not being off the edge. I don't get it, but... That's... That is very annoying. Yeah, I think I'm gonna have to telelocate it. Which is... Going to slow down progress by a lot. We'll need to get a Xur Feathers. We'll need to get... A pork... Pork or whatever it's called. The Hamlet equivalent of a Prestahatitator. And, yeah. What a great time. What a great time. Yeah, the gunpowder just fell through the map. Because that's realistic. And all that. 
All right. Well, what do we need for the thing? We need Azure Feathers. I know that. So that's not bad. We can make that. But we'll need to go get a Boomerang. Which also probably means we're going to need more Silk. We're going to need more Silk. Which, again, also means we're probably going to need more money. So, we are far from the clear here. You also never got a notification telling me that... Uh, dude, YouTube is so mean to me. YouTube is so mean to me. It just doesn't tell people when I'm live. And I'm very upset about it. Alright, so we have a problem. Uh, okay, right now we're trying to fight the Iron Hulk. But... Where is it? His head is off the map. That's his head. And I already tried gunpowder and it fell through the world. So I need to figure something out. We need to get it struck by lightning or telelocate it. Probably going to have to telelocate it. All right. Where did I put my boomerang? No clue. But you know what? That's okay. All right. We need silk then. And what better way to get a silt than fighting the spider monkeys? Alright. Yeah, we're gonna have to telelocate it. Does that mean we need to make the focus too? That's so annoying. The gunpowder just fell through the world. No clue how. It just decided to fall through the world. Just dropped off the edge, yeah. I placed it on the ground and it poofed away. Like it fell off the world. It was very cool. Very cool. I enjoyed it a lot. Alright. Sorry, spider monkeys. There we go. Any silk? I'm not seeing any silk. Although, probably it'd be better to go for the cocooned uh, tree over here. That might be the best way to get the silk. Um, Let's go for it. Oh, they're mad. Oh, they're mad. Oh, they're mad. There's a big cocoon tree over here. That would be amazing if we can get that. Uh, if you want to telelocate it to a spe specific place. Okay, so I should be able to just make the staff and I'll be good. Oop, I almost... I hate these, uh, hiding... You know, I'm just gonna tank you. I don't care. Alright, we just got ourselves silk. Dude, look at them. They're all stuck in... Oh, he can hit me through that? That's not fair. Oh, uh, and all the silk went on the other side. All right, we got this one anyway. All right, we're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. It's all good. All right, we're going to need another hand bat here too before this spoils. Um, we'll heal up a little bit. Alright, um, let's see here, let's see here. Um, we need Azure Feathers. So, my goal, right, my goal is to, why did I drop my axe? Did I seriously drop the axe? Am I that silly? What, what did I even gain from dropping it? Is the real question, actually. Oh, there it is. Yeah, I totally just dropped it. Why? 
Um, your your answer is as good as mine. I have no clue. All right. Let's find a good rainforest tree, and let's just go ahead and get to chopping. We need boards. So boards are what we're going to get. Yet. There is the purple gem over on Pinnacle Island. But there also is a bishop we can take on. Over on Palace Island. So the choice is really up to us. On what we want to do. Is this going to be a stream-only playthrough? Um, technically, yes. I'm not going to post this as a video. However, the background footage of fighting the bosses and whatnot are going to go on the How to Survive series. It won't be like, you know, the 100 Days of Summer, where it's the whole stream condensed. It's just going to be background footage. So technically, this is a stream-only playthrough. Right, I kind of want to make a hand bat before that go the meat goes bad. And then we'll need boards. And charcoal. Alright. Should be good to go now. Let's just get a, a one more board's worth. Yeah, dude. Best best mob in the game alert. Best mob in the game, dude. Best thing to ever grace this... Ah, oh, dude. Hey, can you attack the pig guy? I think that would be very cool of you. Oh, about time you get here. You're going to set my logs on fire, and I'm going to be very upset with you. Okay. Good. He didn't. <laughs> I think I misunderstood what time my plans were at. Uh, it's all good. We fought the Pugilisk, but that's that's all we did so far. That's all we did. And then telelocator requires manipulator. That's what I assume. That is what I assume. So we're going to need more purple gems regardless. All right. So let's see. We're going to need another board. And then which bird drops azure feathers? Is it this guy up here? I think this one looks like it would drop azure feathers. That dropped Crimson Feathers. Okay, so, no. Which one drops Azure Feathers? One of them's gotta drop Azure Feathers. Pigeons, I bet. Pigeons definitely have to drop Azure Feathers. No way they do not. I'm just taking a wild guess here, by the way. But they gotta. Where's... Dude, the one time you want to see pigeons, they're nowhere. At all. There they are. Oh, and of course, he dropped a morsel. Alright, looks like it's nighttime. So, we have to put this on pause because pigeons don't like the dark. Oh, that was so annoying. Anyways, we're going to need the purple gem. Uh, there is a purple gem over on Pinnacle Island. Over here. There is one purple gem. I know that. And technically, we can get over to Pinnacle Island pretty easily if we go through the cave clef. But we have to go to Palace Island anyway for that, so... Yeah. Isn't this just a lot of fun? Alright, I guess while we're waiting here, I'll look it up to make sure pigeons drop them. Uh, let's see.
You guys like this uh, city ambience right here? We're just chilling. We are just chilling. Should I bring the Iron Hulk to Swinesbury? Will that will it like level the town? That'd be crazy. Can I even bring it to Swinesbury? That's the question. Telelocator kit requires shadow manipulator, right? I don't know. I don't normally mess with the magic tab a lot. Because normally I get a hand bat and I'm happy, so. We're just waiting for pigeons to come back. Alright, where's my pigeons? There's my pigeons. Okay, I did catch it though. Mm-hmm. What is that noise? You hear the strange... What is that noise? That's the pigs? There's one. Alright, we got one azure feather. One azure feather. I know we could go to the hunter shop, but... Oh, dude, come on. Don't make me make another boomerang. I'll be very upset. The one time I don't want morsels. Give me feathers. Give me feathers. I shouldn't need to make the focus, though, right? Because it'll just send the... It'll just send him to a random spot on this island. If I don't make a focus, right? Although it's probably a good idea to make a focus. Alright. Time to rename the stream. Watch me boomerang pigeons for six hours straight, I guess. Or look for pigeons, my goodness. Hello? There's one. Oh my god. No way. We have to make another boomerang now. That's so annoying. Oh, that's so annoying. Oh, what? It it had more in it. Okay. I thought it was at 10%. Yeah, I know the focus requires uh, purple gems to run. I didn't want to make the focus because, you know, that's an extra step. But I'll make it if we need to. I'm not too worried about it. Let's see. Okay, well, we've got one piece over here. One piece here. So that's... Okay, we got the body. One of the legs. Or is that a leg? Leg, arm. Um... The head's glitched out down here. Uh, over here is probably where the other ones are, then. We've got a leg, and then... Ah, there's the arm. So there's all five pieces. Or six, I think. Yeah. We've got all six pieces. They're somewhat near each other. Which isn't bad. But we need the Azure Feathers. Here we go. Here we go. Aha, finally. All right. Good riddance. My goodness. All right, we're going to need more wood. Here we go. Oh, there we go. There's a full-grown tree. Actually, it's probably better to just take down two medium-sized trees. All right. Oh, 
Oh, dude. Best, best creature in the game. Alert. Best creature in the game. Alert. Dude. So much fun, this creature. So much fun. Very fun. Alright, anyways, it's time to make the thing. The first step, which is the Hogus Porkitator. Which we will put right here next to our alchemy engine. Now we need the Shadow Manipulator. Yeah, we're gonna need the Shadow Manipulator. And then the... we. I don't think we're gonna need the Focus, right? Am I going to teleport the Iron Hulk? Yes, uh, I need to. I wasn't going to at first because I'm, I'm going to fight him on the first island, which you're not supposed to do. You're supposed to teleport him to Pinnacle Island, but I'm just fighting him. So it's, it's not like this is a long term world where I want to farm the Iron Hulk. Uh, I just want to fight him. So I'm going to fight him on the first island, but his head spawned off the map. Yeah. So that's really cool. Really cool indeed. So now we're stuck making a shadow manipulator, which we need nightmare fuel for. Of course. Why wouldn't we? We also need living logs. So I think it's time to head over to the palace island after I go grab some of my iron. If I don't use the focus, we'll keep wasting time. Well, technically, as long as I get the head into like one of these parts, I can just lead him to where I want him to go, right? Alright. I'll probably use the focus, though. Just because. Um, here, let's, let's get our money, let's get our iron, let's make shears, and then let's head to Palace City, where we will buy everything. In fact, I'm gonna make two shears, because I'm just that crazy, guys. Alright, I'm gonna eat this taffy, because it's so cool. Alright, we'll head to Palace City soon. First, I'm going to start gathering hedges. We need lots of money. Or at least I want lots of money. So, there's that. Uh, where's the other hedges? I think they're over here. No clue why the pig workers always sleep on the floor. They should have houses. All right. So far, so good. I think there's a hedge over here. No, I don't think there is actually. This this island sucks for hedges. That's for sure. All right, let's head to the palace city. It's over here. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I was talking about. Pinnacle Island. You're supposed to set you're supposed to bring him to Pinnacle Island. Because then he'll just spawn all of his pieces at Pinnacle Island. Which you know what I'll I'll do. I have to make the focus anyway, so. I have to make the focus anyway, so I might as well fight him in Pinnacle Island. But, again, I didn't want to because this is not a long-term world. This is a tutorial world. Oh, whoa. I didn't realize that we still had bats over here. But, I mean, I can fight him in Pinnacle Island. Just to show that off. Dude. Annoying. Very annoying. Oh, where did my lantern go? I would like to know. Alright. All 
All right. Let's get to moving. We're going to need nightmare fuel. Which, unfortunately, m probably means that we're going to have to go insane. I almost just got shot. <laughs> did I go the wrong way? I did. I went the wrong way. That is not the way I go. All right, we're getting there. Can I shear these? No. Uh, yeah, it's this way. Nice. All right, we are at Pig Palace Island. Wonderful. All right, let's get out of this jungle. I love bullying these guys. I'm so mean. I'm so mean. <laughs> that I did know about the uh, bird naughtiness. That's the reason why uh, in my guide, I specifically said to find a plains biome because that way it's guaranteed to get uh, blue birds or red birds. Because crows take forever if you want to spawn Krampus. All right, let's get some money. Let's get some money. Lots of money to be had on this island. All right. Lush season isn't that bad. If you get nettles, you're fine. Without nettles, though, so, like, the first lush season sucks. But once you get nettles, you're pretty good. You're pretty good. Life will be not too hard. The only problem is I don't know if there's a shopkeep NPC on this island. Does this island have shopkeep NPCs? Oh, it does. Wonderful. All right, we're going to get a ton of hedges then. Get a ton of money. Because there's a lot of money to be had right now. It's been a good time. See you another... Ah, uh, see you, Klein. Am I building two focuses or teleporting all his parts separately? Well, I want to just teleport the head. That's all I want to do. I didn't want to teleport him at all. <laughs> yeah, I didn't want to teleport him at all. I just wanted to fight him. I didn't want to do all this teleporting gonna slow me down immensely especially if I want to fight the uh, ancient herald which I don't know if I'll have time to do today if we have to do all this all right we're getting some money This is very fun. Very entertaining, I know. Why not use a razor to shave the plants, I'm assuming, is what you meant? Um, that's because it only gives you one clipping, if I remember correctly. And I want as many clippings as possible. Ah, uh, where he almost got robbed, question mark? Alright. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that only gives you one clipping. So it's... 
it, it's a lot less money. Yeah. I'd rather deal with losing a little bit of the iron than not get as much money as possible. Okay. So now, what shops are here that we can go to that'll have what we need? The weapon shop sucks. Everything there is a scam. Uh, that, that's all I know. I actually am working on a Hamlet economy guide, too. So, that, that should be fun. Once I get that out. Uh, okay. These are... Nightmare amulet might be worth it. We can get nightmare fuel that way. That might be worth it. Dark Sword's a scam, because that's way too expensive. But Nightmare Amulet? Hold on. I don't... Oh, okay. I'm just buying it. I'm just buying it, dude. I'm not I'm not even going to think about it. It's probably a terrible trade, but I'm not even going to think about it. Okay. Uh... Are you using Spotify for the background music? Which playlist? I'm not, actually. I just compiled a... I compiled a... What's it called? A Windows playlist of music that I've downloaded. So, it's... It's all, like, random music. Some of it I made myself on, like... GarageBand, you know. Something simple. But the other stuff, like this song right now is not, I did not make this one. This one's from YouTube's audio library. So that way I know it's copyright free. <laughs> but I only made sure to add things that kind of went along with the Don't Starve vibe at least. Alright, so we got Nightmare Amulet. That gets Nightmare... Okay, we need to go to the Oddity store. I don't know what I'm doing. Oddities. That's good. I'm glad you like it. This was kind of like a test for me to see if the background music was better. Because that way, you know, because normally when I stop talking, it's like silent and kind of awkward. But now it's not. Okay. So he's not selling anything worth it here. The Mandrake's cool, but not, not terribly useful. What, are you kicking me out now, man? Uh, living logs. We gonna need living logs, which we can get from the mandrakes. We can get that from the mandrakes. So, let's head over to Mandrake City over here. Alright. Now, if we can make it while they're still out, I'm assuming they'll still be out and about during nighttime. Yeah, they're here. Oh, nice. They're already getting caught. Oh, dude, this is awesome. Okay. Hold on. Let's join in the battle real quick. There's some living logs, and everybody's asleep. All right. Uh, where did he run off to? Where did he run off to? Here we go. Here we go. Okay. It's calling me compost, dude. I just dropped the wrong item. All right. Beautiful. All right. That should be enough living logs. If I'm correct. Does Hamlet have seasonal bats? No. And that's one of the reasons Hamlet is probably one of the easier DLCs when it comes to like survivability. Well, that, that's a lie. It's not 
easy when it comes to survivability because of the fact that all of these creatures are out to get you. But, holy moly. Ouchie. Alright, come here. Call me compost one more time, dude. They make the same noise as the bunny men. I find that pretty funny. But yeah, to answer your question, there are not seasonal... There are not seasonal uh, bats. Alright, so we got enough living logs now. We can use the nightmare amulet to go insane. Should get going. Alright, I will see you. I will see you. Glad you could catch the stream again. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, this is looking like it's going to be a long one. This is looking like it's going to be a long one. We should also head to the BFB's island. Just to grab the purple gem. Alright. It looks like it's a straight shot. Dude, I don't want the fern. I wanted to... Oh, that's because there's no door there. What am I doing? Whoa. What? Wait, what is this? What is this? Oh, this is the Pinnacle Island. Okay. Yeah. Uh, duh. Okay. <laughs> I was like, what? what is this? Oh, it's the thing that I'm going to go to. My goodness. Dummy. Alright. What is this, guys? What what is what is this thing? Hmm. Alright, let's get out of here. And boom. We are good to go. Alright, so we've got a purple gem. I think you only need, well, we'll need multiple purple gems. So, you know what I might do real quick? I might go fight the bishop over here, because I know there's a bishop. But first, I want to heal a little bit. I do have slightly low health, but you know what? I should be fine. I should be fine. We're just going to go for it. Alright, we're good. We got two purple gems. If we want to make the focus, though, we're going to need more. So, let's... Sorry, Pog. Alright. There we go. Oh, now we got some purple gems and gears. So, it works out in the end. But not enough quite yet. Not enough quite yet. That is the unfortunate truth. Okay, so we have three purple gems. Yeah, we need two gems for the staff and three gems for each time I want to use the focus. We also need gold, we need nightmare fuel, we need all types of stuff that's not fun at all to think about. So let's go ahead and head back to Swinesbury. Oh, I forgot, we're gonna need to clear through the stupid vines. Yuck! I, I don't like this mechanic. I feel like the vines, like, I wish there was a way to just... I wish there was a way to permanently clear the vines. Because that's probably my... Ow! Yuck. I gotta remember that. Don't step on the suspicious stone. I could weigh them down, but, like, eh, I'm lazy. That's my excuse for everything. I'm lazy. I'm lazy. 
Dude, where did these bats come from? Hello? Who put these here? It's okay, look, they're stuck behind the brambles because they don't know how to fly over them. <laughs> oh, we're getting allergies, and I don't have any nettles. That's not fun. Now we're at the not fun part of lush season, where I will need to cut down tea trees or suffer the wrath of insanity. Or I could just chill around my nettle factory. Yeah, we're about to sneeze here any second. Um, Let's just chill around the nettle factory. And let's just hope they bloom. Alright. Um, do we have the ability to make light, though? I don't know. No, they're not. I'm pretty sure that means they're not ready yet. Oh, uh, yep, here comes the fun. Here comes the fun, guys. We have any tea trees. I cut them all down, dude. I deforested the entire tea trees. All of them. They're all gone. There are no tea trees. I actually think I did, like take out all of the tea trees. Can't even craft, dude. Alright. Um, pickaxe can stay on the ground for now. Well, I mean, we have to go insane anyway. Right? We have the nightmare amulet, but like... <laughs> oh. Yuck. Alright, well... Sometimes in Don't Starve, Reign of Giants, the caves desync. Yeah, I, I have experienced that firsthand, and it's not fun. It'll reset your season sometime, and it's not great. It's really messy with a. Uh... What is, what is asthma? In Hamlet? What is that supposed to mean? I'm confused. Alright, we're sneezing. We're sneezing. We are sneezing. Woo! Sneezing. Alright. Anyways. Um. Do we have nettles? Do we have nettles? No. That's what it means, I guess. <laughs> Alright. You know what? We're gonna go insane. But, like... That was the goal, right? Like, let's be real. That was kind of the goal. We can go get lotus flowers to become sane again after we're done with our bout of insanity. But, let's be real. This was our goal. So, like, I guess we're okay. Let's just make some meatballs and enjoy the insanity. Uh, it's just annoying dropping everything. Alright. And, three, two, one. Insanity. Alright. So, using this, we should be able to fight. Yeah, here we go. Alright. Nope, wrong one. Wrong one, genius. Uh, see, sneezing while fighting is not preferable. <laughs> but we gotta do this. We need the nightmare fuel. Oh my goodness, dude. Can you send not two terror beaks at once, please? Alright. It's okay. I can handle. At least I think. <laughs> oh no, I'm gonna sneeze. 
I sneezing. All right, we 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 probably shouldn't fight the used two monster meats and two bones. Yeah, I probably should try to preserve this, but yeah, there we go. This is a lot more manageable. Oh no. Yep, there they go. Um, yeah, I should go make that dish. It'll heal me a little bit. It'll heal me. Oh, dude. We're having so much fun right now. All right, let's do two monster meat, two snake bones. And there we go. We'll start making some snake bone soup. This is the part of Lush Season I do not enjoy. And I'm sure nobody enjoys it. But if you prepare well enough, then you're pretty much fine. I, however, did not fully prepare. So, I only got enough nettles to last, like, most of the season. Alright. Ooh, yummy. All right, we'll make a bit more snake bone soup. And then... Delicious. I didn't replant those tea trees. No. I did not, because I didn't think I was going to continue playing on this world. Because this is... Um, uh... Are they non-renewable and lush? No, they're renewable. I just cut them all down. Unfortunately. Very unfortunately. I cut them all down. Because I thought I was only going to be in this world for one year. Okay. Calm down. We're done sneezing. We're done. We're done with it. We're done with it. Alright, here. Can we... Make this guy mad at us. Alright. Oh, see. That's the problem. Um, let's see here. Uh, we're gonna have to utilize this fully. Ah, oh, come on. I thought I could get another hit on him. I just hate that it instantly spawns a terror beak. Okay, this is, uh, we're not farming nightmare fuel very effectively, but we're also sneezing. I gotta, I could kite them if I wasn't sneezing. So we might just have to wait, because it's temperate season right now, I believe. But we're still in the final few days where we're still sneezing. You know what? I'm taking it out on these tea ghosts. Actually, this tea tree's full. Hold on. Dude, holy moly. Sneezing is annoying. This tea tree's full. Are you mad at me? No. No way that guy just came down to steal the... Who took my football helmet? Why is there a football helmet in here? Hold on. You're coming back here. What do you have? Oh, he took an axe. Alright, you know what? We're just gonna get some temporary... Who took a purple gem, too? Whoa. Oh, I sneezed it out, I guess. Dude, no way. What did he take? Alright. All right, nettles question mark. They are not grown at all. 
unfortunately. But we'll keep the sprinkler on to hopefully, hopefully do something with them. I'm not hopeful, though. I'm everything but hopeful. If you're going to attack me, Terabeak, just attack me. My goodness. All right, we're going we're gonna to place down a fire. Right where we can watch everything. Okay. We're going to cook one of these. I said we're going to... I said we're going to cook one of these. Eat it. There we go. We have some time now. We have some time now. Let's do this. This is a good turf to do this on, too. Alright. I don't want to keep swapping it out because they'll just disappear. Every time I swap it out, they just disappear. So, I want to just focus down. Here we go. This works. I can do two of these guys very easily. We only need, what, like seven or so? That was just not fair, but whatever, game. Oh, no. We're getting sick again. Oh, no. Okay. Okay, honestly, um... Not with another Terabeak. No, we can't handle another Terabeak. These guys are all going to disappear now. Yeah, see, they're all going to disappear. Oh, here we go. Okay. Okay. They're actually not disappearing. This is great. Hold on. We're going to need to... Oh, we don't have... Oh, we actually don't have anything light-wise. This is actually a dangerous situation. You know what? We can just make another log suit. I said... What? Okay. There we go. Woo! Dude, what? Stop with the what what are you doing? What is that? You guys saw that, right? Okay. 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 Cool. Very cool. Very cool, dude. Can this allergies thing stop now? I'm beginning to be annoyed by it. Significantly. Alright, we're just gonna wait here. I don't want to claw my eyes out anymore. Yes! Okay, we're gonna turn this off then. We're done with the sneezing. So now we're going to fight. All right, now we can fight and I'm not worried about getting hit at all. Like this makes it so much easier. Even with two terror beaks, I can I can handle. As long as I'm not sneezing. Boom, boom. Okay, three might be a stretch, but it's okay because we we still got it. What? Who said you could hit again? Okay, yeah, three is an issue, though. Like, kind of. Oh, dude, this is kind of nuts. Oh, no, we lost it. Okay, 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 hold on, hold on. All right, all right, all right, calm down, buddy. Calm down, pal. Calm down, calm down. Calm down, calm down. All right. Uh, 
Ah. Uh. Yeah. Yeah. I did I did use up the amulet though because I yep, there we go. Unless we can re-aggro. I did not know they would re-aggro. That's kind of cool. We have no armor though. We need to be careful. I want to get this terror beak out of the way. Okay. Nice. All right. Yeah, I should have done this. I didn't know they would they would re-aggro. Oh, there we go. Okay. I should have done this. Anyways, we got a lot of nightmare fuel. I think we got enough to make the shadow manipulator. So that's good. That's good. As long as we got that much, we're good. As long as we got that much, we're good. At least we should be. Oh, yeah, I did have a fancy helmet. I, I've had this in my inventory the whole time. <laughs> I've had that in my inventory the whole time. And I just haven't used it. It does make me slower, so that's why I just... I don't like using it, but it is in my inventory, and I gotta stop forgetting about it. Alright, Shadow Manipulator, done. What's next? Um, telelocator staff. We need one more nightmare fuel. One more. A singular nightmare fuel. A singular nightmare fuel. I'm going to hope that I didn't pick up the one over here. Because we are pretty sane right now. I don't know why. Which is unfortunate. Because I think I picked up the nightmare fuel. We can go to ends well. But... Yeah, I can catch the small squirrels. I know you can make tea with them, but I don't need to make tea with them. Alright. I did not want to eat the rot, okay? Dude, this game needs to learn my inputs. Because they're clearly not the right inputs. Alright. We're almost ready. We're almost ready. We just need one more... Nightmare fuel. One more. A single nightmare fuel. Oh, my goodness. Alright, we're gonna eat a little bit more snake bone soup. We should be good to go. It's getting late. Yuck. Alright, give me give me the snake bone soup. I'm gonna put it in here. Then we're gonna eat the meatballs. Don't you need the orange picos though? To make tea with them? I'm pretty sure you need the orange picos, not just any pico. If I'm correct. Alright. Um. Let's see. We need nightmare fuel. Which means we again have to go insane. Which is awesome. It's awesome. Right? It's so awesome. Anyways. Uh. What would be an easy way to go insane? I guess we could... Let's 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 head up here. So we at least have the way to go not insane when we need to. I'm also going to go ahead and chop this rainforest tree. Dude, best mob in the game. Alert. Gross. Why don't I use the magical water? I'm saving it. I'm saving it. 
to make something very fun at the end of this. I need it. I know you can plant it to make a revive flower. But I'm also going for no reviving, so. Alright, we should probably take out one of these hippos. If I'm to be honest. This football helmet's broken. I'm also not wearing anything. That's pretty stupid of me. Let's put on a football helmet. And then let's... Can I... Is there a way I can separate this hippo from his friend? Come on. Come over here. Come over here. Yes. Ouchie. Not that it matters. All right. We got another hand bat now. That's nice. Um, the artifacts thing spoils in three days. Are you talking about the Pugilus skull? Because if so, then no, it does not spoil. You're thinking of the... You're thinking of the, uh... Oh, that was kind of close, actually. For no reason. You're thinking of the... What's it called? I, I'm brain farting here, dude. I'm brain farting completely. We're gonna walk through the night and try to get as little sanity as possible. Alright. Uh, you're thinking of the staff that you can make with the skull. Yeah, you're thinking of the staff. All right. Wonderful. Wonderful. All right, should we, I'm gonna save the ham bat for now. I'm not gonna make it yet. Although I might, this guy's being very annoying. You know what, I'm gonna set him on fire. I'm taking a note from the pig guards. Hey, you want to help me with this? <laughs> Ow, what just hit me? Confused? Alright, I'm making a ham bat. Sick of this. I gotta do something about this. Hey, truce for a second. I gotta go inside. Alright. That's that handled in the most annoying way possible. There's more? Where are they going? All right. There's that handled part two. Anyways, anyways, what I wanted to do previously before this happened and it was very annoying My goodness. Yeah, the, the infused iron, which I need for something fun. So, we will hopefully have lots of it. Alright, so before I do anything, I want to go up. I, I know how I can lose sanity quickly, but I want to make sure that I can gain sanity quickly when I need it as well. So... Let's go ahead and grab this canoe. Let's dump it into the water real quick. I said, let's dump it into the water. Let's drive our canoe. Let's grab some lotus. Oh, don't worry. It, it Oh, no, 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 no. No, you don't. No, you don't. No, you don't. 
You are so annoying. Dude, that that is so aggravating. I'm you're you're gone. You're gone. You get out of here. Stupid little thing, dude. Awful creature. Unbelievably annoying those things, I tell you. This one's mine, dude. Dude, heat seeking missile? Whatever. Oh wait, he left those ones? Oh, dude, get scammed. These are mine. Where do you think you're going? You're you're out of here. Yeah, I'm gathering lotuses while also fighting porcupines that for some reason think they can have them. Annoying little critters. I tell ya. What are these guys fighting? Are they fighting each other? Oh no, I thought they were fighting each other. I was very confused. Alright, well we got four lotuses. Not the best, but it works for now. Alright, it's time to go insane. Now we get to do the fun thing. We're gonna dig around and poop. It's a very quick way to make yourself insane in this game. Alright, let's go do it. Let's do it. I also like this aloe. Aloe is very pleasant. I can also eat, like, raw bean bugs and stuff we can find in the dirt. Alright. Haha. <laughs> Alright, there's one. Um, any more dung piles? Uh, got more tips for a complete beginner and don't starve shipwrecked. Okay. So, I'll, I'll talk about a few tips while we uh, make myself go insane here. The biggest thing that you need to focus on getting is for sure the uh, snakeskin hat or the umbrella, either one. And then all of the bosses in Shipwrecked are not that bad. Like, Tiger Shark is just same kiting pattern as Deer Clops. And then Seal Nato is just fighter on the ocean, and you're good to go. Never fight Seal Nato on land, though. Raw food gives spoil or gives. Oh, that's true. That's true. I could also eat monster meat, but that hurts. I want to do things that don't hurt. There we go. We're going insane. We're going insane. We're doing it. We're doing it. It's happening. Oh, there's lots of dung piles down there. Let's go. Let's go. We'll be insane in no time. But yeah, shipwrecked is honestly. In my opinion, Shipwrecked is far easier than Reign of Giants, even. Like... I don't know how I didn't get poisoned by that attack. Anyways, yeah, Shipwrecked is incredibly easy. That's true that you can stand behind rocks, but it is it glitches out very easily. And I've never trusted it. And um, if you don't play on the PC version, there's actually a hard lock that the game will do if you get sucked into Seal NATO. I've lost a 300 day world to it actually, where the game will just you get stuck inside of Seal Nato, and you you just have a bad time, pretty much. All right, we're insane now, guys. Let's set down a fire, and let's enjoy insanity. Let's also go near a poop pile, so that we can go more insane if we need to. All right, beautiful. 
Bring on the monsters. We'll dig through this one more time. So we get some more. And then I'll cook these up. There we go. All right. It's monster fighting time. Where'd he go? What do I think about making a base inside of the volcano? I think it's a good idea. Just, you have to be very careful during dry season. And I'm actually, I, I have a segment about the volcano coming out after this. But you just need to be careful during dry season. Because in dry season, if you have a volcanic eruption while you're in the volcano, it's basically like... You overheat immediately. It's so bad. But it's not a terrible idea because you can you can technically live off of everything in, in there. It's not terrible. Believe it or not. It's not bad at all. I think you could easily do it. Nice. We got some nightmare fuel. We got another monster over here. All right. Uh, Woodlegs has a boat that has infinite ammo. That is true, but Woodleg Woodlegs' boat is also very slow. Like, it's not that slow. Like, it's not raft slow, but it's also very, like, it's slow. And then he also has a... The volcano won't erupt in dry season if the sacrifice is pleased. That is true, too. And you could please it with eggs, which technically is very renewable in the in the uh, volcano. We're just going to gather a little bit more before I go back to going insane. Yeah, the best thing to use for the sacrifice altar is probably eggs. Most renewable thing, at least. In my opinion. Alright, let's get a little bit more. A little bit more. I'm gonna try just using the telelocator staff first. If we can just get the head out of the glitch that it's in... Great. That's all we need to do. We don't need to do anything else fancy. Just got to get it out of this glitch that it's in. And then we're good to go. You once got stuck inside of the volcano because you died and respawned inside it. And you drowned every time you left. That is... Yeah, that... I totally forgot that could happen. Because you didn't go in on a boat, so it wouldn't know where to put you when you left. Okay, well... Yeah, I guess I wouldn't put a, a permanent base down there. Or at least if you're going to put revive points, don't put them in the volcano, because that... That definitely could go bad. I can see that going bad. I'm just hoping when I use the telelocator staff on it, that it stays on this island. I'm really hoping that it stays on this island. Why am I collecting twigs? What am I doing with my life? All right, we don't need twigs. We need to make the telelocator staff. That's what we needed to do. What is that Thunderbird doing all the way out here? Look at him. Dummy. Oh, the pangolin. He's uh, balled up. So sad. Alright. 
Guys, it's finally time. It is finally time. After all this time, we can finally start thinking about fighting the Iron Hole. Which is probably the most con... Uh, whatchamacallit. Yeah, Woody's wear beaver mode is pretty good for fighting. I just, I could never do a long-term world as Woody. Because, like, okay, we could make the telelocator focus if we head back. We need more nightmare fuel, though. Uh, but we'll need more purple gems, too. All right, let's make the telelocator staff real quick. I just think that the converting into a wear beaver every full moon is annoying. I wish you could, like, control it every time. Because having to turn it into a werebeaver every full moon definitely gets annoying. I do not enjoy that at all. Alright, let's go see if this telelocator staff will fix our issue. At all. Ow. Really? It took the pigskin? Really? I guess it is the first thing in my inventory. Yeah, Wilba has her necklace and everything, so it's like... Why can't they do anything for Woody? Dude, where did these guys come from? Dude, I hate this battleisk AI nonsense. I'm taking you guys to the spider monkeys. Yeah, now look who messed up. The spider monkeys are mad now. Now you messed up. Now you messed up. I said in one of my community polls, I'll make a character guide. Yes, I am. And I, I actually have been working on the script. I've gotten Wilson's script and Willow's script done. So now it's just working on all the rest. Which, there's a lot. but And then I'll obviously have to get the background footage. I'll have to voice over it. You know, all that fun stuff. All right. Let's cast spells. Wonderful. Now let's play Where's Waldo. Waldo. Um, all right, guys, let's find him. Hopefully he spawns on the same island. I really hope that he does. I really hope that he does. Alright. Nope, he spawned on the palace island. Oh, boy. Yeah, I do definitely think uh, Clay should definitely add some stuff from Don't Starve Together to Solo. I think there are some things that are just way too good. Like, Woody's transformation things are awesome. And they actually make him very easy to, like, manage. Okay, so, that's an issue. That's an issue. That's a massive issue. The head is on the palace island. And shipwrecked when you use a poison gland, you won't die. I 
I think I did add that to my guide. I thought I added that to the mild season guide. Or monsoon season. Because poison mosquitoes. I'm pretty sure I added that. How it'll take away a lot of your health but not kill you. Though the, the venom cure is definitely cheap enough. That it's not that serious. Alright, guys, we might need to make the the telelocator platform. Unfortunately. I I am I am saddened to say we might need to make the telelocator focus. Which means we're gonna need to get three purple gems. No, I never said it would kill you. I said that the, uh, I said you could use it to cure poison. I'm pretty sure. I would have never said that it could kill you, because it can't. I knew that. I did recommend to not use the gland if you were in a dangerous situation, though. That's for sure. Alright. We gotta, we gotta figure this out, guys. Robin, you are very loud and silly. Okay. We got the key to the city. Am I going to keep teleporting it till it appears in the main island? I, uh, yeah, I probably should. Making the platform is, I just hope we don't run out of durability. I just hope we don't run out of durability. That's what I'm worried about. I'm worried it's going to teleport everywhere except for the main island every single time. That's what I'm worried about. But then again, like, how are we going to get purple gems? How can we get purple gems in Hamlet? How can we get purple gems easily? Um, make the focus when I have one usage left. I, I should probably just make the focus. We can get, we can get a, uh, whatchamacallit. Let's see, let's see, let's see. How can we get gems, though? Yeah, I know one red and one blue gem make a purple gem. That's art class. But... Uh, we can also hammer the shadow manipulator down. Technically. What is... Hold on, hold on. Let's see. Let's see. Um... Let's see, maybe the... No, no. Okay. Because we need three to fully charge it. Which is, we do not have three. We have zero. A, a very small amount. Alright, what I'm also going to do here is I'm going to get a free lantern. By committing crimes. Haha. <laughs> My lantern now. I did already get the bishops. That's how I got the three purple gems already. Um. If I if I had Reign of Giants, I could get a deconstruction staff. But or if I had shipwrecked, because I could use the brain of thought. That thing is overpowered. I love the brain of thought. 
Um, I am worried, guys. Okay, let's think about this realistically. Let's think about this realistically. Is there a chance that we could... Dude, why did the head have to spawn off the map? Like, that's that's what's annoying. This stream would be half the, le the length. We would have already fought the Iron Hulk and been done with it. But no, he decided to spawn off the map. A lantern loses ability and turns off, but city lanterns don't. You mean like the lanterns in the world, like these? Yeah, I know that. Um. Oh, the deconstruction staff doesn't offer gems. Yeah. Okay. That sucks. All right, we gotta we gotta do something though. We gotta. I, should we just chance it until we get down to one use left? I'm really tempted to just chance it. Play my cards. Because getting three purple gems just feels like it's gonna take like a year and a half. All right. That's true, because then you could just uh, copy gems. You could deconstruct deconstruction amulets. Or whatever they're called. Yeah, let's just chance it. There's what? A one in... There's a one in, uh, what's it called? Four chance. Or five. Five. My bad. I forgot Pugilisk Island here. So there's a one in five chance. We've got this. We, we, we can do this. We can do this. Easy. Easy. Absolutely easy. Dude, where are these bats coming from? Annoying little creatures. Alright. I can get red and blue gems from stalagmites in the caves. If if we get down to one use left. I got shot, guys. If we get down to one use left, then I will make the, the focus. I don't want to make the focus because it's going to take us forever. But. And I won't lie, my luck is not the best. Honestly. My luck is not the best. Alright. Let's get a... Whoa! How did it even hit me from there? That's my question of the day. I would like to know. Uh, oh, I'm still holding the torch. You know what? It's okay. It doesn't matter. Uh, what is this? You know, you can use the duplicate staff using the deconstruction staff and construction and... Really? Hmm. Interesting. I'll have to try that out eventually. I normally don't mess with, like, the construction amulet, the deconstruction staff, because I don't normally... I, I used to play t worlds long-term, but I don't do it much anymore. All right, come on. This time's got to be it. Please tell me it went back home, please. All right, we're going to check the other islands first. So if it's disappointing, 
then... Alright. So far, so good. So far, so good. I'm not seeing it. Alright. Come on. Last island. Biggest one, though. Um... No! That's the Apocalypse Island too, dude. Oh, my luck is so great, guys. We're just gonna be on a wild goose chase. Literally. Literally. Just on a wild goose chase. Annoying! Stop it! Dude, I am sick of this thing. I want my pig skin back! Stop! Oh my goodness, that's gonna give me a headache. Alright, alright, dude. I am... I am so aggravated right now. Of course it goes to the... Of course it goes to the hardest island to get to. Of course. Why wouldn't it? Why wouldn't it? Right? Hello? You're supposed to cut the vines again. Thank you. Alright. Alright. Yeah, I'm gonna go insane. I'm gonna go insane. Um... At this point, don't really care. I just want to fight the Iron Hulk, and this game has inconvenienced me. Massively. It has massively inconvenienced me. You know what? Oh no, I st I'm stealing your flowers. How sad. How spooky. Oh no. Oh no. Whoa. This is unheard of. Whoa. Whoa. One year in Hamlet is 34 days. But yeah, that, that, this is day 71, so we've survived a full uh, shipwrecked or reign of giants year in Hamlet. Alright, let's 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 make some food. Dude, I am so upset. I am so upset. need our gas mask we just need our gas mask all right we need a new football helmet because this one's going bad want to make sure that we have the ability to protect ourselves all right and we're gonna need some food let's make some you know what I'm just gonna start making snake bone soup it's not the best for hunger but like don't care. Yeah, yeah, it would be 35 days. It would be 35 days and regular don't starve with no DLCs. Alright. Let's get some snake bone soup made up. We have two chances. Two chances. Three snake bones and one meat should yield meatballs. Um. 
I'll test it out. I'll test it out. I, I don't really care for the longevity of this world, so if it gives me wet goop, I'm not going to be upset. Let's see. Nice! It does give me meme balls. Okay, beautiful. Beautiful. We can save the snake bone soup for healing then, if we need it. Which, let's be real, we probably will. Dude, Robin, you are loud, man. You are loud. Do I ever world hop in normal playthroughs? All the time. All the time. It's definitely the best part of single player Don't Starve. Is you can have a base in one world, and then your other world can have, like, all types of different stuff. Um, and, and, if you go to Hamlet, and you get the key to the city, you can go to Shipwrecked or Reign of Giants, and build a Hamlet city in Shipwrecked or Reign of Giants. Which is amazing to me. It's amazing. All right, let's head to the toxic rainforest. Let's head to the toxic rainforest. You can't link worlds in mobile. Oh, that's that's awful. Surprised they haven't added that. Do you guys have shipwrecked? Well, I'm assuming you do if you have, you know, if you were asking about it. You can use the Brain of Thought, that is true. The Brain of Thought is very powerful, but you have to use it correctly. Because you only get four uses, so... You would need to build, like, say... What's the shop with the guy that accepts... I don't know. You need shops that have people that accept good things for money. Then you can build, like, the Slanty Shanty and the... You know, all that fun stuff. The Brain of Thought is awesome. It is awesome. Alright. Let's move. Let's get to the stupid, the, the stupid and dumb, the stupid thing. I don't want to harvest the grass, but okay. Fine. Dude, I am sick of those scorpions. I don't know if I've said it in enough, but you guys don't have Hamlet. Ah, see that? Are you serious? Question mark. All right, we're here. We're here. It's time to... Oh, I thought I left my tele... I would have actually quit the stream. I would have actually quit the stream if I left my telelocator staff at home. That would have been the end. We would have picked this up some other time. But luckily for you guys, I brought it. Oh, that's weird. So Shipwreck is, is a totally different app. That's... Oh, that's weird. That's definitely weird. This guy being in a Thunderbird biome is dangerous. Very dangerous. Alright. We should be good. Isn't there wormholes that link between islands and Hamlet? There is not. No, you have to go through the ruins. You have to go through the ruins. Please. Please. Send it to the mainland. Alright. So far, so good. So far, so good.
Oh, come on. Oh. Oh. <gasps> yes! Yes! Oh, yeah. Guys, it's, it's Iron Hulk time. It's happening. It's happening. All right. Now we can finally get prepared to fight this thing. Although, I gotta say, we're not prepared. We've been spending the whole time trying to get the head. We need to get, like, armor. We need to get a fresh hand bat. But other than that, we'll be good. We'll be good to try. Uh, do you know how to get doi doi feathers and shipwrecked without having to kill two of them? Okay, so you can actually pick up doi doi's when they're sleeping at night. So when they're sleeping, you can pick them up and then you drop them on the same island and they will reproduce. And then you can, you know, have them as a farm and do with what you would like. Though, in my own opinion, doi doi's aren't, aren't like the best thing in the game. Like you can certainly live without ever encountering them and you'll be fine. Like they're not that helpful. They're cool, but they're not like crazy good. Dude, no way. I I hate these things. All right, I don't ever plan on coming back to this island except for the apocalypse. I don't know if we're going to fight the Ancient Herald in this video, guys. It's just we've taken far too long. I don't know if we'll fight the Ancient Herald or not. Perhaps we will, but... You use them to farm for Krampus. That is true. You could technically bring them over to Reign of Giants. Like, bring one over and then kill it. And it will count as a full 50 naughtiness. Since it's technically endangered in Reign of Giants. But... Uh, it should be good. Should be good. Should be good. Alright, this football helmet is at 2%. Where did it go? Oh, yeah, we're wearing it. I don't want a 2%er on me. Alright, we need to make some log suits. And we just need to get ready. We just need to get ready. Alright, we've got this now. It's in the bag. Now we just have to survive the battle, and we're good. We're straight up good. As long as we survive the battle. Which, who knows if we will. Oh, vipers. Um, vipers are not venomous. Alright, you know what? Let them fight that guy. Not my problem. Their feathers are also really good for sacrifice. That is true. That is true. Their feathers are pretty good for sacrifice. I find eggs to be much easier to get, though, in my opinion. I find eggs to be far easier to get. Yeah, that glomer farming method is kind of insane. Look at that. Look at this head. It's with us now. Beautiful. All of that work, and it finally turned out good. So now, it's time to fight the Iron Hulk, everybody. Yeah, the Krampus farming was in stream two. Although, if you don't want to watch through the whole stream... Next Friday, not tomorrow, but next Friday, 3 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, I'll be releasing a fully edited version that includes that Krampus method. So, that should be very fun. 
All right. We need lots of rope. I would like to get two log suits if possible. I could make nightmare armor, I guess, but I also don't want to go insane. So log suits and football helmet is going to have to work. Oh, best creature in the game alert. Best creature in the game alert, guys. Did I tell you? They don't ever give up, either. My goodness. You love the shipwreck title theme song? I do, too. It's really nice. My only... The only thing that sucks about Don't Starve on PC and console is we only have the the we only have the hamlet theme because you know hamlet was the most recent one will i credit you when you show the cramp i uh yes yes i will i've already added that segment so don't worry you get you get proper crediting <laughs> it's all good it's all good all right, guards, can you deal with these things, please? I really just don't want to deal with these things. Most foul, most foul. All right. Hey, pig guards, I got some friends for you. No way that hit me twice. That's annoying. I could deal with them right now, but like... I'm just... I can't be bothered. This guy, I might though. He's being annoying. Alright, we're gonna eat a snake bone soup. Alright, get stuck on the hedge. Oh, now you wanna be smart and pathfind. Stupid. Alright, alright, we're good now. We're good now. So, let's get our log suit. We got two log suits. We're gonna get some more football helmets. Let's just get some more grass. You guys can also delete Hamlet if you don't play it much. Um, yeah, yeah, that's that's true, that's true. But then you miss out on all the Hamlet stuff. So like, why would you do that? You like the summer and mild season work modes? Hey, look, at least you don't like the spring one, because. You never hear the spring one, because it's always dusk. I hate that it stops during dusk. I wish the work music played whenever you were, like, doing work. Alright, football helmets. Yes, please. Alright. Guys, we are looking good. We've got log suits. We've got football helmets. We don't need this gas mask anymore for now. We've got lanterns, we've got snake bone soup. Let's go make some more snake bone soup. And then another ham bat, and it'll be time to go. Yeah, I, I wish it played through dusk and night. Kind of like the rainforest uh, song does in Hamlet. Kind of like that. I wish that was just permanent but nope nope we don't get nice things all right this is good this is good let's make some more snake bone soup
And then I'm gonna make another ham bat. Dude, my room is a mess. Holy moly. All right, we got the ability to make another ham bat. You get PTSD from the spring song. Oh, that that was I made meatballs. Whoops, my bad. Oh well. Let's just act like I pretend. Let, let's pretend that I meant to do that. The summer showdown is the most exciting one for sure. That is, it, it is a pretty uh, upbeat song. It is pretty insane. It is pretty insane. All right. This should be enough snake bone soup. After we get one more. One more. Then we'll be good to go. Let's keep the gold in our backpack. We'll keep the gears in our backpack. Um, some pigskin we'll keep up here. Yeah, I'm going to make four soups. Don't worry. I meant like this should make enough for us. I don't know if we have the monster meat to make another one. We could use we could use regular meat, but eh, it's fine. It's fine. We're good. We're good. We're going to be fine. This will be a piece of cake, guys. Nobody's ever failed to the Iron Hulk ever. All right, should we assemble them all where the head is and then just like just have the fight happen right outside of the uh, city. Dude, what are these two doing? <laughs> I should take the magic water. Look, I'm, g I'm gonna use the magic water. Don't worry. I'm gonna use the magic water. If we get time, if I get time, which I probably will. I like doing these streams long anyway. We'll go to the Apocalypse. We will go to the Apocalypse and we will we will fight the Ancient Herald. We will fight the Ancient Herald and it'll be crazy. But I'm going to use the magic water, don't worry. I'm going to use it. I promise. All right. There we go. Alright, come with me, friend. Let's go. Come on. Oh, dude. He is so cool. Alright, let's make sure we keep aggro. Oh, uh, bye-bye. Alright. Let's keep this train going. Wake back up. We're not done yet. I should have definitely brought more pickaxes. Oh, dude, this poor pig guard has no clue what's about to happen. <laughs> yes, let's keep moving. All right. Look at that. We have one piece merged. One piece. All right. Should we go for the ones on the left or the right first? You know, let's go make a gold pickaxe. Why not? The infused iron takes two days. We'll be fine. We'll be fine. It takes two days to spoil. Alright, let's get the last of the pieces that are on this side before we go to the other side. No, it's not a problem of them losing aggro. They just, uh, they turn off. 
Hey, it's a bandit stash map. That's cool. That's pretty cool. Alright. Yeah, they turn off. Don't shoot, don't shoot, don't shoot. Okay. Alright, let's get the body. The body is definitely the... This, this piece right here is probably the most lethal piece. I'm pretty sure it shoots lasers. So, like... We're going to be in trouble if this thing decides to be mad. All right. Let's go. Yep, it's mad. Yeah, I'm pretty sure if I get close to it, it's going to shoot a laser. Yeah. <laughs> All right. That laser does a ridiculous amount of damage, if I remember correctly. Alright, good night again. Let's do this again. He's gonna take the longest time, too. We should have taken everything to the body, but... Oh, well. Not that big of a deal. Yeah, that, that laser attack, though, does a obscene amount of damage. Oh, he's not mad at me anymore. Oh, well. We'll let him do his thing. Here, you know what? Thunderbird, activate him. There we go. That works for me. No, be mad at me. Holy moly. Alright, come on. Let's go. Let's move. Aw, oh, he's, he's gonna get distracted by everything, though. Look at that, dude. He's insane. Woo! Alright. This is definitely the most lethal part of moving this guy. Oh. Nope. Not good night yet. Let's keep it moving, buddy. Yeah! Oh. Oh, it doesn't do that much. But he... Okay, it stuns... Okay, that was terrible. Why'd I keep getting hit by that? I'm not even fighting the boss yet. Hey. Dude, the gnats aren't gonna die from you. You need to come after me. <laughs> it's okay, though, guys. We got snake bone soup. We got the soup. We got the soup. Alright. Come on. Come on. Don't go to bed yet. Keep being mad at me. So he, he switches aggro every time he does that, that little animation. Or if that happens. Alright, let's do this again. Wake up. Alright, shoot your laser. Yep. Come on. Let's get him away from the pig city before he does a rampage. Although I wouldn't... Dude, that scorpion just got annihilated. Ooh! Oh, come on. Come on. For real, for real. Alright, this is going to take the longest for sure. All right, shoot your laser real quick so I know you're mad at me. And let's go. Let's get a move on. We're almost there. We're almost there. Stay mad at me. No, stay mad at me. Yes, be mad at me. No! Oh, good night. Alright, shoot your little laser at me so I know you're mad at me. There we go. We're so close. You! So close. Come on. Come on. We're so close, buddy. Stop giving up. 
Glad we got this piece out of the way, though. What's the hardest boss in Hamlet? Definitely the Hulk. Definitely the Hulk. That's why I saved him for last. He has the most interesting attacks. Let's just say that. It's combined with all of the body pieces. Alright. Welcome to your home. There we go. Alright. Body's done. That's the hardest one. Alright. All right, we'll need to make another football helmet, too. Maybe make a coffee. Yeah, you're right. I'm probably going to make a coffee. I'll have to head to the mud spa, then. I have enough money to make coffee, so it's not that big of a deal. Um. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. All right. Another thing that I'm worried about is how far away is humid season. That didn't sound good. At all. Uh, dude, that, this would be awful. If this was a long-term world, this would feel so bad right here. Like, it would, that would actually be awful. Luckily, this isn't a long-term world, so it's not that big of a deal. Alright, this is an arm. There we go. Wake up. Alright, I... Let's see, what does the arm do? Laser as well. Okay. Arm is laser as well. No, you're mad at me. Stay mad at me. Come on, let's go. Oh, he just got mad at the Thunderbird for... Oh no, he didn't. Hey, Thunderbird, you wanna... Thank you. Very helpful. No, you're mad at me. Yikes! Oh my goodness, I've never clenched so hard. Not that it would kill me or anything, it's just spooky. Alright, so the arms are super slow too, unfortunately. Yeah, owza. Oh, Come on. Come on. Come on. Stay mad at me? Yes. I'm just worried humid season's gonna come in. And if humid season comes in, then we're actually kinda screwed. Not gonna lie. I wasn't paying attention. Whoopsie doodles. We're going to go through, like, all of our football helmets before we even start this fight. Alright, I just want to stay close to him so he doesn't get enraged on the globe. Flies! Wow, dude. A double attack? Alright. Ow. This thing's got some range. Stay mad at me. No, you're supposed to stay mad at me! Stay mad at me, right now. No, 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 no. Oh, down he goes. Yes, wake up. Oh, my, I can't understand his range. He's got more range than I thought. All right, we gotta take him up here. That's a lot of range. Alright, you're mad at me, right? We're so close. We're so close. Alright, we're almost there. Wow. Well, there goes one of our football helmets. Alright. 
Come on, you gotta be close enough. That's not close enough? Alright, this has to be close enough. Alright, there you go. Whoa, here we go, guys. It's almost here. I'm just very worried about, um, I'm actually incredibly worried about, uh, what's it called? Humid season. I don't want humid season coming and ruining everything. Where's the last, oh, dude, the last leg is so far. Good thing it's a leg. The arms and the torso are the hardest parts. The legs are pretty fast. All right, let's go. Come on. Come on. He has a long range, dude. But I have to stay somewhat closer. That happened. All right, come on. Oh. This is going to take a year and a half. But luckily, he's not that far. All right, be mad at me. Yes. Come on. Let's go. Let's go. Yep. That happened. I just don't want him to do that. Ugh. Be mad at me. Oh. Dude, this guy is so annoying. How much iron do I need to take out of him? It won't be able to hit me if I'm too close. I feel like that's false information. Oh. No, he can. He can definitely hit me. He just has to aim closer. It depends on where he aims. Alright, we're so close. Come on. Come on. No. Yes, you're very... Ah! Dude, I hate that he can just queue up attacks like that. That's so weird. Alright, we're almost there, guys. Hello? Okay. We're gonna need another pickaxe. All right, he's gonna queue up an attack. No, he's not. See, I, I don't understand the attack pattern. All right, come on, come to your body. There we go. One more, one more, and we're in business. Let's make another opulent pickaxe. We're also going to need another ham bat, though we should probably go make some coffee. Alright, sorry if I'm not reading chat too much. I'm kind of focused. I want to get this done before humid season hits. I'm a little worried we won't be able to do it before then. I'm a little worried. Yeah, I know I know how to dodge his attack. I know how to dodge his, his attack, but sometimes he hits me with a double whammy, and I'm not sure how to handle that. Bad at kiting. Mmm, my friend. How rude. Alright. You know what? I'm going to swap out the meat, because we're almost ready. And I want to make sure that we're good to go. Um, I'm also going to go ahead and just make a meaty stew. Oh, I just com combined the stacks. I'm so stupid. That should be meaty stew right there. Um, and then... Let's see here. Alright. We've got plenty enough to make more football helmets if we need it. Okay. All 
Alright, we'll take our money. And then I'm going to go ahead and head over to the... Before they close, I want to head to the mud spa to get some coffee. Of course, no coffee is being sold, but I'll take healing items, too. I'm not uh, afraid of healing items. Unless they're anti-venom, dude. I'm literally not needing anti-venom at all. You know what? I'll buy it. I'm just going to start buying everything until she gives me coffee. There we go. There we go. Beautiful. Yes, keep it coming. Keep it coming. <laughs> there we go. That's two coffee. That's two coffee. All right. All right. Now well, let's go make some coffee. And then it's fighting time. And we'll see what happens. All right. We'll actually cook these green caps. Um... Do we still have honey? Oh, we don't. Can I use an egg to make coffee? I'm pretty sure I can. I'm pretty sure I can. Let's try it anyway. Worst case scenario, whoopsie doopsie. I guess. Doesn't everybody love eggs with their coffee? No, that made uh, whatever this is. Fruit medley. All right. Well, that is upsetting, actually. Um, we'll have to go back now to grab some more coffee. Whoopsies. We're fine. We're fine. We're we're still speed running. Uh, maybe take poultice. No, I'm not gonna take the poultice because it's gonna clog up my inventory. Am I playing an Xbox Series S or X or one? I'm playing on Xbox Series X. That is what I'm. I'm I am playing on. Alright, I'm gonna have to make the ham bat now before this meat spoils anymore. Hey, I'm back. Give me what I need. I need coffee. 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 Are you kidding me? Oh, I guess we're doing this without coffee. Oh, ice. We could use ice. Okay. We have one oink, too. So, that's... Thank you for that knowledge. We can also use blue caps to heal. It's That's pretty good. I guess we will be taking poultices, after all. Alright, let's head to the grocery store. We only need one coffee, anyway. So, we're good. We're good. One coffee should last the entirety of the boss fight. As long as we're not stupid. Alright, I'm gonna drop one of these. I'm going to make a ham bat. And then I'm going to make coffee. Iced coffee, apparently. And then I'm going to cook these green caps so we're max sanity for the beginning of the fight. There we go. Whoo! All right. All right. And then I'm going to leave the twigs and grass at home. No. Oh. Ice does not work. It makes fruit medley. It makes fruit medley. There will be no coffee for this fight, apparently. I swear, I thought other things than honey worked, but I guess not. I guess not. You have to use four, uh, you have to use four things. We can do it without, uh, coffee. It's just going to be stressful and engaging and fun, right? Like, we'll have lots of fun, I think. 
We'll have lots of fun. I'm not I'm not upset about not having coffee. We can we we can make it work. Two coffee and two honey work. I think you need three. I think you need three. If I'm correct. But then again, I also thought you could use eggs, so. I thought you could put eggs in your coffee. Uh, so you might not want to listen to me. Because I think eggs and coffee is reasonable, apparently. It is most certainly not reasonable. Let's do this. We got this. Worst case scenario, we take him into the pig town. And just... <laughs> um... Have fun. I'll need a pickaxe too, because I know he builds walls that you need to actually break out of. So that's something we'll have to we'll have to definitely keep in mind. Why would you add butter to your coffee? Dude, look at this guy just enjoying his time. Oh, poor little guy is about to get demolished. Alright, these, the legs are definitely the easiest to deal with. And they're the easiest to move around. Because look at this. It's so great. Come on. Night, night. All right, come on. Let's get you to your body, buddy. Ah, uh, he's mad at the bird now. Yes, you're very mad at me now. I think that's cool. I think that's very cool of you. Let's get moving. All right. Good, he's still mad at me. We're almost there. We are almost there. So close. I do not need to leave his wall circle. I feel like that's a quick way to get myself killed. <laughs> I have to deal with lasers and whatnot. Alright. This will be technically my first time fighting the... Uh, Fighting the Iron Hulk. I do know the basics, but... Again, it will be my first time. Unfortunately. I have to wait for this stupid fire to clear out. Very annoying. Dude, can the fire go away? Maybe? There we go. That is the longest fire known to man, I think. We're so close, guys. It's gonna be nighttime, though. I'm kind of tempted to wait till daytime. <laughs> no way he just hit me. What an annoying guy. Alright, you know what? We're gonna wait till daytime. We're gonna wait till daytime. This pig is gonna be annoying, but who cares? Dude, look at this thing. Look at this monstrosity. That's nuts. Uh, does the telelocator staff always take whatever you're teleporting to a discovered area of the map? 
That I do not know. I actually do not know that. Alright, guys. Let's enjoy our final day. Our final day. Before the Iron Hulk descends upon us. We'll, we'll spend our night with Alfred here. What is up, Alfred? How are you doing? Are you having a good time? Okay, you've got to be kidding me. But, you know what? Out of all the times, dude. Really? Now? Alright, we should probably head to the city then. So that these stupid bats can get dealt with in the city. Alright, let's lose them in the city. Ow. That's so annoying, dude. God. I hate the stun lock. Could not have picked a better time to do this, right? Alright, anyways, we're fine. We're fine. It's time to get to work. Okay, go away, you are annoying. It's time to get to work. We're gonna fight the Iron Hulk. Bum bum. Whatever you want to say. I'm going to equip a fresh football helmet because I don't want that stagger damage. Because when it switches your armor out automatically, it gives you the remaining percentage of the damage. And it can lead to some low health. Alright. Let's do this. Come on. Dude, pig guy, you gotta get out of my way. Like, you're, you're about to get eviscerated if you don't leave. Yeah, see what happens? See what happens. Do you see what happens to you when you decide to fight me? Really? You still want to fight me? Oh, guys, it's happening. It's here. The Iron Hulk, and uh, we're still being chased by a stupid pig. All right, um... I dropped it? What'd I drop? What'd I drop? I, I, didn't, I didn't drop anything important. I don't think. Oh. Yowzas. Yeah, we should probably go put our log suit on. <laughs> Alright. We've got our log suit on now. We're gonna go ahead and eat some blue caps to, uh... Ow, you can't outrun that, can you? Nope, I can't hit him from there. Alright, what attacks are we looking at? Is it one, two? One, two, three? It's two. It's two. Okay. Alright, looks like mine's here. What is... Whoa, holy moly. Alright, this part I just have to kind of, like, stay running. And then the last one just hits me. Oh, this is interesting. Okay, so now he's back on biting mode. So, one, two for that. That's not bad. This isn't bad. I've got some pig guards to help me out, too. <laughs> Ouch! That hurt. Oh, this is gonna hit me. I can't run away from the last one for some reason. Ooh, this is good. Stay distracted. I'm gonna heal. Oh, okay. I don't know what he was doing there, but... Okay, so that, that laser attack is interesting. Good to know. Okay, what's this? Oh, I see. That's the, uh... Dude, I can make it- I can farm. 
I can farm his own eruptions. That's cool. Ow. Ow, I wish I was better at dodging those. Okay. Um... Wow, I, I already lost a whole log suit. Jeez. I already lost a whole log suit. That's a basalt eruption. All right, we are with him now. Although he just broke himself out. All the radishes, no. All right, that's Basalt. Okay, this is cool. Uh, we... Um, we should have made more log suits. Or I should have brought more armor. Does he despawn if I leave? Like, will he despawn? That's the... Ow. 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 Hold on. Hold on, I say. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Guys, we're hurting. Okay, we need to get... Uh... <laughs> yep. That does a lot more damage than I anticipated. We're taking him into town. <laughs> why don't you... Uh... Why don't you come here, buddy? I should have gotten coffee. That would have made this fight significantly easier. Hey, pigs. Uh, you want to help with this? All right. Now we can use the road. I think that's going to help significantly. Now that we can use the road. See, like, look at this. Okay. Dude, we are hurting. <laughs> All right. He's going to do the basalt. Oh, dude, these poor pigs. <laughs> oh, man. There goes the light. The lights. I don't know how I survived that. Alright. Ow. Okay, I'm not... I'm walking into the shockwave. I don't get that. All right, those are mines. Those are easy to deal with. We can... I think there's this mechanic where the last piece of armor you put on takes more damage to its durability. That is true. And I put the log suit on last. So, that makes sense. However, we are... Oh, basalt. Ah, oh, yeah. Dude, these poor pig people. I have ruined their lives. Yowch. Oh, he's mad. No way. Dude, easy. 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 Absolutely easy. <laughs> um, so yeah, if you want to fight the Iron Hulk uh, without having any knowledge about it, like I did, just take him to Pigtown. <laughs> and there we go. That is pretty much all of the bosses of Don't Starve Hamlet. We still have the Ancient Herald, but... Don't worry, guys. It's not over yet. It's not over yet. It's not over yet. You see this? You see this right here? This is something very fun. All right. Before we end the stream, before we end the stream, we're gonna we're gonna wait until daytime real quick.
I thought it would be much harder, to be honest. I mean, we almost died there, but like... But we just had to retreat and heal up a little bit. Just kind of play play shy. Don't be like right up on him. Just kind of keep retreating every now and then and then hit him again. That wasn't that bad. And that was my first time fighting him, so. <laughs> and then, if you guys don't know, when you defeat the Iron Hulk, all of the body pieces spread out across the island again. So, we've got, let's see, it should be around this island. Like, they don't go... Yeah, here's the leg. Uh, here's the other leg. You know, you probably got the arms over here somewhere. They all spread out across the island. That is why, if you have a long-term world, and you want to farm the Iron Hulk, you should telelocate him to this island right here. Because every time you defeat him, Every time you defeat him, he will spawn all of his pieces on the same island. So it's super easy to fight him again. You thought I was going to use it against the Ancient Herald? I want to fight the Ancient Herald legit, like without the living armor. Just because, you know, I, I want to be able to show off how to fight him. And I've never fought him before, so. But that's probably going to be a stream of its own. I'll probably label it like conquering the apocalypse or something. Anyways. Are you guys ready for this? Are you guys ready for this? Swinesbury will never be the same. Oh, dude. Oh, dude. No, it's humid season, so we can't see anything. Alright, what is, what is this? Oh my, dude, I can just... Dude, I just punch him! Oh, you guys are so done. You guys are so done. You guys are so done. It's so over for Swinesbury. Dude, BFB is up. Oh, oh dude, townhouse gone. Townhouse gone. It's so over for everybody here. Now, if you wanted to s use this this thing, you know, smart, you would, dude. Louis Louise has so much health. Oh my goodness. Oliver, I'm sorry, Oliver. It was is it wasn't your fault. I'm sure Oliver was a great town guard. Alright, should we can we fight the the BFB? Can we fight the BFB with this thing? Dude, goodbye, pig city. You can also harvest things too. And actually really effectively. Like look at this. You can just Alright, let's let's take it out on the on the world now. See that gnat swarm? Get out of here. Get out of here. Get out of here, gnat swarm. Okay, they don't die, but like you get what I'm saying. And this Pang Golden? Dude, get out of here, Pang Golden. Weevil? Uh oh. Our artifacts going bye bye. Look at these charcoals. Yeah, the Swinesbury Massacre, dude. Dude, the Picos? It's so over for the Picos. We can harvest all of these stumps. Okay, this gnat swarm is actually going to get annoying, isn't it? This farmhouse? Uh-oh. 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 Wait. Uh, my robotic suit's going away. Erm, um, this is awkward. 
Oh, wait, I keep the gnat swarm? Uh-oh. I don't like that. Ah! Oh, no. <laughs> okay, it's a good thing we have nothing equipped, because then we would, uh... We would, uh, what's it called? We would be slow. But luckily, we're not slow. Alright, guys. Well, whoa, where did all this manure come from? That was fighting all of the bosses of Hamlet. We did not get the Ancient Herald done. But I promise I will fight the Ancient Herald. At some point. I'll probably do an apocalypse based stream at some point. I don't know if I'll do it on this world because I've kind of... I could do it on this world. I, I, you know, I probably will do it on this world. Dude, these gnats are going to get in my way forever, aren't they? Alright, let's slow walk all the way home. Let's, let's just shamble our way home real quick. We're tired. We did a long day of massacring. We're tired. We're, we're, we're super tired. We gotta go take a nap. In our lovely Swinesbury home. <laughs> Should have blown up my own house. Anyways. That's gonna be it for this stream. If you guys enjoyed it, make sure you leave a like. You can go watch my other videos. I've got lots of other streams of Don't Starve. I'm planning on introducing some more games as well. Be it RimWorld, uh, you know, any of the other survival games I kind of enjoy. We could also do some story games. I don't know. Anything, really. I'm okay to stream anything, as long as it's not, like, bad to stream. But that's going to be it for this episode. Make sure you guys... Why did the gnats leave? I have no clue. Normally they don't. I don't think they like they like Swinesbury. I think you actually lose them if you go in Swinesbury. Anyways, if you want to be notified every time I go live or every time I upload a video, I would suggest you join the Discord. There I'm going to tell everybody what time I'm uploading and what time I'm live. And I'm planning on building that Discord up so it's actually a good social server. But right now, it's nothing crazy. But I'm, I'm waiting for more people to join in. Anyways, that's going to be it for this one. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.